That's me. Did you hear me? Oh, I don't even know what I was talking about. <laughs> oh, what was I even? It's offline. North American Regional Finals. My name is Mark. It's offline, you fucking morons. Try reading. Hey, turn that guy's month off into a fucking lifetime off. Offline in you stupid up. fucking North bitch. Finals, Remember that guy? Gonna, try course, reading. Uh, try reading. Uh, you yeah, fucking we asshole. We've seen these guys throughout the entire year, you know, battling all, all these online tournaments. And it's going to be exciting to see who gets the win today. It's I mean, offline, you know, which is crazy. <laughs> I can't believe it is. <laughs> I wish that guy was right, but whatever. <laughs> Thank you. And of course, now here for the regional finals where we're going to crown. The North American champion. I'm excited to see. I'm I can't believe that. I didn't even know this Stacey was going Steve. on. I think where should. is this? I think we should. We got Tasty Steve waiting on stage. To Do you guys parents. know where We're on earth Steve. this is? Stage. Hello. Welcome to the. Tech <laughs> He's new here. Look at his Mama pants, man. dude. He still wears these pants. I've been making fun of these pants for like eight years. What? I can't believe this guy wears shit like this. Uh-oh, is that me? No. That's not me. Joey Fury. Where did they get a stage? Where is this? Hey, what the fuck? Is that me? Effing? It's not me. What? Yeah, no one's gonna make noise. It's not you? Okay, good. It's them? Okay, good. Next up. <laughs> Thank Please, you. It's not me, stage. it's them. Uh-oh. It's not me, right? Yeah. Excuse me. I'm getting tons of fucking Fs like crazy. <laughs> Thank you. It's not online Tekken, okay. dude. It's offline. But where is this? I'm sure someone said so, and I I didn't <laughs> see you. it. Do you Next guys know up. where this is? This One must be in Florida. No way, Can dude. I get Joe Crush to come NorCal? To okay, I could live with that. Who? W H Pizza? Gosh, there's so much lag. I can't tell if it's me. <laughs> Thank you. There's plenty of noise. And of course. It's just not people. Not to be forgotten about. Let me get this music. To the stage. God, this music makes me want to take a shit. Who's this? God, turn this off. And next up. I know you see him. I know you see him. Let me see him shadow. <laughs> Everyone's all shy. Why they gotta make these guys walk out if they're all gonna be like, oh shucks, with their hands in their pockets. If you're gonna walk out, you gotta come out and shake the ropes like the fucking and ultimate warrior. Not I mean, who the fuck wants to see these guys <laughs> walking with their hands in their pockets? You know? There we go. This guy's got something going on. Now we're talking. Here we go, look at this shit. Peace sign, we're <laughs> getting you. somewhere. Better than that schmuck with his hands like in his that. pocket. Aw, like oh, shucks. And I can tell that's a little know. better, right? We're getting somewhere. Feedy X, that's the guy who plays Noctis, isn't it? I think that guy play, plays Noctis. That guy, you know he's a bitch. <laughs> Thank you. Plus he's got his fucking socials <laughs> out. Thank Keep you. an eye on the Noctis guy. I'm, my money's on Noctis. Oh shit, but you know who that is. You know who that is? That's fucking no clutch. <laughs> That's no clutch. Ben. No clutch having ass Chang. That's him. He's got no clutch. <laughs> Is that all the players? I might have missed one. Getting ready to start. As you guys know, we are going to be playing in two different pools. Yes. We have these seven great the one and only. That's right. Formerly Korean, but currently Canadian or something, right? The North American champion. He's formerly Korean, but the real kind. We have some crazy like real, I mean, for real Korean. Usually we have four people per group here. With one player missing, we're going to have a three-man group. And only two people make it out. So, of course... 
if there's a tie situation, you gotta have some. I can't of believe they're doing this offline. So, very Good shit. You know, we'll see who goes down. I already see him setting the stage, though. <laughs> Thank Joe you. Fury gonna be one Who's of the chick on the left? Know, <laughs> the crazy thing is, he's got Max with him in that same group as well. Actually, let's go ahead and check the regional selection. It's video. such a we, uh, simple, easy <laughs> joke. Anyone, it's like a one-size-fit-all joke. Well, Who's the chick on the left? Long hair. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's good. It's easy, clean. Anyone could do it. Who's the chick on the left? Hey, Harris. <laughs> why, why not, man? Who doesn't like to laugh? Hey, Harris. <laughs> Who's that chick over there on the left? Lol. All right. Fuck it. Uh, yeah, I'll give it up. Man. That's real. Who I want to send to his group right now, but. Mm, hey, thanks, Earth Boy and Rangel hey, and Neonardo. <laughs> thanks, Enderborn Thank and Alka Stelter. Uh, thanks, Holden and Gats Ocean. <laughs> That's rip. Uh, thanks, Bally and Devin. Uh, the Dirty and Mecca Mayfly. Thanks, Oblivison and Stink Meaner. And thanks, Bastinelli. Uh, Emerald Viewer, and thanks, Dr. Philium and JCD's Nuts Jr. Thank you. And thanks, um, Johnny Tightlips and Sasso Fan, Icy Zerg and Spasticles, uh, Dan and Jesse Lee or whatever, and, and everyone else, Gumberkeles. Should we listen to this? It seems recorded. <laughs> yeah. How could these guys be here so and there? Go to Joey. Joey, you have the very first Wait, Waldo. I didn't see Cuddlecore. I'm a little bit confused, but who cares? Damn, hey, Billy Hoyle. Thanks, man. This is pre-recorded. go. So, kind of hate to do this. It has to be pre-recorded. Weren't they just inside a studio? in the same group, but I've got to do it, unfortunately. So, I'm going to send 20. Shadow 20Z over to group. All right. Uh, I don't think this is a surprise to maybe anybody that's been watching or uh, following competitive. Hey, you there. guys could just tell me what's going on. Shadow, now going into group B, <laughs> Thank you. Have to face off against Junia and some other players. Mm, uh, thanks, Fury and Rust. Joey. Appreciate you. Thanks again, Billy Hoyle. Uh, hey, no pants. Anybody uh, done done playing uh, Beat Mania, amigo? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, uh, thanks, Fruit Punch. Constant. Challenge of progression every seven. This guy has cameras on his hands while he plays beat me. Thank you. Taxing. And I think hey man, there's a different flavor for everything on Twitch. Leave that confrontation for later in the bracket. I used to follow a guy. I used to follow this guy on Twitch who used to play Dark Souls games. He used to play Dark Souls games with his feet. And he would put the camera on his feet and play Dark Souls games on an arcade stick. No joke. He used to play that shit and beat the games and shit, right? And then I later found out that this guy has no hands. Thank you. What a poser. I unfollowed him. What? That's ridiculous. That's not even that sick, dude. Because if you got no hands, your feet are your hands. Anyone with no hands could do that. I thought this guy was a regular guy with hands that learned how to play Dark Souls with his feet. Now that's impressive. No hands. This guy could probably eat breakfast with his feet, brush his teeth with his feet. The guy's a poser. Come on, man. That's not even impressive. Anyway... No pants putting the camera on his hands reminds me of that guy and his feet. Anyway, whatever. Whatever that has to do with anything. See you on Reddit. <laughs> whatever, man. The guy was a poser. End of story. I don't care what you have to say about it. See you on Reddit. See you on Reddit. These guys are still talking. Are you recorded? Um. Pre-recorded talking. Hey, Hanzo Gonzo, what gives, man? I watched Fifth Element yesterday. Thank you. You know, I I was surprised at how I didn't love it. I watched Fifth Element yesterday. I have seen it before. It is a great movie. I would have said yesterday, like, it's a guaranteed win. Hey, Puddle. My, my mother just had a heart Hey, all right, shut up, bitch. Fuck you. Thank you. Uh, I was surprised at the fact that I didn't love it. And you know, I also was surprised that Men in Black, in my 
Memory, I thought I remembered loving Men in Black. Like, this movie is one of the best. But I rewatched it and it was just solid. All right. It was all right. Same with uh, Fifth Element. I didn't feel like it was amazing. I just thought it was all right. Solid, good actors, good acting. Thank you. You know, good memories. It had nostalgia. Yeah, Nyan's liked it. In fact, I think she liked it more than I did, which is surprising, because it was my idea. I have played PDX online quite a lot. Yeah, we've both um, seen Nightcrawler. It's good. I've played Joe Crush quite a bit as well. This is a Same with really Inception. Uh, Inception was also me. like, this time I watched it, I was I like, just, wow, this third dream is layer is ridiculous. My movie taste changes after COVID? Hey, Puddle, my mother just had a heart attack. Can you please wish her the best? Fuck you, I haven't gotten COVID. <laughs> Your movie taste changes. Uh, hey, all right. Thanks very much, AC whatever. Appreciate it. And thanks, Bottom Morales and Machorka. Uh, thanks very much, Eric Zima and streaming Harry Chun Lee. Jalex, thanks. Uh, and also, a oh, this guy is this guy for real? Hey, uh, this guy's trying to tell me that his mom's sick or something. Hey, I don't fucking believe you. In fact, I think both you and your mom are a couple of bitches. What do you have to say about that? Damn, you got banned in the chat. You have to kind of prepare like get fucking banned, bitch. Anyway, no refunds. So I'll just be you know, really digging on the matchups that I'm going to encounter. <laughs> Fuck you. Um, it wasn't really uh, tough but, you know, happy new year. Or ben Chang, uh, like Junior mentioned, that guy's full of shit, dude. He subbed like three minutes ago. This is exactly so what he wants. You know that? And this is also exactly why his mom doesn't want him. Just I'm telling you the truth. This guy wants to get some kind of fucking like highlight out of me or some shit. He probably did already, didn't he? Didn't I tell him to fuck off right, well, and called his mom a that. bitch? Wish you guys the best of anyway, the listen, North dude. American your mom's not necessarily a bitch, but if you think about the fact that she's responsible for you and you're like the king of bitches, I would say she's a bitch. Just without knowing her. Thank you, Mark Man. Anyway, I'm in the middle of something. No refunds. And fuck you, all right? I'm not a fucking witch doctor. I don't give a shit. I don't want to hear about your problems. I want to hear about what dope shit's happening. I want to hear about your mom winning a jackpot in the casino. Or I want to hear about some awesome dish she made that's delicious. Or why you appreciate her. Some stupid shit that's not negative. Anyway, fuck you. Get COVID, pussy. Thank you. Uh, enjoy the new taste in movies. Three matches, right? Two out of three, actually. Thank you. Hey, thanks, Method Man. And my mom's tight hole. And thanks, Volian. And Mystic. Thanks, Rick McSick. And uh, thanks very much, Beto. And anyone I might have missed. Shit got a little rowdy a minute ago because of some asshole and his mom. A number of characters and of course he did that shit on purpose that guy's not you guys can real check it out. Ten, and his yeah, mom is perfectly perfect. healthy and exactly. looks so really attractive yeah, while she's care. making course, brussels sprouts that are uh, like blue cheese flavored well, and right? shit right now perfectly healthy he's just full of shit he's a bitch all right but i do protect your shirt i do believe we do have joey fury hey nice mom getting ready to play right now what characters are gonna choose i have no idea this shit is like listening to the radio i mean joey has had a number of characters Throughout the entire year, and I can't Shut really up. think. What does that even mean? Me or them? Yeah, I haven't been really listening. Okay. I've been yeah. yelling at people. <laughs> hey, it's <laughs> offline. That's cool. <laughs> Radio wall. Oh, yeah. Speaking of working out, I gotta give a lot of prop star friends over at yeah. Astro Gaming. Astro, of course, <laughs> Thank the official you. headset. And hey, headset. thanks, Okazumi oh, and Nido Z Revenge. Thanks, Mahehe and Moonbear, Lolly Lover and Hulk Hogan, Volian and Z Gabriel. Thanks. Do you think that that guy was an alt? Because you know if you try showing up with two alts, then the robot's going to get you. And then you'll be flagged. You're going to get flagged, dude. You don't want to do that. The robot, once you're flagged by the robot, it's over. It's out of my hands. You know, excuse me. I think the first match is... Ooh, look at this. My name is Joey Fury. I play Craig Martin. Thank you. It sucks. We're good friends. 
come from the same city. Fucking sleeping face. Ooh. Boring. Let's watch the matches, dude. Doing the group selection, like whether I should. Who gives a fuck? I've been changing my pool, but I think that's not a big deal. I mean, we both have a good chance of getting out. How confident are you? Yeah, yeah you want me to read the questions too? <laughs> hey, Cyber Monkey, what's up, man? Thanks for the dollary dues. Appreciate it. Hey, Matt1228, thanks for the tier three. Big Friday, Habibi, why not? Yeah, please read these questions. Sure thing. What? Is the sound off? Oh, Mac. My name is Mac. I mean, Bobby. Oh, you. <laughs> Z. Uh, thanks, Michelle Rodriguez and Wumpa, Mr. Chuck, Coffee. Thanks, bros. They're just saying stuff. I don't really care. I just want to watch offline matches. I'm pretty confident. Pretty much no matter what. Yeah, sleeping face. For me, at least. like anybody can win. Everyone here, anybody can beat anybody. So, I can't even hear what he's game. saying. Get Sleeves up. are too short. I love the rock. Well, right. you know, COVID and all. I don't even know what's going on. The volume was maxed out there. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck it was. Was that slow motion? Joey looking like it might be the Marduk. That's the character we've seen the most out of this past year. Don't, no don't ask me, there. dude. I don't even know. You guys see him? We lost him. It's hard to hear them because of the masks. Thanks for streaming, Pencho. Hey, man. These pictures. These pictures are both pretty funny. This is pretty tight so far. I like the laughs. Game on. Game one. Kicking it off. Tekken Online Challenge 2021 NA Finals. Look at that outfit. Uh, thanks, Jimmy the Cuck. And Marduk killed my mom. And thanks, Michelle Rodriguez and everyone else. This is a real match offline. <laughs> Thank you. He's got that new hop kick now, though. Mac finding it early here. Look at his first round. All Mac, but look out to the back. Almost had a combo. Oh, Ooh. Marduk with rage. Biggest thief in the game. Yeah. Oh, no, sir. Got it. That was a big risk there. Biggest course. thief in the, the game? Able to duck, block, and Is that true? Yeah, great start for he's, he's talking about he could How steal the whole match. Is that yeah, true? No way. What about Akuma? Akuma is the biggest thief in the game. <laughs> Can't he, like, kill two life bars and shit? Akuma, dude. And he could jump over Miz? Come on, man. No way. How's Marduk going to get away with legs like that? He can't be a thief. What the fuck is he going to get away from? He's got baby legs. Akuma can fly and shit. Teleport? Akuma's the real thief. But I'm sure Marduk is also good at it. These guys probably play each other online all the time. Non-stop. Finally, third time's a charm. Able to get the tackle, get the mount as well. Into the Oki situation. What's he gonna do? Another tackle, relentless. Do it again. You know, I've never liked you, Rick. No both up, New York? Mr. Puddle and I don't know. Puddles in chat. Hey, thanks, B Wang, B Dang, oh, Win, D Wang, yes. whatever. Thanks, Sergeant Scrubs. Thanks for using your Twitch wall. Prime here. Uh oh, nah, that's a big comeback. A little too big. A big boy. to be little too big. It's a little too big, man. With a time like that, and Marta can do shit, but, like fall on the ground. Thanks for streaming. It's hard to beat. Marduk has a low where he falls on the ground, doesn't he? That's like hard to make a comeback if they have a move like that. King could do that too. Turn 33 today. Thanks for the laughs as always, Amigo. Hey, my pleasure. Happy birthday. Python explosion. Thought about giving another power crush with the trade this time. No follow up. Happy birthday. Two throw. Good break. Thanks. Here we go. They try to find their spacing. They try to find their options in Rage. Now Mac is. Man, he's <laughs> dead. Oh, he's dead. Uh. He dropped it. Oh my God. Uh. Thanks, Master Baven and Raku. Thanks, Crystal. 
Uh, thanks. <laughs> Shrug Thank you. and well, Simbo Blian or whatever. Dude, you gotta remember that these guys are so used to playing online now. My GF created my username. Thanks, Hugh. Uh, uh, the key here, especially in the round robin seats. What does that say? You... Whatever, thanks. <laughs> uh, thanks, Thank Clutch you. the Kid, and uh, Clutch the Kid, and Roger, and thanks, Dan Gensora. <laughs> it's the N word and ban him? Damn, that guy's girlfriend's trash? Why are you guys hating? Well, I mean, time for a trade in, but the chat room don't like us. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe later. Maybe later. As we drive mm, over to the thanks, fight. Barndini and Jaeger Bombs. Okay, it's 1-0. Like nice stream. Thanks, Frank. Thanks very much. I like it, too. That's the low. <laughs> Thank you. He used to play Jack. But he dropped Jack for Duck. 26 today. I'm still a little cocksucker. Hey, thanks, DMT. I know that. Yeah. Excuse me, happy birthday. Listen, you birthday-having bitches. I only do four happy birthdays per day. All right? There's only two left. So cash in your fucking happy birthdays. Uh, and then that's the end of that. We're done for the day. You know how many fucking birthdays there are today? Not a fucking clown Spider-Man costume. <laughs> Thank you. All right? Four balloon animals per day, and that's it. <laughs> Thank you. Happy birthday. Uh, thanks, Happy Face Man and Vexy Doll. And thanks, Imper, whatever. And uh, uh, Witness History. Happy Big Friday. Removed ban? Who's that? Someone got unbanned. It was probably a accidental. People get shot because the mods can't aim. And then they don't unban. It happens. Too bad. Thank you. Belly to kick combination. Yeah, Hell's Leap makes up finally coming out from Mac now. Stays down there. You gotta mix up your OP. That Marduk outfit is so stupid. I mean, I guess it's not the worst. It's not the worst, but it just looks ridiculous. Wow. Thank you. Wow. That was rough, man. He really pushed him around. At the end there, made him really have to guess. <clears throat> I wonder what he could have done to beat all options, if anything. Uh-oh. Is that online? Thank you. Thanks for the subs, everybody. Happy big... Wow, dude. How did that reach the back roll? That was crazy. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, it didn't hurt that much, and he got out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. How's he gonna approach? He waits. Goes for the side tip attack. Good break. Good throw break this time. Back kind of tied up here. Counter hit down one. Didn't get the follow up there with the back. How's he gonna deal with it? Oh. He knows what he's doing. He's oh. Oh my God, dude. That was. They were playing like morons at the end. But then at the same time, it was semi-calculated because that 1 plus 2 he did was probably the throw break. You know? Oh, my God. Missed combos everywhere. Are these guys supposed to be pros? Is that what you call this? I've been out of the scene a while. You, got, you guys let me know. The times are different now. Is this what you call pros? No counter to the down 4 That's a good win punish. Joey just out of rage. That's also a good thing for Mac here. Got him with oh. the one, and that will one, be one. Top. Hey, that's cool. Mac Best of three. Up. Two out of three. Alright. Alright. PR Pizza. Low. Uh, thanks, Ultimate Nightmare and Squish and Blackout and Imported John and also Eric's Techniques. Just getting warmed up. 
Anyways, now we are going to a final game here. Happy Good Friday. The very first matchup of the day in Group A. Yeah, these are post-COVID pros. Uh, they were sticking with the same characters. We're going to the Hammerhead stage once again. Woof. The sidewall combos have not been good for Joey lately, at least. Where's the main man? That's the real question. I mean, Get the real the pros out. will kind of mess up for both players, depending on how you take your approach, especially at the start of the round. Let's see how it goes. 1-1. One, one. Interrupt again on the second hit. I like Joey. Joey is always challenging with the jab or something very quick. And he's still going for those throws. And Matt, you know, he's starting to duck them. And he's reacting pretty well to him overall. Counter it. Big down four two. The follow up here. You should be able to get the ball as well. That's cool. Down three plus four. What's the mix? Oh, you know what games I asked for from No Pants? I asked. Uh, I put the order in for Tenchu one and two. Wow, that does so much damage on counter hit. Uh, Tenchu one and two and Klonoa. What do you think? Never played any of those. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my goodness, okay. The relentless good picks. From Joe All right, Curry. good shit. Always putting him into mix-ups. PS1. I'm looking for PS1 games. You always got to make the right decision when you're getting up Ideally, I would like for the PS1 game to be something that would be enjoyable today. Not, oh, this was so fucking fun when I rented it when I was like eight years old. No. Today. Today. Good way to start the pressure. Damn, man, I wish that I didn't dislike Dino Crisis. I think that's like just the kind of game I would love, except it's fucking trash, dude. You know? I mean, what do you want me to do? You'd think I would love that. But it sucks ass. Dinosaurs are so dumb, dude. Dino Crisis is a, a result of the times. You know? There was a dinosaur fad at the time. You know? There was so much... Like Jurassic Park was hype. They just rode the dinosaur train. You know, Jeff Goldblum. Nightmare Creatures is a great idea, except it has Rob Zombie music in it, and I ain't trying to get banned. They're gonna ban Pokemane. <laughs> Pretty girl versus bald fat dude. I don't think I stand a chance. I'll get vaporized. So no thanks. Thank you. Try to close it out. Last pixel for Mac. He gets the block. Can he make something happen with Rage? Oh yeah. I mean, it's what Rage is for. No. No. Thanks, Tian. Thanks, Richard Nixon. And snacking on chimps. Leo, PZ, and Ultimate Nightmare and Effect. Thanks, Gex3. I looked up a couple of lists of like. What are these dance moves? Did he just dab on him? Did he just dab on him? Oh, uh, shit. Start for Joey there, but definitely I didn't know it was going to get dirty. Damn, Markman is doing the teapot. So the Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid man. He likes the bright red. Yeah. Every one of these matches counts even more. Even He's about to pour you a glass. Anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying. This is the North American regional final here for Tekken 7. And man. Right Man, now, these guys are brave as AF. We have our next these guys are like, uh, they, right now, them bringing me this entertainment and considering all things considered, this is offline. It almost feels like they're like firemen or some kind of like military, like essential work. How are they doing this for us to watch this? That's crazy. They better be getting paid double. Whatever it is, double it. That's like front line. You're like a, you know, it's hardcore. Uh, thanks, Pink Dolphin and Zan Dizzle. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna get that sorted out in just a second. Soul Reaver. Oh, I see. Okay, so just because Cuddlecore got DQ'd. Why? Uh, so that is the current thing. Damn, that's interesting. DQ. Hey, why DQ'd? She got sick. What is gonna? What's it gonna? What's it gonna take? Gasp. You want to be able to have the top two 
in terms of placements to make it out either on the winner's side or the loser side mm -hmm. into the bracket play that's going to be happening later on today. But of course, not only that, you have to think about the long term. God, you guys are so stupid. You know that? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> hanging out with you for the last 10 years surely has made me an idiot. It's over, dude. It's over for me. The shit you say, you are an idiot, dude. You are the dumbest person I know. You know that? You are the dumbest person I know. I've never met anyone who would say this stupid shit you say. You, this guy earlier told me his mom had a heart attack or some dumb shit, and I told both him and his mom to fuck off. And it's because of you. It's because of the dumb shit you say. You know that? That was you, oh, yeah. not me. Mainly, but a bunch of characters. W H Pizza. I feel like he'll use <laughs> Thank you. Plays Marduk offline. <laughs> Thank you. It's pretty hard to deal with, so I want to see if I can do better offline. Joe Crush. The two players in there, Joey Cuddle and Mac. I've been playing. Joe two Crush. Two All right, he's a king player. He's got a king shirt. So I would look forward to the run back. And Max has been my offline bracket demon for the past couple of offline tournaments. And then, of course, Joe, he's been having my number Play online, so Tenchu 3 instead. What do you guys think we should do with the inside of this guy's uh, requesting asshole? Thanks. Where's Play Tenchu 3 like instead. Like talking to a volleyball. But I've been playing in some other shirts. Uh, thanks very much, Tom Hanks. And Rip's pretty hair. Thanks, Dance a lot and Koema Kijo. Thanks, my own savior and P Roy, Pink Dolphins and Dizzle. Happy Big Friday and Happy New Year. Mm, hope everyone's feeling good. For now, I got those games I mentioned Klonoa and Tenchu 1 and 2. But I'm open to suggestions. I googled like best. Thank you. Best PS1 games, and <laughs> Thank you. the results were kind of like the obvious usual suspects, you know? I want the kind of, you know, the next tier, the ones that people have not really heard of. Because, I mean, I had a PS1, I played all that shit. There's like, in the top 50 PS1 games of all time, there's like 20 JRPGs, dude. Yeah, at the time, they were like the sickest shit, okay. But, bro... Come on, man. Why don't I just read a book? You know? How about I just read The Great Gaps before you guys, like, fucking, uh, that one dude. I forget his name. Surprise, surprise. Started in Tekken Revolution. I, you know, that's the know first that. time I've seen that. <laughs> DMCA? Can you not do that? Is it against the law to read a book to you? Whoa. That's cool. Mm. Really? No, it ain't. Come on. What do you fucking know? You're a lawyer now. If you're a lawyer, then I'm definitely a lawyer. Everyone starts somewhere. Thank you. Uh, although he hasn't been using as much Jack lately, right? It's been Dino Tom Crisis Tom, 2. I wonder if I should retry Dino Crisis 1. Uh, I didn't even beat it last time. I got to the very end, like the very end of it, and I was like, this game sucks. I remember thinking it was totally whack. Dinosaurs? Dinosaurs are dumb, dude. I mean, they're cool, I guess. But I don't know, they don't seem very cool. To the next level, and you know, mm -hmm. for a lot of people, 2005. That yeah, was dinosaurs, dude. Yeah, Thank you. Resurrection 5.0. Yep, yep. People like, uh, good old days. you know how everyone always <laughs> hates on zombies. <laughs> like, you know, it's overdone. There's a million <laughs> zombie you. shows and movies, and zombies are played out. Dinosaurs couldn't even last like over a couple of years, dude. Dinosaurs are whack. They got played out so fast. I mean, it was one good movie. Did they ever even make a good Jurassic Park after that? No, right? Just one. Every Jurassic Park has been a laughing stock. Have they ever even made a good dinosaur movie other than Jurassic Park? Or dinosaur game other than Dino Crisis? Oh, I guess there were some arcade games that were cool, but they were Jurassic Park. Oh, Turok? Why don't we just end the conversation here? Turok has always sucked, and you know it. What's a good Turok game? 
be a character that you would take to the infinite stage. But then, you know, they gave him that new screw attack. And all of a sudden... His one? I had one. one. Oh, yeah. And I knew I didn't like it. It was like... It felt outdated when it came out. But I was comparing it to Goldeneye. You know, around that era. It was a similar era, wasn't it? Earlier versions of the game... Kind of Turok is for pussies? Why? Uh, I'm listening. Why is that? <laughs> it's kind of funny. I might agree. Joe Crush is playing Geese. I thought he played King. Really doing a great job in here. He does have meter as well, so Joey's gonna have to obviously be very aware of that. Yeah, if you guys I like watching Marduk more than I like watching Geese, but it's hard not to root for Joe Crush. Just because, you know. Oh, yeah. Who? And he's going right into it. Let's see how he's gonna go. Nice break on the throw there. That is a high. Hey, thanks, City Light. And. Oh, boy. Kill this he dude. With chop and he dropped them, that round uh, thanks very much, City Light and Base Bro Man, dude. Captain Batter Blaster and Tanos, Corey the Clorox, Elbow Licker, and Nachos. Thanks, Butt Horn. Yeah, I killed him. And he does have the meter to work with it. Let's see what kind of mix-up he's going to do. He goes for the one two, one two. And look at that damage. Open stage come off and jump it. Yeah. Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, more people, people getting shot. Thanks, Panics. Like, hope you're good, big man. <laughs> hey, you. hope you're good, little man. Uh, thanks, Yurisus Clay. That's nice of you. I'm doing great. What did I have? I had chicken tacos for lunch. Two of them. Uh, I watched Fifth Element yesterday. And I was a little bit disappointed. I remember it being so good. Just like... Uh, Men in Black. It was alright. I liked it visually. There were a lot of cool looking... Damn, someone just got a fucking permaband. What is going on here? You got permanently banned, dude. Stupid bitch. You know you're causing homework for me? You're gonna stay banned. You fucking stupid asshole. Alright, you got lucky. Listen, don't fuck around. You know when you fuck around and get banned? You're giving me homework. You know that? Because you are banned, and you're gonna be like, oh, I was just kidding. It's not worth a ban. Don't you think you are being a little over the top? I don't think I deserve to get perma banned. I was just kidding, right? But if I'm gonna go and go back and fucking unban every one of these stupid bitches one at a time, you know how much fucking homework you're making for me? For your little fucking JK? Got 100 bucks on show. You know? <laughs> so fuck you, man. You can't think of yourself as an individual because you are not one. You are a bunch of assholes combined. You know? That's why people are surprised when I say, when they get banned for asking for Tekken. They think like, oh, I'm the only one on Earth who's gonna ask him to play Tekken. But you're one of a billion stupid bitches. In fact, you are the billionth. So, you can imagine, after that many requests, I'm ready to use all my action points on you. I don't even want to hear it. I don't give a fuck. I don't need details. Thank you. You know? Anyway. Happy New Year. <coughs> thanks, Coopstar. And thanks... But, you know, Panic at the Costco, Mishu Guy, and Rangdris, Sejam Malaykum, and Sage Six, and Selections, and Ursus. Thanks, Ursus, Clay, and Panics. Lamb Kebab, I love Lamb Kebab. Any kind of kebab. I mean, kebab. That's all I need to hear. I mean, not any kind. I guess you could have something weird. But you get it. 
What about great fencer Musashi? Damn, you seem like a really big fan of that game. Since you got fucking one out of the three words in the title wrong. Nice recommendation. Sounds like it's really good. Great fencer Musashi, dude? <laughs> Damn, that must have been your childhood from the sound of it. Stupid bitch. Thanks for the recommendation. It's Brave Fencer, you stupid asshole. He's still wondering. What's everyone talking about? That game was my childhood. I don't get it. Eris is weird. Eris is stoned again, lol. Stupid bitches are too dumb. This guy, I'd love to see this guy try to play Path of Exile, dude. I'd love to see you try, man. This shit would be like some kind of animal at the zoo playing with a fucking children's toy. Look how cute he is. Shut up, bitch. Thank you. Hogs of War? I never heard of it. POE Elitist. Yeah, I know. I love that shit. Don't you? It's hilarious. Good meter on his side as well. Yeah, I mean, he's close to two meters, which is going to obviously lead to a ton of damage, especially if he could get the right reads. Oh my That's God, way no more unsafe than that. <laughs> but he got Thank it. You. Joey is going to clean up here. He gets the wall. This is going to be a nasty situation. But it's not over for Joe Crush. You guys are rooting for Joe Crush, right? Joey is like the villain, dude. He's too good. That's not good. Yeah. Excuse me. A lot of people in the chat room getting timed out. Escape from Tarkov? I've never played it. I don't even know much about it other than I think it's like a looter shooter. Multiplayer. Oh, yeah, that might have been a fucked up throw break, too. Did you see that? He backdashed, Joey Fury threw him, and he was like backdashing. He ended up doing back one, two. It's possible that that was Joe Crush accidentally doing the wrong throw break, going back one, a tilde two. And that ended up being a fucking sick ass whiff punish. Like, damn, he's so good. Yeah, sure he is. It's possible that was totally an accident. Matilda. Man, I yelled at a lot of people already today. Hey, thanks for being part of today's script, guys who got yelled at and possibly banned. Good shit. I I, I enjoy uh. Letting it out, you know? It's kind of like punching a bag full of bitches. It's 1-1. One, one. Joey Fury is probably pissed. Therapeutic. Yeah, it's therapeutic. Thank you. This guy right here, dude, you're so stupid. I'll get you. 23 messages previously. Man, you are a, such you. a bitch, dude. Hey, give that guy like a million, dude. Give that guy a million. One month. <laughs> Thank you. Suspension. Thanks, Suit and Tie Live and Fan Rear. Thanks for the, the uh, five gifted subs. Hey, Joe Crush got this. Damn, this guy's got chip. That chip? When he's got, uh, oh my God, good throw break. Run, run, run for your life. Oh my God, that it worked. He, that is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. That was ridiculous. It stops the clock. Joey Fury is a lucky, cock-sucking bitch. You know that? That was, like, the only thing he could do. And this other guy let him do it. That's the only thing on Earth that could have killed him in one second. That's it. There's only one thing that could kill him in one second. And that's the super. Thank you. Jesus. Is Joey Fury gonna ride the momentum? Butt hash. Jack Miller, Fox 30 News. 
<laughs> Thank you. That was sick. See what he does. Again. Chop. Raid mode Marduk time. You don't want to mess with it. Tackle. Uh, big trouble. Mid. Try driver one or two. It doesn't sound like I would enjoy it. I mean, but die, you could but be right. The suffering on PS2? Hey, what's up, guy who doesn't listen? Uh, I'm looking for PS1 games at the moment because that's what I have set up. I'll get to PS2 at some point. Soul of the Samurai? I think I played that, didn't I? It's kind of like Resident Evil, but with ninjas. You guys see him? I lost him. Happy Big Friday, smile, smile. Can't believe RE3 lol. That yeah, that's the thing, man. All of the games on the top 50, top 100 lists are all like, yeah, everyone knows about this shit. Resident Evil, Silent Hill, Final Fantasy 7. Come on, man. I don't need Google to tell me this shit, bitch. Tell me the games that I never heard of, you stupid idiots. These guys are all posers. These guys are all fucking posers, dude. These guys who make, like, articles about the best stuff. All they do is Google it themselves. Stupid assholes. I believe so. But great stuff to Joey Free. What a battle. What about when... I'm looking for, un like, unknown shit. Like, I never played Klonoa. And I know that most people like Tenchu. But it's kind of still not, like... That means, of course, we still have... I guess it's not unheard of that I've never played it. Tobal number one? I think I've played that. Ideally, I'd like to find games that are hidden treasures. Urban Rain? I think that I've played that too. They made a remake of Medieval on Steam. Medieval 2? I didn't know there was a 2. Excuse me. Either way. I'm excited to see what this potential final match is going Blade to be. of Darkness? Between these two and, um, hey, what do you guys think of that? That doesn't sound familiar. I mean, I know they have a lot of history, but before we get there, let's take a look at the current standings. Uh, you know, it should show us that Joey Fury 3-0 in the group stages, of course, means he is moving on to the winner's side of the bracket in our top four later. But we still have to decide who's going to join him in the top four from the loser side. So I Front Mission 3, I played that when I was a kid. It was one of my favorites. Right I also played Xeno Gears. I remember liking that too. But games like that just are unplayable now, for me at least on stream. Like, dude, how the fuck am I gonna read all that shit and then comprehend it with a bunch of kindergartners jumping around, fucking around, you know? It's impossible. How am I supposed to do that? I can't do that. I would be able to play a game like that if I was sitting here by myself, chilling. But. You know, with you guys here trying to make balloon animals for you and shit, it ain't gonna happen. Yeah, those JRPGs, I'm not gonna argue with you. Those are really good JRPGs, right? All of them. All the ones you're recommending are all good. Chrono Cross, whatever the fuck you're saying. I know they're all good. But none of them are gonna work. You know? There's also other games like, for example, like Gran Turismo. Yeah, that was one of the best games ever, but I don't think that shit's gonna work. Or like, you know, shit like that. Kingsfield. I've played that. It sucks. Thank you. Parasite Eve also, you're not thinking, like, you're not thinking. Parasite Eve, if you have seen it recently, it's got a ton of fucking reading, and your character walks so slow. It's like she's running top speed, her feet are moving, but she's moving so slow. So annoying. Anyway. God Hand? That's on PS2, first of all, and I've played it before. It's alright. Look up Ninja Shadow of Darkness. Hold on, I was in the middle of looking up this other garbage. Blade of Darkness. Is that the same thing? No? 
And look at the way he's kind of spacing and rotating around here. I'm looking Try at sure something about Stay away from those bad situations. Blade right of now, Darkness. Just like that, the rage is pushing him towards a bad position. Blade of Darkness, huh? Hey, what do you guys think about this Blade of Darkness? Ape Escape is probably off the table. It seems as though most people who talk about it say it did not hold up well. Like there are, if you look up Ape Escape reviews, most of them say that this game was revolutionary but sucks. So, it's not very encouraging. Considering you guys are recommending shit like uh, Great Fencer Musashi, your recommendations are obviously very well fucking informed. You know? emotional roller coaster. I would not be able to handle that. And look at that big block here from uh, the Symphony of the Night. Come on, man. You think I never played that, dude? That's what I mean. You're like a regular fucking Google journalist. I'm looking for the secret shit that only pro PS1 users know about. Like the the secret shit. I've played Siphon Filter, Strider 2, Einhander. Damn, you guys got some good recommendations, I'll give you that, but the problem is that I'm also a world-class pro at the PS1. I'm such a PS1 expert that when I nut, I make the PS1 startup sound. So, think about that. Sure, your recommendations are good, but... Mm, I already know them, man. I was a freshman in high school around that time maybe eighth grade I don't even remember <laughs> Thank you. what year was that let's see you guys got a lot I'm trying to skim I'm looking for things I've never heard of like this one that I just looked up oh yeah ninja shadow of whatever I'm rooting for Joe Crush in case you don't know but he got caught ducking, got hit with the Jake end. It's a problem. <laughs> Final round here, game number Tomba? one. Tomba? Hey. Hey. Tomba Wild 9 is a dope spot. platformer on PS1. Wild 9? Oh, no, hey, no, what's no, Wild no, 9, chat? Finish the string. Finish him. Oh, no. I mean, what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Mild 9? Greek sensor Musaka. One of those things, unprepared for something, you gotta do it, but again, Shut up. Thanks. This guy's trying to make a joke. Overblood? Hey, what do you think about Overblood? Hold on, after this match, I'll Google the last two. Overblood and... Wow! Uh-oh, 10 seconds. It's gonna do a lot, but is it enough? Not enough. Wow! Oh, oh my 50, 50, god, dude. Are you gonna run? Are what? You gonna run? What is he doing? Damn, he just... Wow, and he taunted him at the end! Woo! Uh, okay, okay, that was pretty good. Hold on, one thing at a time. Wild 9. Yo! Masaka Kaka. <laughs> Shut up, dude. God, he's dumb. Thanks. Wild Nine. Wild Nine. I never heard of this. This is a weird fucking game. Hey, Wild Nine. I love this. What do you think? Wild nine? Go down here. This could be the final game, but Joe Crush does have the advantage. Let's see what happens. Wow, good timing right now. These outboard ones. Death Trap Dungeon. Strings are working. Man, there's so many recommendations. Death. Really, we see Max. Yeah, but that's a wild entry one there. Not this time. Ice whip one. Death Trap Dungeon. What? Joe is on another level right now. 1998. I was in the eighth grade. Wow. <laughs> too bad. This game has tits. But they look really weird. 
Death Trap Dungeon. Hey, this could be funny. I might go for Death Trap Dungeon. You guys ever heard of this game? Death Trap Dungeon? Gunner's Heaven? No, you never heard of it. It's the worst game ever? How old are you? I'm 37. How old are you, kid? Intelligence Cube? I had a demo for that. 37, don't listen to these stupid bitches. They're just in denial because they're like fucking 41, 42 year old deadbeat bitches and they can't live with the fact that I'm younger than they are. So they gotta push me up to 47 just to fucking wake up in the morning. Fuck you, bitch. Okay, the follow up here, he's gonna get some damage. It's an unskilled third hit. I'm 37. 1984. He's three of them in a row. Oh, yeah. Stay alive. Apocalypse with Bruce Willis? Is that a game? Or is that the movie with Ben Asfleck? Where they are like oil riggers that go into space. What'd you say? I'm not going to burn unnecessarily. Uh, I got Klonoa and be both Tenchus. Yeah, right now, Klonoa and both Tenchus. What's the problem, guys? Did I say it again? My bad. Hey, good shit, Joe Crush. I was rooting for him. <coughs> Armored Core on PS1? Nah. Break Time Pendejo? That sounds good. It really could have gone either way. It's so Galarian. I've looked it up before. It's kind of whatever looking. There's also another game called Trag. T R A G. It's like an anime Resident Evil that looks really shitty. I think I played it on bootleg when I was a kid. Check out Thrill Kill. Oh, yeah, of course, guys, we have Group B coming Future up, so Cop, LAPD, that sounds familiar. Future Cop, LAPD. Not even talking about our top four later. Just mm -hmm. in Group B, we, we obviously Future know the players. Future Cop, LAPD. We have Shadow, we have Junior, we have Bin Chang, and we have PDS. Exactly. Yes, X. Group. You know, Joey talked about earlier, Bin Chang. Long play, no group. commentary. You know, <laughs> Thank you. Now, that's YouTube content. No pants, you're fucking up, man. Seemed like he took kind of a break. Long play, no good. commentary so is what we know. need. So I'm really excited just to see how he does here. Yeah, and again, I hope you guys stay This looks kind of cool. All of our social platforms as well. Future Cop LA. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Ghost in the Shell on PS1 was sick. What do you guys think about this stoner? Thanks, Ghost in the Shell on PS1. <laughs> cool name. Thanks, Time Warney and Meat Wad. Dream Emulator. Uh, Epic Quest and Diablo's Dub. And Dragon Dark. Chi and Gormless Orange Name. Wild 9 on PS1. What's Wild 9? Did I look that up already? I ain't trying to play. Oh, yeah, I did. I did look that up. Hey, uh, I'm 37. Urban Chaos? Hey, No Pants, can you write all this shit down? really cool. We hit a lot of new regions that we haven't hit in the past, especially... West Africa, South Africa, mm -hmm. more, more Skull from, Monkeys, uh, the South Americas as well, uh, Pakistan and India, right? Yeah, it's it's great. And Skull of course, monkeys. we are going to be Whoa. going uh, to a break. But as we go to our break, Skull gonna, uh, give a big shout out. Whoa, to what's band. this? Uh, Patrick Bartley from the J Music Ensemble. He's going to be heard of this. treating us. Oh, it's a platformer. Yeah. So hey, no pants. Write this one down. Skull <laughs> fuckers. What's it <laughs> called? You. Skull Monkeys. Cool. Write that one down. I mean, what are you Is that guy? Oh! <laughs> it's the saxophone guy! <laughs> Thank you. It's the saxophone guy from Twitter. Survival mode in driver one was ridiculous. It's the saxophone guy from Twitter. Whoa. Cool. 
Cool. Wow, that's neat. <laughs> Thank you. He's blowing into that thing, man. Isn't that amazing? Hey, you ought to fucking put down Final Fantasy XIV for a minute and learn something good, you bum. You know? Try blowing into a fucking saxophone for a change. What the hell? Damn, musical tutorial? Hey, this is a pretty good idea. This is break time. Damn, you're right, but I don't want to miss it. This is such a good idea. They have live music. They're showing all kinds of shit for everyone. Look at this sprite right here. Look at this. And a minute ago, they showed a combo. Now they're showing some My other funny. shit. Who knows whose dad painted that? Look at that. Stuff for us to consume. I like that. Hey, you guys are pretty smart. Look at those pecs. I gotta take a piss. Hey, I should take a break. Uh, can you write that one down? Skull monkeys? Skull monkeys. It's like a platformer. It looks pretty cool. Hey, did you guys ever play this game called Scud? Is that on the PS1? I think I remember that game being kind of shitty. Scud? Is that game shitty? Tekken 3? That might be fun for five minutes. Medal of Honor? Nah. Scud is on Saturn? No, it's not. I, I, are you sure? Maybe not. Maybe it is. I don't know. Yeah. Excuse me. Dukes of Hazard Racing? Hey, let me take a break and I'll come back and we'll discuss further. Thanks for tuning in and joining me. So far, this has been fun. It's offline. Isn't that shocking? From what's considered one of the greatest soundtracks of all time, Tekken 5. Wow. Cool. That's neat. This is the guy from Twitter. Remember him? All right, I'll be back. Break time, Habibi. I'll put this here. Be cool. Oh, you. <laughs> Yoga Stan is unjust and cool. Also, Toy Story 2.
up in there, will ya? <laughs> Thank you. Too bad, man. I just stopped smoking yesterday. Oh shit, we love saxophone bound seven 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 seven. Thank you. You guys. Yo. Thank you. I mean, what are you doing, my friend? Thank you. Thank you. Yo! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Seven seven seven. <laughs> Thank you. The whistles go. <laughs> Thank you. Smile, smile. Poof, what did I miss? Nothing. Did the saxophone guy do another encore? Encore? Skull Monkeys. I'll check that out. It's a PS1 game I never heard of. 40 Winks? 40 Winks? This better not be some fucking hand tie. 40 Winks. Never heard of it. Oh, that's on Steam. 40 Winks on Steam. Whoa. <laughs> Thank you. Looks pretty cool. Kind of shitty. Uh, nah. Hey, thanks, Headphones39 and 1 million Perrys. Thanks, Pink Clouds and J Wool. Uh. 
Damn, a lot of recommendation. Listen, I'm I'm thanking here. <laughs> Thank you. Apus Gabe sleeping face. Mm, G police. Well, listen, let's let's uh damn, there's too many recommendations. Even if there's a good one, how am I supposed to <laughs> catch it? The trophy's mine. PS1 Bloodborne comes out January 31st. Yeah, sure it does. I actually started competing for like studying Tekken and like tag two. But <laughs> yeah, thank you. I did. I wasn't able to go to events, so for me it was all about accessibility. I usually like to. Play oh, like Ben Chang! Woo! When I play the some team games, then I can blame someone else. Then uh, when we lose the game, but the one on one aspect. Of it's it's too bad, man. I just stopped smoking problem. yesterday. No clutch. Woo! -hoo. Triple smile. Thanks, thorough. Crash Bash. What's Crash Bash? Is that a different game? It's a predetermined like rule set. Damn, suspicious user! Hey, what up, suspicious user? You have been restricted. That was sick. It was just a game that my brother and a friend of mine tried to get. Suspicious user coming through. We got one. No one can see what you're saying, you know. You're a suspicious user. Happy that. <laughs> Thank you. That was sick. I was, was looking for kind of experience. Thanks, Phase 94. Uh, Smiley so, Socks, Boris, Clitoris, Bloodborne on PS1, like Ono, New Maker. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, Ghost of Lord 7, <laughs> Banana Jamma, Subject <laughs> Deltoid, Lord L. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Pink Clouds and ZMH, Tekken Fan, Nine Andrew. J Wu Sock Monkey in a finals group. Shut up, bitch. We're about to get to Not V Happy man. and Roast Beefus. German year, Pup. Happy New Year, my Frozen friend. Beast. It's good to see you. Androna. That's a lot of new good Twitch effect. Prime Always users. Thanks, bros. Man. I can't wait to get to this group B play because Bomb Ship, Mellow Me. Fury, holding it down Fan, it whatever, it Cinder. Right <laughs> Thanks, Krangus. Two moms spamming L in online. bed. But it's a complete Saws and Linges and True Tube and Milwaukee really and Screwed by Sonic. Hex. Judge Phoenix, the nerves are a lot different too, Lord that's really gonna be. I Night Shot, Tomba 2. That is a lot of you, man. Can I just thank all of you right now? Not only that, you know, it's just as good. Well, Half these gonna names gonna are just fucking stupid notes, jokes. How am I gonna approach this? Two moms spamming L in anyway, bed. Thanks. Stupid you know I've never liked you. Asking us how. Hey, thanks, Amir. I'm a trap. I'm a stash. And Lollygagon, Quidjibo, and Real Riggs. Happy Big Brian Friday, there, everybody. Well, the Devil Gin is one of the favorites. You see Xavier Woods out there rocking it as well, pumping it up. So you know this good ass Tekken is what you need. 10 0.gg slash merch if you want to get your hands Martian on Martian Gothic? On one. And shout outs to Tenno for making that possible. Martian Gothic? Again, I already have four fun, games yeah, lined up. That's enough for one sitting. Maybe we should hang on to our recommendations. Mm -hmm. Four games, Martian Gothic sucks. As we get into our back, we're gonna find out what Martian Gothic sucks. From Group B, and that's gonna be coming up next. All right. Well, I will look, look at it up. the fact that this next match is gonna be a, a good old-fashioned house match because these guys. X Files is on PS2. That game's tight. I played it. I played both Scully and Mulder runs. They're different. Isn't that cool? You can see right there a pool, but you can see right there. And Ben Chang and PDX gonna be on the tail end as well as like we said before. Everybody's gonna get to play each other, and that's one of the best parts about this. Everybody gets their time to shine. There's a PS1 X Files game. What do you? What are your thoughts? Who really? Do you think is gonna be making it? What are the key matches we gotta watch out for? That Jackie Chan <laughs> game sucks. Thank you. Mm, thanks. To control the pace, 455 hat. People who will get that lead early on. Who we're thanks for gifting us up. Take that lead in those in those first few games, right? Also, you have to look at the fact that this I got enough game games for now. <laughs> uh, the four games I'm gonna try are uh, Tenchu one and two, Klonoa, and Skull Monkey. Speaking of the two brothers, we have a short interview we were able to talk to both Junior and Shadow about their upcoming match. <laughs> Thank Let's you. See what they had to say. Hey, thanks, K, K and M. Hey, man. Thanks. My name is Nathaniel Jordan, and I play a lot. Happy New Year. 
it might be a little rough for me, but you know, that's someone who knows how I play throughout my entire career at second. I just got a surprise. Wait a minute, they're showing Shadow versus Cuddlecore. Call me a bigot, but isn't that not Shadow or Cuddlecore? That's a uh, Junior, isn't it? Pretty confident people I played before, but the biggest thing to play my brother right off the bat, it's a little discouraging. And I'm just gonna play my best and see what I can do. Shadow is his first opponent? All right, nice save. You got lucky. There he is, that's Shadow. All right, you got lucky, you got lucky. I was about to get offended. I figured, uh, to my brother. Uh, probably didn't expect him to be my first net. Uh, he's also the it's funny that you can't hear anything anyone's saying because of the masks. <laughs> Everyone's a Charlie Brown adult. I know a lot about him, but I feel like he's a lot more uh, analytical. Hey, thanks again, Ketchup and M. Uh, round Robin, uh, I have some experience with that format. Doesn't it feel like a hundred years since you've seen anyone? Not too worried about that. Everyone's about to be like, um, like when you see people again, it's going to be like, uh, everyone's about to be like a celebrity. You're going to, I'm going to feel starstruck when I see everybody. Shadow says, hey man, I ain't like losing. I want to play against my bro, learning Tekken. And I talk about, you know, how Shadow is a favorite, but I also feel like Junior might be one of the most, the strongest forces that any one of these other players has out there. He is one of the main training partners as well. And I feel like if I'm if I'm in this part of the tournament, the group play, I'm looking for Shadow to be in trouble a lot of this. And I feel like that's only going to come from yeah, somebody that has Yeah, most things are the same for me, too. going to be one of those people. You can see right here, Chanel. What's on Steve's shirt? Probably a hole. <laughs> same as all, on the rest of his whole outfit. Get up in there, will ya? But these guys established themselves in the Tekken Tag 2 online world, as well as just being some of the best players out there. Same going for the brother and Saint, another. Thanks another to that one horse. horse. Who we just saw at Shadow sleep in on Rickstar. Uh, Tekken final as well. Hey, thanks, final. Tasty so Steve's know bracelets. Exactly what to expect from these guys. And the hey, I'm Bode and Jobert and Akran. The world of Tekken, and they've hey. had an amazing career ever since they started in Tekken Tag 2. It's nice to see them really grow and really be stupid joke. Game yeah, to North that's true. So I'm excited to see this, and I do want to. The worst part about that is it cost him money too. Astro, Astro has been Doesn't that make it even stupider? So, so Astro Gaming, of course, the official headset. Anyway, happy New Year. Challenge 2021, and again, like I said, I, a lot of love to the Astro family for always supporting Tekken and fighting game community. Nah, that's definitely facts <laughs> right now. Look, we've shifted to an Thanks online again. world, so we're going to need the best audio equipment possible for this fighting game stuff. Shout outs to Astro for holding us down. On it's and on. The FGC court. I These see guys that. are brothers. Here we go into the matchup, and I I was ready for this. Both kinds. But now to see it here, we got Zafina versus Eliza. This is going to be a battle. So you're going to see a lot of specific call outs. I both kinds, both matchup. kinds. And that's what I was kind of hitting at with the Junior versus Shadow matchup. You're going to have that opportunity <laughs> to see some of the bolder call-outs coming from Junior if he can get that game started. Not doing so well right now. Eliza's the back to go. Yeah, and you know, these players are Great day coming through. Each other. Damn. Damn. Gang, gang. Like players. Step aside. Three to four, even maybe many moves ahead of I like the sound of that. I love Great Day. Thanks. Right there. Shadow. Thanks, DJ Bustinut, gang, like gang. And like thanks to, to JoJo's 1DO. The game can really open up for it. You can see Shadow doing a ridiculously good job of just keeping that pace to a crawl so that he doesn't have to worry about Eliza. And Zafina, Zafina Don't is ask me, I'm not familiar. Kind of use her movements to kind of lock down her opponent. Because she has so many great options from not only her back dash, but her sidestep or sidewalk as well. And she's like really evasive. That name so reminds me of Granted, Gohan's before Ho-Hans. Right Another anime-related like name that sounds funny, so I guess I'll give it up. Right as well as Damn, the someone the got like permabanned. Really What'd you do, man? Hey, no pants don't like you. Why did that guy get banned? Why did that guy get banned, no pants? What did that guy do? Hey, no pants, what did that guy do? It's an alt? Dude, you know you're gonna get flagged for using alts. You know, ban evading gets tagged. I see you do it all the time, bro. You gotta take the point, man.
Of course, just find Go over to the main man. He probably won't perma ban you. Are you into feet too? Mm, no. I'm into them not hurting. Because I have gout. So, you know. I like it. I like it when my feet don't hurt. If that's what you're wondering. But sexually, no. I think they're unclean. This is trouble. Oh, oh, block. Tray, but takes the and up wide to take it. That was crazy. Okay, Junior, you're not out of this yet. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna shot. He's gonna have to build up some meter as well, especially if he wants to get some of that damage and that utility. That's actually pretty good against the Fina. If, if, if Shadow's gonna reach, Junior can definitely counteract. Mm -hmm. Look, oh, these okay. guys are nice. Definitely got the wall. Big damage. I think I gave them the some of my pizza and good at strong game. style. As soon as I say that, the retaliation wall they did that, no you know. Trouble. They're just walking by, happened to go past all the pizza around. Hey, what's up, amigos? What do you guys got there? Pizza? Yeah, come over, you motherfuckers. You can have as much as you want. Oh, gee, thanks, Harris. Yeah, because we all know, man, it's only those top two. So thoughtful. That we'll be going to man, what are you doing walking by here anyway? We're way out of the way. Like this format, all so the way on the side. A lot of these guys oh, you just happen to be taking a walk by around. the pizza, huh? All right. It, all right. Here now you it's all good. That's why I got extra. I got extra. I think I got Hey, How many pizzas did I get? I think I got like five extra large pizzas. Just in case of these side hoes that might be walking by. Yo, wait a minute. You know? And this is one of the things we were talking about, man. Like, Tekken is at that point. Six pizzas? That shit was tight. And I know Six we saw, pizzas. We saw interview with Shadow, but Shadow didn't even say anything pizza. about his cousin. Didn't even say anything about the Anna. There's extra characters in there, and now you see Junior switching to the gym. Yeah. We put a seatbelt on that shit. Buckle it up. Six pizzas, man? That's like bigger than Rick stuff. For almost every single situation, especially when you think about it defensively. I like the I like the gym pick for Junior mostly because I feel like you really do play with good. momentum with Eliza and with Jin you kind of slow it down to a crawl you can still pick and choose your spots mm -hmm. but you control the pace so much more counter hit four four they're doing commentary with masks on that's wild that would literally be impossible for me because when I have a mask on like my mustache is constantly fucking starting a fire against that shit so all the mustache hairs get crazy when I talk it would be impossible I wouldn't be able to do it unless I had some kind of like paintball mask or a sub-zero mask. Really predator mask. That's what I need. I need a predator mask. You know? Just that completely covers everything and does not make actual contact with my mustache. It just covers everything up. Like a predator. too bad, man. I just stopped smoking yesterday. Seen the Flintstones movie? Once again, right the back one back with back uh, back. John Goodman? I think so. I don't know. Who gives a fuck? Anyway, thanks. Yabba Dabba. And thanks, Knuckles. And Eris Doobie. Whatever. Thanks to JoJo's and DJ Bustin' Not. I gotta sneeze. These shitty jokes. They have too much dander. Shitty joke dander's finna make me sneeze, bitch. Damn, nice low parry. No way. I don't believe it. Oh, I believe it. I believe it! Oh my god, what? That was cheating. Nice comeback. That was a nice comeback. Nice combo. That was a nice comeback. Look at that. I didn't believe it. I didn't even know Junior plays uh, Jin. I thought Junior plays that hoe that throws fireballs and jumps up. But Shadow, Shadow is known as one of the fiercest and most consistent mm -hmm. competitors the last few years here in the North American circuit. Bro, in all honesty, this, he's a global threat at this point. But he plays right Jim. Now, he's losing this round and this second match. Oh, oh my God. Nice shitty combo. Oh my God. Oh, nice. The up four, two that was crazy. 
Junior one game apiece. Every game, every set we've seen here today, outside of like one set, has went down to that last game. And you, it's really, really important. That lets you know just how close and skilled these guys are. <laughs> Sleeping and face. That, they have a lot of experience Shadow. against each other. At least he's still like always falling asleep. That's good. I know, and I don't know how long this wire is. Home or at the room or at the even good. Crazy. Any ideas what I should eat for dinner? Damn, maybe pizza, dude, because I think I want pizza. So we should all just get pizza. Yo, the Jin Kazama pick yeah, pizza. Out the Claudio, and Thanks, this go, is Ron. really what I want to see. I wanted to see what character I think pizza is the way to go. His repertoire Layers. that would make his brother tacos. I had two tacos yeah. for lunch. Yeah, yeah. No, tacos and sauce. I'm making coffee. You guys want some? I'm good. Thanks. Anime is cool, you know. Let's see if it's gonna work this time. I gotta tell you something, Steve. This, this, I think, is in Junior's favor. Seems like a lot of people in the chat don't want any. I'm my guess is because you look like <laughs> you don't you. wash your That's hands. Absolutely true. But so, <laughs> no thanks. I'll get my own. Appreciate it. Anime is cool, you know. And thanks, Samurai Baker and Roman. She still has a battle right now. A 4 2. Oh, Savage Axe to follow up here. How is he going to push against this? They're about even on life. I'll, Good folks. I like how you dubbed that the Savage Axe. And now I call it, I've been calling it the Savage Axe for quite some time. Uh oh, miss. Wow. We go low. Who are you guys rooting for? I like both players. I'd like to do an ankle check. <laughs> ankle check. And between these characters, check. they're both kind of fucking whack ass right. characters, so I don't really give a fuck out as far as characters go. 20Z, Junior. Damn, seems 50 50. You're going for Shim Blade. Someone shoot that guy. <laughs> uh. Junior is the underdog. <laughs> Oh, counter hit. Yeah. Got him sleeping at the wheel. Has an opportunity. Goes to the deep before misses it. Thank you. Good block there on the down back four. Okay. Wow. All right, comeback time. That he doesn't normally have with his other characters. So Jade. Oh, nice fucking combo. That was sick. We talked about having multiple characters. Nice comeback. One of the problems with that is you got to be, you have to be ready to perform with those characters just the same. Could potentially drop rounds, important rounds, if you can't. All right, another opportunity right now. Here we go. Hey, thanks, Strider. <laughs> oh, my. Thank you. Thanks, Strider, for the tier three. See Haro and Kurti and Romanshi. Hope you guys are enjoying your Friday. I like this, though. I'm having a nice one so far. What a block right there. Didn't make anything happen from it. Good block on the starburst down to I might get well. pizza for dinner though I'm not very, very sure about it. I also don't know what movie to watch. Yesterday I watched Fifth Element and it was oh. man. Pizza's on me, boss. Damn, thanks, Cyber Nephilim. That's nice of you, man. Going up for Thanks for the pizza. This is what I, was I will about this is why turn I'm that into pizza. And then later on into poop. Like it's gonna come from Thanks. Inside the house. The call came Fifth from Element house. is really good. And in my memory, I thought it's one of the best. But when I watched it yesterday, I was pretty underwhelmed. I felt like... It's kind of like I don't know how to explain it. It just felt like uneventful. I like the acting from a lot of the characters, and visually it was pretty cool. I like the look of the bad guys, and the acting was nice. It just did not have that magic that I remember. Throw these moves out, but he's gonna have to be very wary of the forward four. And Junior set. has been locked loaded every single time. Mm, oh and my set gosh. Point called out. Final, Locked final round. And that's gonna be the set. Junior yeah, I'm, what? Oh, I thought the round count was the other way around. Junior won. I thought it was final, final round. That hugging? Come on, man. They're brothers, but... He went for the handshake. And then he was like... How could they're brothers? You know, this is not a matchup that we see live very often. They're brothers. To get to see the 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 thought, what you're going to be doing into the matchup, letting you know layers beyond what we're normally used to. Yes. Especially when we see these players play against both. But here, both kinds. You really get to see all of the homework and all the studying that they both put together into going into this competition. Well, that sets up our next match. They're already going into the stage. Thank you. Ben Chang.
going up against Phoenix. Hey, thanks, uh, thanks again, Cyber Nephilim and Jay yeah, the Anime Dawn. Yeah, that's a very important one. Hey, that's a, that's an important one, especially to me, near and dear Love. to me. Oh, yeah. But I would also like to say, Love. man, Ben Chang has been a Tekken Shut threat up, bitch. for years. He, my man has always been <coughs> Ben Chang is a deliver the hands of he's a crowd favorite steady, confident players out Ben there Chang is a cr crowd favorite what's on his Let's shirt oh it's not a hole I don't know probably yeah anime Julia or maybe Power Rangers or some shit is my guess brother, and it was a close one uh, Steve one, loves shit like that anime Yu-Gi-Oh cards Power Rangers he loves toys and shit, too. Like, if you hang out with that guy at, like, a comic convention or something, forget it. It's like uh, every five steps, he gets hype over some fucking toy. Something about Wolverine or whatever. He goes up to them, and he also, like... Talks to the, the vendors a lot about it too. Like, oh man, let me see that. Is that an original first edition? Oh man, that's tight, y'all. All right, see ya. And he just leaves. Next guy, just tire kicking. You know? So my name is Chang Bin. Kicking the tire. Oh yeah. How many miles she got on her? All right, see you later. It's hard to say. It's pretty fun actually. I at the time I was annoyed, but now that I think about it, that was pretty fun. Just watching this dude well, getting name. hype over junk. We'll and then, like, getting the dude that owns the junk the hype, events, um, thinking he's going to sell it. I tend to win against that and then guy, just but... leaving. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, anyway, good shit. Good luck selling this trash. Today. See ya. How confident that I can play on that day as well. Good times. I actually lost a lot with, with the Shadow in the online events, but... Um, I've seen Shaun of the Dead. I think it sucks. I'm not, like... That shit doesn't impress me, man. Sorry to break it to you. I think Shaun of the Dead sucks. It's like, uh... You know, whatever, man. Same with Hot Fuzz. It's even worse. Hot Fuzz is even worse than Shaun of the Dead. At least Shaun of the Dead has, like, some visual appeal. Those kind of format, I think. So, yeah, it'll be pretty Yeah, I understand you guys like it, but we gotta remember something. Between the two of us, one of us has a sophisticated sense of humor. And then there's you. A little bit more sophomoric. Easier to please. You know? You probably thought uh, something about Mary is one of the funniest movies no, ever. ever. Oh, man. Uh, ben Stiller is so funny in Something About Mary. Is so. Do you remember the part where she puts his cum in her hair? Oh, it was hilarious. I was uh, on the floor. Lamau. Yeah, all right. Good shit. Sean of the Dead. Sure, bud. That's a classic. Yeah, no, it's not. That guy sucks, and that um, movie sucks. I was sucks. looking at the draft, and I was trying to guess who would go where. My guess is Joey would put Bin Chang not in his pool, and then the rest I thought was going to be a toss-up between Cuddle. Mm, thanks, Low Tier Snoopy, so when and thanks Joey Black Clues, and and, and the Chang whole gang. Here, thanks like, again, okay, Nephilim. Now I just need him to put me. Hunt for Red so October. What the hell, <laughs> man? Would you get your dad out of here? Whose fucking dad is that? Hunt for Red October. And that was a word from both and you know our girlfriend is not like 59 years old. You know that, right? Come on, man. Who the fuck's mom would want to watch that? You gotta be old. Hey, how old is that guy? He's like, yo, I just didn't want to be by Mac and them because they you really wouldn't like so this way, Hunt for Red October Hunt for like Red October dude what kind of recommendations are these all the players here universally considering where they come from oh yeah and you guys can see Bin Chang who started a lot of his Tekken career in Korea and mm -hmm. a lot of people don't know he played in the Tekken Crash series I was gonna oh, look at the trailer the for which player does he respect uh, that one no, Matt 1228 recommended it's care. called there is nobody better who is that Why is what is that shit called I should it just to say me. And he got an exclamation point. So he yelled at Coherence, um, yeah. Ben Chang demeanor ever. I keep trying to call I, 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 it I, I, I um, comprehension. But it's coherence. Also from the Pacific Northwest. I might look at the trailer for that. 
and which players mm. does he respect? One of our very own Rip and JDCR. Nice nah. players uh, to, to respect right there. Nah. Tekken 2 is when he started. Real talk, that's when I started Tekken as well. So you get even extra points for that. I liked and, Memento. Uh, we recently like watched Memento. I have seen it, but not for a long time. Thing, I loved it. Personally, it was awesome. One character consistently, especially that's what I mean. You know, going back and watching old movies that you think you surely all love this. It's one of the best movies. Sometimes I was surprised. I was disappointed by Men in Black, Fifth Element, and Inception. Those three movies were definitely like disappointing. This this like latest watch. Let's go right into the matchup. Bin Chang versus Feedy X. This is going to be a first to two. All right. But the other ones were really good. Especially Hateful Eight. Man, Hateful Eight is such a good movie. Sam Jackson, dude. The way he sh talks shit about the guy who shot him. Oh, I don't want to spoil it. I won't spoil it. But he calls that guy a bushwhack and nut shooter. <laughs> that shit was hilarious, dude. Bushwhack and nut shooter. <laughs> that movie is so sick. Thank you. That movie is so sick. Good one. <laughs> Thank you. Jackie Brown, I've seen it. Uh, yeah, maybe. I don't know. I have to think about it. Another one that's kind of high up on the list is Fight Club. I haven't seen Fight Club in so long. Uh, and I'm not 100% sure if our girlfriend will like it, to be honest. Uh, we'll see. Death Proof? Death Proof? Isn't that that shitty-ass game that everyone ignored that came out recently? Oh, that's Death Loop. Whatever, same difference. Hey, we're rooting for... Who are we rooting for? I watched Enemy. It's cool. I watched Enemy. I liked it. <clears throat> that's the one with spiders, right? And Gyllenhaal. Yeah, No Country for Old Men is amazing. I just watched it recently. It was good. Oh, my God. The well, game with Michael man. Douglas. Just I haven't seen that in a long relax. time. I don't know if I'll like it. The game is good. Maybe I will watch the game. We watched seven. It was awesome. Nightcrawler, awesome. Hasn't been able really to have an opportunity to control. We have not yet seen the three plus four out of him. We have not yet seen him going in for any big mix-ups. Mm -hmm. Right now, PDX is controlling the spacing game. Damn, so many good recommendations. You guys definitely are good at recommending movies. That's for fucking sure. Impressive. Calm or I can move or I can do anything. I'm ready for PDX. Hey, PDX. All finishes the string. You He's got this. Right here. Oh, the Good block. Wow. All right, mix bit. up. Ah, uh, almost. He's got a long two. arm. Got to be careful. It does have that armor, but you got to be weary of the start of it. Nightcrawler. You like nocturnal animals? I doubt it, because I've never heard of it. I've seen the upgrade. It's all right. I liked it. Opportunity oh. here. He goes for the down back. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. Punish PDX committing and it got him in trouble. The wall might be his next destination. Wolf of Wall Street. Oh, I've never seen that. Oh. I've heard it's good, but I don't think I give a fuck enough about it. Wow, he almost got the full thing. Oh, the big butter knife. Oh. Oh, the blue stuff. Uh -huh. oh, wow! Now keep in mind, this is the scenario that. Oh man! So you mean you're trying to tell me that Bin Chang actually has clutch? Is that what you're saying? And then he looked at him. And you're saying that he only has no clutch online? Thank you. Wait a minute, that doesn't make any sense. What about all those clutch moments where he lost? And we called him no clutch have an ass Bin Chang. That's what I'm here for. Wait a minute. So you're saying he has clutch. I just want two clean elbows. Give me one of those. Hmm. Alright, we're going into match two and 
already him having a nickname that that pick of Hakumram, no really clutch and all the pace of the match overall. No, thanks Ben Chang know, has no clutch for, right? <laughs> like, it really does and thanks Ta Ta Wu Tang and Wired Blue thanks Prove It Cabron thanks I love that movie dude that movie is awesome Bob the Mexican is probably my favorite there are so many good characters in that movie though have you seen the professional yeah great wall carry and just big damage overall we watched tombstone it was also very good uh tombstone and then hateful eight was like a back-to-back -back western marathon two days in a row Hateful Eight is like four hours long on Netflix and so easily consumable in one sitting. I can't think of a movie that is more easily watchable than the extended version of fucking Hateful Eight. That movie's tight. Man, Bin Chang is eating. You gotta chew. Oh, Thanks for all the good recommendations. Thanks, Rose Beefus and Red Rum Gamer. Not able to find a spark here. Puts him into the situation. Guaranteed down four there. <coughs> I'm trying to skim all your recommendations. Nice. Only a true master. Uh oh. I was wondering when we were gonna see the punch carry. Bone Hawk by Quentin. Are you making shit up? Are you trying to say Bone Tomahawk? And if so, that's not by Quentin Tarantino. You should check out Bone Hawk by Quentin. <laughs> Quentin Johnson, that is. Greatest director of all time. He's my brother. Shut up, bitch. Uh, thanks, Gex. Enter the Gecko PS1. Thank you. And Little Trees. Have you watched Heat? I have, but I don't know that it's gonna be, like... The type of movie I want to watch for girlfriend season. I'm not sure. <laughs> it, action is cool, you know, but it's got to be not mindless. Because if we're going to watch something, like, I almost am tempted to watch Die Hard with a Vengeance. But I'm concerned that it might be a little bit too, like, all right, well, then next we're going to watch Shrek 2 or fucking Ratatouille or some shit, you know? So I don't want to walk into a banana peel here with the movie. I got to watch a movie that's genuinely good, and I don't want to have to accidentally end up watching some sorry-ass shit, you know? Anyway, if she asks, I've seen Ratatouille, and I love it. It's It was my childhood, all right? Play it cool. Do me that solid. Uh... <coughs> Taking the set this time around. Yeah, I love that one. So good. I've even seen it recently. Everybody gets a piece. It's too bad. Now I just stopped smoking yesterday. Get to make it to if you like going practice, crazy movies, you'll love Coherence. Yeah, I'm, it's on my list. I just said that. I think I'm I'm going to watch the trailer for it tonight with the intention of watching it. So unless that movie's trailer is fucking shitty, then I'm, I'm probably going to watch that. Or unless, Oh, yeah, Whiplash. Damn, I think I'm going to watch Whiplash. Because, you know, there's no chance in hell I'll ever watch it outside of Girlfriend Season. And a lot of these so I think Whiplash like is the way to go. Uh, but also Coherence. I'm going to check that out. Your childhood, huh? Hey, someone beat this guy. What do you got? Some, something to say about it? There will be blood is tight like no country. Is the reason why you're not believing that Ratatouille was my childhood because I was in my 20s when it came out? Is that why you're, uh, you're not believing my story? Get this guy out of here. Uh, thanks very much. I drew Drink your milkshake. And thanks, Matt1228. I'm on it. Thanks, German Suplex. Actually, let's go ahead and take a look at the settings to see where we are right now. We are through two matches so far. Right now, Whatever. Fuck you. I'm in my 30s now. I'm currently in my 30s. Bin Chang as well. So this is going to be obviously a situation where we find out who is in the overall lead amongst the group. 
every single one of these matches matter. Every single one. So. Every one of the matches definitely does matter. So not able to get to these long playouts until we get to the winner's finals section. For another few pool. months? So you got to take a look at it. Minutes? Bro, let me ask what you one more dumb? time. Who uh, thanks, Mind <laughs> Bleach. Bro. Thank you. And my, if my dad was a player, I still would respect I'm 37. With an exclamation point. I Just mean, that's not I young. Sure, I want you to but know that I'm sure come that on, it's man, only 40s. Me. That would be yeah. sick if I was yeah, still be, streaming and I was 47. I I mean, that would be sick. If 10 more I'm years? Bro, Holy years cow. Old, God knows how shitty games will be then. I would have already put a chocolate gun in my mouth by then. Playing these sorry ass games. For what we saw from Junior, just playstyle wise. And I'd like to say, over the past, what, two years? That Junior has been playing God and switched knows. to this online format, he's gotten significantly better. Oh, yeah. Significantly better. I've been watching him play in so many tournaments online and just gradually getting better and better, having better play. Ten more years of RE1. Hey, I'm in the middle of my first playthrough. Right now. Gotta say I'm proud of the bro. Thanks, Cervanti. Putting in that time. Thanks, Regil. No slight to all these other players out here, of course. Happy New Year, bros. Been, we've been watching plays since the days of Wizard. Hope everyone's World, feeling you know good. We've I'm feeling great. Up, so really nice cool and limber. I think that pizza is gonna be for dinner and, and probably a movie. Yeah, you know, good one. Thanks, Eris, a primordial serpent. Officially launched in 2019. Is that a good thing? I love, I love where we're at. You know, obviously, I wish it was a better situation globally, but we're here. We're able to Thank watch these two players play at a high level and really go. City at of God. And I think Junior, I've seen that. You know, Junior sounds is, familiar. Again, one of those players that has really started to grow more since we started shifting to the bitch. online tournament. Mm -hmm. Not only that, we've already seen he can prove it in an offline. Yeah, tournament. Ben Chang versus Junior. So these guys that have been playing week in and week out, whether it's community tournaments, these mm -hmm. online major tournaments that we have, they're gaining this experience that is, I think. Uh, I think level. that's his team jacket. So many weekly events and, oh, it's wow. like his jersey. Brian wow. Fury, all right. I said it before. Jack of all trades teases that outfit is horrid. Come on. <laughs> Train to Busan. I saw that. Uh, that movie was good. I liked it. It's probably a pretty unique zombie movie. Maybe uh, it was more unique because it was Korean, but I liked it. See how he starts out. Whoa! He was ready. He knew that hatchet kick was gonna come. I like Train to Busan more than I like that Parasite, the one that won all the Oscars. I didn't even think Parasite was all that. I also didn't even finish Squid Game. I just watched one episode of it. And I didn't like it. It felt like totally a waste of time. I wasn't even curious. Out here one round has the lead nice gets the punish there on the down but i did like series. train to boost on there was another oh, korean yeah. movie i watched that i like but i forgot what it was Haunting. wow and junior stuck on this wall i don't know i didn't blow. squid game was not worth my time it I mean, but it's cool right right that you like it an opportunity but this this could do it this is a big opportunity he's gonna get quite the distance here okay Yo, the oldest of old school mix-ups that Brian has. All right. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, yeah. I saw the devil. That's Korean. I think maybe that's one that <laughs> Thank you. Nyan's has seen. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. I watched Parasite. It was all right. I didn't love it. Too much reading. Taking with the down four one junior tightening up the play. Yeah, big opportunity here. He does have good positioning. He has meter as well. It would be wise for Junior to use it. That could have been an easy mm -hmm. EX dive kick there. Wasn't able to pull oh. the trigger. Wow, look at the spacing from Junior. Glad to hear. I'm more interested in dramas or like <laughs> thriller or sci-fi horror shit like that. I don't want just like an action movie and shit. Looking for something to close out this round. He's gonna have to watch out for Green the book. This wall pressure as well. About oh. time. Oh, still alive. Oh, Damn. The spring of what was he doing? What kind of combo was I that? I saw upgrade. It was all right. <laughs> it was ugly. That's what he's trying to say. It was ugly. The outfit and the combo. Pig with Nicolas Cage. I don't mind trying out Nicolas Cage movies, but I really think he sucks ass. I recently watched uh, The Color of Space or whatever the fuck that movie's called, and I thought it sucked. I think that guy is garbage and always has been. He's got like one or two good movies, top. Top. Like uh, Con Air, 
Conair and Lord of War. Don't even try saying face off. Don't even try saying face off. Oh, The Rock. The Rock is good too. Or whatever it's called. Rock. Con in 60 seconds is garbage. Fucking all those movies he's in is, are so bad. You, I mean, I'm telling you, go watch Face Off. Go watch Face Off right now. Go do it. And tell me that John Travolta doesn't do a better job playing both characters in that movie. Face Off is the perfect like evidence that Nicolas Cage sucks. He sucks as the good guy. He sucks as the bad guy. John Travolta can act circles around that clown. He sucks. John Travolta can act circles around that guy. End the story. And it's displayed in that movie. Go check it out right now. Check it out. Thank you. But Con Air was sick. I'll give you that. Look at this guy. Gone in 60 seconds and face of. Are goaded. Face of, huh? You see, this is the kind of guy that's gonna really love movies like Face Off. This is the kind of guy. See what I mean? You would never like a movie like Hateful Eight. You need movies like fucking Crank. Crank Part 2 on DVD. That's what this guy's all about. Battle Royale? Is that a movie? Yeah, I loved Interstellar. It was awesome. That's one of those movies that it's so good, not even Matt Damon could fucking make it shitty. Matt Damon is so good at managing to be in really good movies. I don't know how he does that. Interstellar was awesome. You thought Interstellar sucked, dude? Why don't you just say you are an idiot? In trouble, I mean he's down to his last leg. You're an idiot. To change up this that movie was tight. The robot in that movie was sick. It had great music. It was good. It was a good movie. <laughs> Thank you. Over the timing situation as well. And just like that, he gets a big wall standing one into the launch. You're an idiot then? Well, yeah, I know that. You don't have to tell me though. That's the thing. Like, why would you just go around telling people that you're an idiot? We could tell. You don't need to tell right us. Now, Ova Jr. taking the lead in this group B play. They dap it up, man. That, that's just a hard draw. Once again, I'm just saying, kidding, man. You're not an idiot. Really I just don't like you. It's really hard to try to pick out things from his game. You know, to hold against him. No offense. On, because he might not even be playing that character by the time you get the point. Exactly. And I, I mean, going into this, even in the selection group, they were talking about Enter man, the such boy. a weird fact that you're going to have to deal <laughs> with. Thank like, you. You don't even know which character he's going to bring. Mm, thanks, Avalutza. Yeah, no, and and thanks, Val, man. Strife. Thanks, Amaterasu. And Nerzek. So thanks for the Twitch Prime. That's nice of you. So it's like I said, it's <coughs> impossible Thanks. to prepare for him. You got to do research over months. You got to stake out. Matt Damon is bored to play Tars. Gonna possibly play. And then you got to train. Nah, so, almost. I mean, Chan, Someone shoot that guy. The bigger threats here in this group B play. Um, once again, now has the lead in group B play. Nice so, try, nice try. Like out Don't forget to rip the bong. Chat. Looking really strong, looking really good right now. But again, it's not over. There are still many. Hey, thanks, play. great and fencer he's Musashi. Of our stage. And, um, I gotta ask you though, <laughs> what an idiot. Thank you. Can you imagine someone recommending a game and them getting one out of the only three words in the title wrong? <laughs> Great fencer Musashi, huh? You want me to play that? Your favorite game as a kid? Nice fucking recommendation. Yes, I've seen Snatch. Come on, man. That's one of my favorite movies. Annihilation was cool. I saw that. I liked it. 
So that essentially kind of seals your fate. Mm. Unless the person <laughs> that one. has you. the lead now, the second place person, just keeps losing. So every match, like you said, is going to be pivotal. Both of these guys are on their last. Yeah, we watched Memento. I loved it. Lost the first one. So it's going to be pretty, pretty <laughs> tough you. to make it out. I mean, especially considering you have Shadow. Shadow coming from that first loss. Uh, he, excuse he, me. You would want to be recovered. You know, I've never He's liked you. Player. He's going to be able to a bring quiet back, place. It's a well six sci-fi slash horror slash thriller. I feel like I've seen that, you guys can see on the screen right but now. it's follow one of those forgettables. On Twitter and on YouTube, you could watch all of the vods, all of the slash. Our, all of our past events for checking mm -hmm. online challenges. Quiet place but sucks. For games like Ball, Thanks, Matt. Twelve twenty-eight. One at a time on now. On Police Twitter, story. Twitch, the Jackie Chan movie, dude. You want me to watch Rumble in the Bronx for girlfriend season? Regarding Tekken and the Tekken online this guy's definitely yeah, not going to be uh, in grand finals again, of keeping a girlfriend. A That's for sure. Final. We've already seen a lot of other regions wrap up their finals, and it has been what ridiculous. A noob. I love that we found Hey, it. honey, <laughs> let's watch an <laughs> old you. Jackie Chan <laughs> kung fu movie. As well, so it's been pretty good. good thinking. So I believe we are going to be going on a very mm, short break. I watched that movie again movie recently, though. Not recently, later. like two years ago. Jackie Chan's sick. I think it's break time pendejo. Thanks, Satoshi Hollow. Man, I'm so glad that Jackie Chan and Pokimane both bought Evo. It's in good <laughs> yeah, hands. Thank you. Uh, Thanks, Burger Blast. And thanks, Thrill House and Ruble and Diving Gout. Thanks, Hentai Kotze for the new Twitch Prime. Damn, a lot of you are offloading your Twitch Primes here today, huh? Did all your favorite uh, uh, pool streamers get banned or something? I love Too much this. Hell's Kitchen? <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thanks, Party Dad and Flister. And also... <laughs> thank you. Uh... Lolex, I think I'm gonna get up and take a piss, right? <laughs> Thank it's a you. good time to take a little whiz. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Luda Skid. <laughs> Thanks, Thank Smokey you. McPot and Armalord. Thanks, guys. A lot of good recommendations. It's like I'm kind of full, though. My inventory is full of recommendations for the time being. Though I appreciate them <laughs> Thank still. Thank you. Elite Squad. <laughs> Shut up. Thank you. Thanks, Dirty Mook. Hold up. And Yan the Ripper. You know what I what else we're gonna do? I should probably talk about it when we get back, but uh, maybe <laughs> tomorrow you. for dinner or something, I'm gonna buy a bunch of ingredients for nachos, and I'm gonna make nachos myself. Because when you get nachos delivered... That shit's always mad soggy. These fucking bitches are doing... Oh, completing another order nearby. Another order nearby, dude. This is a fucking matter of life and death. You got nachos in there. You know? Another order... Every second that goes by, my nachos are getting soggy. And you're completing another <laughs> order nearby? <laughs> Shit Thank drives you. me nuts. I'm just gonna make my own fucking nachos then. I'm gonna buy all the Thank ingredients... You. And I'm going to do it myself. And I think I'm going to make them with flaming hot Doritos. Mm -hmm. What do you have to say about that? Why don't you think about that shit while I take a break? And then we can discuss what ingredients I'm going to get. Mm, you know what I mean? Be cool. <laughs> Thank you.
<laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Who does Raven or Master Raven? What is the name of that company? I thought it was. I thought it was like they got hired. Wasn't by, it called just the organization or something? Yeah, like it was. That? I thought it was like the organization. I thought they were also hired by in NT Five. They weren't hired by G Corp to. It's not G Corp. It's not G Corp. Because G Corp was with Kazuya. Master Raven and Raven. I know for a fact that the first Raven that was introduced is not like the Raven. He's a Raven, and Master Raven is the leader, the boss yeah. of all the Ravens. So even the Raven that worked for. I, I thought they were just like independent, like basically they're just independent assassin contractors, right? I don't know who they were. I, c I can't say off the top of my head who they work for in the Tekken story. It was very mysterious. Yeah. I'll say that. Yeah. yeah. But I know that the Raven that was first introduced in Tekken 5 had like coon eyes, had the short hair, but, but um, Master Raven, who was introduced in Tekken 7, had the sword, was the leader of said Ravens, and absolutely cool as hell, too. I'm not comfortable answering if we don't know the name of the organization. Mm, I don't know the name of the organization either. I, it, I think it's the organization. All I heard remember is mysterious organization. They didn't do shit in the other games. They didn't. It was only Tekken 5. Who do Master Raven and Raven work for? Oh, man. The, two of the most mysterious characters in the game. Uh, I guess they work for a mysterious organization. They were reporting everything that's happening in the world. Like, the first glimpse that we saw of Raven was in Tekken 5 where he just simply reported into his comms. He was like, Keihachi Mishima is dead. And he was out. And when he walked off, remember what happened? The Jack was there to try to grab him. I just remember this. That's he true, and he disappeared. He, he, he disappeared and cut it in half and it like blew up. Yeah, I, rem I absolutely remember that. And he was upside down on that jet too. Yeah. That was sick, I just remember Second that. Second six. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I mean, he's always been an anomaly. I mean, I think, I feel like they're information brokers. This is my take. They're information brokers, and they work with the different organizations around the world, feeding information to them. Obviously, these guys are all about intel. Ninjas, man. The ninjas, bro. They're, they're all about... They're high-tech ninjas. These, these oh, are, yes. These are extra broken ninjas. Can we talk man. about not only... So, Raven. We, we knew about Raven in Tekken 5. He we was about there. Raven. But when Master Raven came in Tekken 7, seeing that just the name Master Raven made you wonder, but then you find out that Master Raven was the leader of the Raven group, right? And that the Raven that we saw before wasn't, was just a small fry. That's crazy to me. That's actually sick because this character that came in, it was a ninja, like the full blown <laughs> yeah. disappearance Thank techniques. You. And it was really, really dope. And then they bring in the leader of the Ravens who has like a sword, just actually teleports. Like that was another thing that was a difference between them. Like oh, yeah. they one literally used like smoke techniques, but one literally just teleported or made like doppelgangers. So. Raven has a special place in my heart because the first time I've experienced Raven, especially going through the story mode in the game, but also playing the game in the arcade when Tekken 5 first came out, was Raven was introduced on the Moonlit Wilderness stage. Oh my and, and God. You, and you can imagine already how epic and how iconic seeing that character in motion is for me. And I think, again, synonymous with, you know, just all the epic stuff that happened in Tekken 5. Not only, man, the intro song in that game was so cool. The intro was epic, but seeing Raven and seeing like a real ninja style character, very different from Yoshimitsu, very different, was man. so iconic at the time. I don't know who they work for. I don't know what they do, man. But man, they deal out a lot of cool shit. I'll and tell you looks, that. It looks damn cool. I can tell you that right now. Well, back in the Tekken six, I thought that um, the average level of American player was not that great. But um, 
after the Tekken 7, it, it's really, really com competitive, even compared to other countries as well. I've been playing a lot of these like online NA tournaments and some offline NA tournaments, and what I've seen is like there's just so many high level players now. Like I'm excited to see offline come back and see how they stack up against like Korean, <laughs> yeah, Pakistani, Japanese, because I really do think yeah, you can beat some of them. Thank I think you. It's pretty good now. The other, the other um, reasons they the competition is a lot more fierce. You know, everyone's super good and they play each other a lot more often. Honestly, I feel like. The level has come up during the pandemic. People just seem to be grinding more, playing more, all these online competitions. These past couple years, I feel like NA has been really stepping their game up. So a lot of new coming players and a lot of overturning players and everyone is just getting better at the game. I think NA Tekken is interesting because the top players are really, really good and the overall scene is really, really weak. I used to be really hard on myself and be like, you know, you're having this like little short term success, but look at the grand scheme of like the world stage and you guys are always really weak. Like I'm just getting by because people don't know knock this, this, you know. And it was kind of really negative self talk and I wasn't as much as it was good for I think improving, I didn't think it was good overall for like my well being, for kind of like uplifting people around me. So uh I try and keep it in the back of my head and just like there's a lot I can keep working on, but also kinda of, like appreciate <laughs> how far we've come. Thank you. Like, the steps being taken and enjoying the process more than kind of where we stack up long term and the more I engage with that kind of positivity, the better I do. So it's kind of worth it, <laughs> I think. I think we can beat everybody. Everybody. <laughs> um, we've been playing. Everyone's getting stronger here. From literally the East Coast, West Coast, South. Middle Poof. Uh, what was that cartoon? I think we can beat anybody and everybody. What the fuck was that? Did I see a cartoon? Man, I need to get a phone, dude. My phone is broken, basically. It just, like, crashed and restarted by itself. I never did that before. I need to get a new phone. Uh, what's the top of the line Samsung piece of shit they got? I think believe the next match is Shadow vs. PDX. That is going to be <laughs> yeah. some good ass. Thank you. S21 Ultra. Chicken fajita nachos and traffic Wait, featuring right. Michael that's Douglas that's and Catherine Zeta-Jones. That's the one. Lydia, Devil Jin, Kuni Mitsu with cute ass second. What? Good ass second. Thanks, Barry McCockiner. Chicken fajita nachos. I would eat that. What's the other part? Oh, I think I've seen it. I want one of those. Some people have dogs. Some people have dogs. S22 is coming out soon. I know, man. I gotta hang in there. What's soon? February? So make sure you guys get your dibs on it. Be able to check it out. Wait and see the S22. Man, this phone's a piece of shit, though. Shadow. Thanks, Cuff. Sorry if I missed you guys. Did I miss people? Yeah, a ton of them. Thanks, Mango and Groovy. Very, very yeah. Excuse me, shiny caps. To get in. Troy and boy, Sarandep. I be Raj. Gotta give a shout out to our friends. Over Thanks, Ribbon and Halavari and Dre. And Moon Mochi, Proxy, uh, Smoky McPot, and Cuff. Match is starting. Look at this outfit. How is this tournament legal, dude? Stupidest looking outfit. This is kind of what Looks like he works at the year. mall. You know, Does this guy work at amazing. fucking like pretzel really factory really or some shit? Cinnabon? You know, ago, this game sucks. Why is this guy in the fucking game, dude? This guy works at Cinnabon. He's not punishing anything. Yep. Orange <laughs> Julius, dude? <laughs> but, hey, fucking guy no, was working at Orange Julius, man. He's got no muscles, dude. He looks like he's making corn dogs. This guy sucks. Why did they put this guy in the game? Make me a damn corn dog, you fucking bum. Look at this character, dude. looking very sharp right now for PDX. Uh-huh. Dude, he's just picking, picking away at him. Jesus a Christ, kind of man. Ball, but very clutch low parry. He needed Bully. Yeah, it's been one of the hallmarks of PDX lately, right? Like, he's been losing a lot of ground, picks up a low parry, makes a little bit of a comeback, but then inevitably he loses the round because he's fallen at such, so much of a life deficit already from the beginning. But right now, with Rage, trying to make some Damn. Happen, being patient, looking for that counter hit. Uh-oh. Oh, like a book. 
He's seen it before. And he finds the wall. Perfect combo. Spear uh, Wow. Man, that got tied up real quick. Ooh, oh, punish it! Hey! I thought he wasn't going to punish it. I like it, though. He was able to take that. Put the brakes on on the wall, sending one as well. All right. We're rooting for FDX. Because he works at Hot Dog on a Stick. And times are tough. Not too much damage. Oh, I went for a low crush. Oh, Ouch. That down Perfect. One, especially coupled with, you know, the down forward one four getting that wall splat at the What do you mean someone is lagging? This is offline, Pendejo. Here come the two two. Boy, someone's really lagging it up. Such a good tool. Just keep your opponent locked out. I mean, but if you have the patience of like a player like Shadow, is it really that much of a threat, right? It's not much of a threat, but you know, if you have the light speed and you're locking him down, then it becomes much more of a factor. Yeah, and I think uh -oh. there's a big opportunity to get to punish. Not too bad. Yeah, this so character is that. a slimy, oh, trifling oh, hoe, dude. Could be good for All those here. lows that leave you in uh -huh. stance and you have to guess again is so of obnoxious. Goes for the drive. Now, kind of spent it. Corn dog. Oh. oh. What's he gonna do? What's the mix? Do you Go see what I mean, dude? Here. Three lows in a row, man. Three lows in a row. And Shadow able to steal her way through. Yeah. Taking that very first game. This is your fate. Yeah. Very, very important game, of course, as we mentioned earlier. I love Shadow corn dogs. Opening matchup against Junior. Mm -hmm. That was all oh, lag, I know. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Taking you know, advantage I, of the I, lag. I don't know. It's, yeah. hard to, it's hard to tell. We don't know what goes on mm -hmm. in, the, in the home when they're playing and they're practicing. Right. Because that gym pick looked like such a confident gym pick. It was curious because you know I've seen him pick the gym more and more lately, June yeah. at least. So it's definitely something he's been working on incorporating. Into Thanks, the uh, so nice get a win mustache, a Mark Julio. Oh, yeah. You can't even see it, man. They're wearing masks. Nice shitty you know, joke. Clap like minus four twenty. There's no whiff punching, and that's one of the big things about him. You'll hey. see him whiff punching down for choose online. I hate to break to you, the PDX that we're used to seeing is online. I I almost get that. <laughs> So this, this is an outfit is I'm sure he can do well. offensive. Thank you. That is that an movement. offensive outfit for an offensive of character. Movement and whip punish. Right. At least this time, just leave jabs on the whip punish there. So at least that's something. Yeah. I mean, it's a tall order. I mean, when you're talking about movement, I'm still rooting for him one though. One of the best movement characters in the game is oh, Athena. Sure. This I've watched him play before. He's good though. I don't know Athena, how good he is she, against she, she's Athena. On but PDX is good. You wouldn't expect him to be good because of the character choice. You'd think like nobody in their right mind would, who is, their mind is right enough to be good, would pick this character. You would think. Wow, he caught her. But seems like he's pretty good to me. He's got to be careful because you know they're whipping nonstop. Yeah. With very evasive nature. Oh, look at that. And that's the thing is once you start feeling comfortable. That counter hit one plus two will come out. And Shadow really, over the course of the year, has really mastered the use of that move. It's something that we didn't Damn. Used to see way back in the day. Why did that work? Hey, you guys think they're playing on PC? Yeah, right? I think they're playing on PC. Down forward one, two, one, closing it out. And the follow up. Yeah, this stage is very strong round and performance here from Shadow. Not skipping a beat here, able to take it. The music's good and the stage is good. I wish more stages were like this. Nice. More ground break, more Still wall break hit, stages. Still keeping that position. It's exciting. Oh, the second hit, able to land in the ball. I like the excitement. Back yeah, you can tell the Phoenix, he's hesitating on the first because he's blocking. So, of course, when he swings in, it's too late for the second hit. Oh, and looking at the timing here. Good steps here. Shadow in Tekken 6, there were stages around. where I love the this. middle of the stage <laughs> would floor break, <laughs> but the walls <laughs> wouldn't. I thought that was a really cool idea. Why the fuck did they take that away? The middle of the stage was breakable, but the wall, there was like a cemetery stage. And then there was also a stage, it was like the, it was like some space stage where there was a glass floor and that would break. That was really cool, man. Why'd they take that out? You mean like, it doesn't even make sense to me. Strategically, that's cool. It's cool in a lot of ways. Think about wall carries not allowing a floor break, but the middle of the stage being breakable. Yeah, Fallen Colony, I think that's the space one. 
with flying I feel like jets and shit. I think the down two <laughs> is something that Shadow Game is looking out for. He'll, he'll jab it, he'll whoop it. Thanks for the sub. He did the whoop up oh, it's over. Oh, my God, you're going to be good. Take him out, and that's it. Shadow thanks, nice hair, Re Par, Par Blue. And now. thanks, and, you know, we're just uh, the Darren and Payway. Thanks, Spoon of Thunder, for the bits. Which is and Tavern to God. Okay. So now he has two losses in the group stage, mm -hmm. which is very, very unfortunate. Two losses. And Shadow, with that win, of course, gives him an opportunity. Damn, they're all distancing. <laughs> Not an easy feat. <laughs> Thank I think you. Right now we have Pinchank probably going to make it out. Thanks, Spoon of Thunder. Yep. Uh, we know Shadow Thanks for the sub, Junior's too. One -one. Yep. Uh, and it looks like Junior's coming up next to go up against PDX. Uh, so if he loses here, <laughs> Thank hey, you. thanks, Ant Sweat Pants. Yeah, very, thanks very for using your Twitch Prime on my stream. This, uh, this could Amigo. be one that, that decides it all. So anyway, that's nice of you. Thank you. So thanks, Bat Guano. could be playing the role of spoiler. Mierda. Hard boiled is good movie. Where all you can do is. I think I watched that. And yeah, I think I watched it. You want to go out it's like, by the same yourself. director yeah, so as like, Drag Through Concrete, isn't it? Or am I thinking of a different movie? So this is huge. I mean, you, you think <laughs> of yeah, Rip is tall. He's, he's like six win, foot. That puts him in a better position. And five maybe or six out. six. However, I don't know. He's Junior tall. Gets, then he will be the one getting out because he has the win over Shadow. Yeah, tiebreakers are confusing. Yeah, I'm six three. I don't know. He's tall. I'm just gonna stand here and be like, he's six three. Crazy. Are you that's sure? He right seems taller than that. Right? That's what we're gonna do when it gets yeah. to it. Put it on the screen. Maybe you're right. <laughs> he's six two. Yeah, he's getting, getting shorter. Can I get Jeff. taller? The North American Regional Finals for the Tekken Online Challenge uh, 2021. Of course, this is 2022 now, but this is of course. I'm five ten. That we have. It's been amazing. You know, we've done this in 15 different regions around yep. the world, hitting new places. We did South Africa. We did West Africa. Of course, went to Pakistan and India for more events as well. Uh, some name stays like Korea, Japan, Philippines. He's six six really on nice Grinder. <laughs> Obviously, everyone's still playing. The game. Yeah, it's, it's been really a lot of fun. Ah, I'll really give it up. Europe as well, South America. There's just been representation <laughs> from literally all sides of the planet. I feel like, and it's just been a great time for all <laughs> fans. You know, even mm -hmm. though we haven't had the offline events. Hey, the thanks, Joseph T. And Maggot Scum. You know, aside from the thanks, fart filled balloon animals. I think this is the most and bad guano podcast being able to really talk about the game. Show their passion and really uh, help communicate what's happening to you guys that are watching at home. Uh, how much we love Tekken and how much you guys can enjoy Tekken. So again, thanks to everyone that's been part of all of the production throughout the entire. Woo! Year. I mean, Mark, I mean, man, and Rip. Woo! I know this is the last one, Mark, but I'm like, what? don't cry. It's too early. Let's wait till at least the top four. What? There's no crying in Tekken. Sure, we'll Except wait. Except for the Heihachi we'll guy, wait. but then he died in the story, so it doesn't matter. You notice how glazed There's these eyes that, look? Uh, Raven Corporation. Anyone else <laughs> notice <laughs> that? <laughs> Corporation, you Keep in mind, this <laughs> event <laughs> is in Thank NorCal. You. Did it? I'm not gonna look it up. Let's ask mm -hmm. and Michael. Let's ask those guys. Uh, but you think it has? Just been. making an observation. Misremembering that? Don't make me think about it. All right. I want to focus you on the it. next match. No the next problem. Match little observation. X versus Junior. Uh, thanks, Nero, Xan, or whatever. That we were talking about. Mm -hmm. Let's see how this can play out. Let's go ahead and actually look at the standings to to see where we are, what the what the possibilities are. Sure. Let's see what we got on the screen, as you guys can see, and kind of follow along at home where we're at and how we got here. Yeah, I mean, if you just look back at even Damn it, man, I wish I didn't laugh at that. When he got Some no dude was just like, that chick on the left is pretty hot. <laughs> Damn it. I should not laugh at that. Shit's fucking clean, though, man. But so far here in Group B, she a cutie. That basically guarantees them spot out. PDX rough day so far, 0-2. <laughs> Probably not going to make it out here. But with the win here, oh, yeah. that means Junior goes 1-2. and two. Shadow has one game left. If he loses that one, he's got one. Kyle drink a water. One, two. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the, the world. If you look at it, everyone's going to have the same 1-2 and two record. Then we have to go to the game by game to see who actually won overall. But and again, we're not going to be able to find that out until the very end. Right, so... In this format, if you're a player, you just got to win every single These game. These pictures are pretty game, close up. To, so Junior, of course, representing Chicago, the mid best. Mm -hmm. Started off in Tekken Tag. Which again, players Tekken do Tag you respect? That we all played, right? Chanel. Before yeah. Tekken 7. So For it's sure. great to see, again, the generational <laughs> gap. Thank you. How these players have come into the game. Hey, thanks, Maggot Scum. Thanks for gifting a sub. The, the generation or the, the, the lifetime of the game. Hope you guys are all feeling good. PDX here. I mean, 
I got to root for the guy. You know. <laughs> is that one of VDX's emotes? <laughs> I actually went up to him and I was like, I was like yo, man. Is that an emo? You got my name on his screen. <laughs> <laughs> you make me look bad. You make me look bad. It's, it's, not, it's not me. It's the JDTR part of that, for sure. That's where the losses are coming from. There you go. Uh, but yes, BDX. Well, yeah, he's got knocked right his hair. It's time. Game he's probably game. RPing, like, dude. Instead of using the JDCR movement, you need to start using the rip movement. Go yeah. crazy. Of course you're going to get knocked his <laughs> hair. The full forward. experience. Dash with your face. Thanks, Luke Flywalker. Damn, Katarina coming out from Junior. I was waiting to see this. I thought this might have been one of the other characters. Because we've seen him use, other than Jin. Mm -hmm. Katarina and find success with Katarina in the past not using Eliza. God. That was the other go-to character that we were used to seeing. Yes, yeah, the third character for Junior here. Or is Julius. Mierda! has used the most characters so far. Thanks, nice eyes, yeah, so Shadow right. 20 Z. Damn, right sounds like he's got a fan club. Katarina, one of those wow. very, very annoying characters, but also very much like Jin were has the power and strength of counter hit in all carry. <laughs> Thank you. Oh yeah, you gotta be really careful where you're hitting your buttons against Katarina for sure. Damn Harry aggressive. Katarina. Well, so many good options for Katarina. Man, get oh. locked down. No. Why does she have a Harrier? That's crazy. I don't know. <laughs> she is, uh, she's definitely no got duck. Do Harriers have bazookas? No punish. I mean, they have some type of artillery and, and I think <laughs> they're uh, lick based on Thank you. Uh. Gotcha. Hey, thanks Junior. Eric Williams Art. And thanks, Dixon B. Continuing here. Whatever. Dixon B. Whatever. Thanks. Again, every single one of these players has been able to win tournaments. Uh, whether it's dojo events throughout the entire season, they've been all Man, able to win tournaments. Man, it must be so hard doing commentary with a mask on. The whistles go whoo! Man, Great right stream, now, smile, smile. Wall, thanks. So. Thanks, Noctis yeah. Wears, Dr. Shoals. I mean, he's standing up all day, taking orders at Orange Julius. He needs the arch support. You know, standing up all day at the food court. He's got two jobs, man. One more match and pools in his top four. What's your uh, estimation on how much longer this shit's about to take? Probably a couple hours, right? Looking to fight back now. Nice now for my guess. Just in time for big dinner. I'm gonna ha I'm gonna get pizza. Oh, today. There it is. There's the PDX I'm used to seeing. Alright, he gets the wall here. He goes for the evil man follow up. Let's see what he does. One four and five to two. Goal. Nice. I didn't even know this shit existed. Good call, no pants. White sauce? I think I'm gonna get red sauce with pesto drizz. I'm gonna drizzle some pesto on top. But great stuff. No Dude, meat though. Man, I really want pepperonis uh, badly. Fashion with that but I'm not gonna. Yeah, Sucks ass. Man, is it time for to switch characters? Is he considering? No, just you mean just using another other outfit? stuff. <laughs> another different outfit? He's already used two outfits. I, I saw. He we pulled out more. the funny hat. He pulled out the, the funny hat. The one with the helicopter thing on yeah. it. When's the last time you had a hash brown? What do you mean a uh, hash brown? Right, this is gonna be tough. Do you mean hash browns? Or are you talking about that weird ass square thing okay. they give you at McDonald's? His main. Yeah, his main. Let's see how it works out for him. Yeah, that uh, backpack down for you. That was I don't remember. From him a lot. And we have not seen a lot of that at all today. So that was the first one that looked clean like the PDX we're used to seeing in tournaments. Let's see if he can put something together here. But Junior starting off with a low counter hit. Very low now as well. Man, oh this boy. guy is kicking oh the boy. shit out of our hero. Come on, man. Oh, there you go. See, that's one thing that has been missing so far. Is his ability to not only get the counter hit. Sometimes what you do is you use the movement to kind of create the space. Orange Julius is just like Bang, right? Orange Bang. You guys know about Bang? It's like a Mexican orange creamy juice drink. See what happens here. Yeah, it's been a really dominant performance from Junior. What does Katarina know less? It's like creamy, yeah. It's not soda though. It's like Not Tang, dumb fuck. Tang is like Kool-Aid but orange, and it's got monkeys on it. Uh, I'm talking about Bang. It's like a frothy kind of like cream Mexican thing, creamy Mexican drink. 
It's right next to the Horacha. What are you fucking? We never even had any kind of Mexican food. It's right next to the Horacha and the other thing. The purple one. I forgot what that's called. I will fr Yeah, Hamaika. Exactly, dude. It's right next to the Hamaika and the Horacha. Either way, I know it's a long play. I mean, that. there's so much that can happen information wise within the course of a round. It Shit's can really good. change after one round or one sequence. It's called Orange Bang. <laughs> can you believe the nerve of this yellow named asshole right here? He tagged me and he said it's called Orange Bang. I said exactly that. Can you believe this fucking guy said that shit to me, dude? Out of void in the puddle. Open your fucking ears, fat so. It's called Orange Bang. Get it straight. I mean, I was correcting other people 10 seconds ago, telling them it's called Orange Bang. He's got plenty of time, and he did not fuck it up. Let me show you my collection of weapons. All of them. The Royal Armament. You know, Harada apologized to me when they unveiled Noctis. Said that. Said, I'm sorry, Aaron. I did not accept. Do not accept your apology. It's true. Boom. And I wonder what game they're making right now. I mean, think about it. Michael Murray and Harada go to work every day, right? They go to work every day. They do something there the whole fucking time. What are they doing? What the hell are you doing at work every day? Working from home? Damn, what do you think? They're playing Final Fantasy XIV all day long? Farming for cum just like the rest of us? Jesus. I mean, I mean, Bin Chang might use them. You never know. He's, he's been known to use them. Still in the tournament, looking good so far in this group. Bummer. But we're going to final game here. In this set, at least. Junior for Speedy X. Forgotten Realm. Bro, that is the Thanks, pick. Thanks, Ben. Third clutch, have an ass chain. And Noctis wears Dr. Scholl's. Break floor. Yeah. Happy Big Friday, everybody. Floor break, eh? This is probably one of the cooler stages. Have the coolest combo. Downstairs. Damn, that's a good move in this stage. Damn. Punish that. Oh my god. How did all that shit whiff? That was crazy. How did all that shit whiff? One per round, you want to spread it out? You want to have consistency, make sure it's a whole good season? Yeah. Alright, nice. Good punish. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, uh -oh. He is Wall dead. bounce. He's dead. Wait. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I thought he messed up for a second. Dead. Spend the rage art. You this. You can. Give this Go long no con. Any Yoshi players? Out of I wish. Order. The stairs are out of order. Yoshi players are usually fun to watch, but the downside is they never win. With the round. Dude, that was a lot of but they're still fun to watch. Mm -hmm. round. We spent 20 hours setting up the set and you guys broke it up. Yeah, the first Yoshi round. is hype, but they just never win. So you never see Very too much of them. You only get like a little glimpse of Yoshi. You never Again, see too much. With the light lead. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, finally, it was able to break them. Hair all day. Uh, cool demons. Yeah, basically. Thanks, DB Blues. Pick up the 3 3. It's a math battle. Counter hit. That was interesting to use the forward forward one plus two right up his face with it. Yeah. And again, he's been using that forward forward one plus two. He likes to keep him there at the wall, likes to be able to do the second game afterwards. Ow! the second hit, wasn't ready for it. All right. Here we go, round one round apiece. Yeah, it's tied up! Game, right? PDX anyway, is staying like in there. He got tired of me yeah, making yeah, fun of his part-time job PDX. in the food court. Still fighting for contention, you know, there is that very chance we could have a three-way tie and I'll have to go down to the game yeah. differential. But how are we going to get there? Who knows? Yeah, the shoes are so stupid, dude. Those are like Skechers. You gotta mix it in there. It's such a great tool from Noctis in general. It's the ass. I would check it too, because you gotta remember, it's one of those things where 
It can't be low period. It's a different usage tool. There we go. This is big. He has the wall. Yeah. Close it out here. Thank you. Oh. Ooh. That wasn't part of my 50 All right. One round away. point for PDX. Can he do it? Fighting all the way back here. I thought it was really in favor of Junior at the outset. The way it started. BDX is turning things around. Low and spear. the spear, bro. The spears are working. Uh huh. This is looking like Damn. Storm will be counted. He's in charge right, right now. Assistant store manager. You, Assistant? Oh here. my god. Oh, nice drop. Oh, wow, nice whiff punish. He was probably scared of the second hit. Oh my god, dude. The no, sidewall no, saves no, lives. No, Holy no, shit. No, Holy shit. No, mix no, up no, and no, what no, the? No, what no, the? No, the camera? Hello? What in the fuck was that? The leg? I've never seen that either. The camera went fucking ape wire. What the hell was that? And then fuck with man. Come on. Now he's got to make this. Oh my god. God, dude, that was brutal. What the hell was that, dude? The camera got crazy. Was that sequence that they pulled off? But that was crazy. What the fuck, dude? That was indeed insane. Gotta give it up. I'm hungry. Amazing performance. I can't even focus on something so absurd for more than ten seconds without thinking about pizza. I'm hungry. Next game, some pizza. Falling apart, but, uh, you know, thanks, Busta Tunes and Snake the Edge the on Spotify. Again, thanks, Blarvel and DB Blues. Thanks, yeah. bros. Very big W as well, because again, we're looking at how we got here. And again, that was fucking weird. It's, it's just been nuts. Mm -hmm. Everybody's Can uh, you going eat each on the stream? So yeah, it's not against the rules if that's what you're asking, but I usually don't. I've done it before. I just don't usually eat on the stream because I'm I'm in a I don't eat in here. Usually, I eat in like a dining room. Whoa, a dining room. Yeah. Excuse me. is always a question mark. Always a question mark. Leroy. Yeah, hey Hachi, Brian, um, Devil Jin. Yeah, could be all those. Things. You might use Anna too. I don't know. But listen, Before the pandemic, I wanted to start going out to restaurants but look at that. and at the taking you guys here, with me. One match to play. Same thing with Shadow. Like you know, but to sit at the it. table and uh, eat food and order it and shit. But then they had a pandemic, and I never went to another restaurant again. I just realized, yeah, if Shadow wins here, then it's a three-way, two-one tie. What happens there? We let the mathematicians figure it well, out. Well, they'll right? figure it out. Yeah, they'll <laughs> definitely figure it out. But in my head, that's it's gonna be Shadow and Junior if he wins. Oh my gosh! I think you might be. Wait, really? I, I think so. Isn't that how we're? I don't know. We'll let them figure it out. Either <laughs> way, know. we have a tight race. I don't know. We have Take a tight us to race. your dining room. I mean, that tight race. is in very cool. Nah. You guys can see Shadow representing the Midwest. Man, out of I'm Riverdale. hungry. What are the players he respects? Saint. We, we were just talking about. Oh, yeah. Saint. Which player do you the, respect? He, he picks Saint. Ah, and then I Saint. believe brother Junior picked Chanel. Mm -hmm. And that was an old King of Iron Fist tournament finals match from yeah, way back to the day. City represented yeah. Yeah. Riverdale. Yeah. Global finals even back then. Riverdale. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sounds Steven made up. Kuma voice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was good times. <laughs> it was good times. Man, I got to find that video. And then Vin mm -hmm. Chang, of course, the respecter of none. None. Damn, which so players do you respect? respect none. That's no clutch, Don't Bin you, Chang. You have to, you're talking you have to, to you right know, he's there. He's going into every one of these matches, picking. And I mean, if he didn't, he would just use one character. Oh, cool. His respects. favorite character is Brian. Yeah. What is his second six characters? His second six characters were Bob and Lars, I think. Yeah, that's not Brian. <laughs> but again, those were <laughs> yeah, very Bob and good Lars. characters. He's he's one of those players that can adapt and use those very good characters. I suppose so. Started back in Tekken Five. You know, we were looking at the uh, the games that were started, and myself, Joey, and Bin Chang are all Tekken Five competitors. I'm like, we're, none of us are the same age at all. Uh, well, that's ridiculous. the beauty of this game is and Tekken Five because it was an arcade title, right? Way yes. back in the day, it, it it and even culturally, like uh -huh. everybody. When Maybe they I should drink some water. I feel like I I need a snack. I'm game. gonna get a snack on the I next break. Back in the arcades, I'm withering away here. Levels of people playing the game, and that's, that's the beauty true. of the arcades because anyone can uh -oh. go there and compete. What that guy do? Back in those days, Tekken Five days. 
there was like a new generation of young players coming through. Yeah, like, like who is this Why did you ban that, that guy? You know, he's like 17. Did you miss? I was like, well, who is this guy? God, Java so Stout, you are a bitch. <laughs> Dude, they don't kick people out after 10? I guess not. Uh, anyway. <laughs> yeah, my parents. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. Are you, are you still going to get that made up <laughs> cyber truck? <laughs> yeah. and it was They're never going to come out with that made up cyber truck. I don't think it's made up. These are two of the best players in America battling it out here in pool stages. Publicity stunt. Not even the finals. Yeah, it's. It's unclear who even can make it out of this group at this point. So, probably thanks, one Alex. Of them. Two dicks. Can it be both of them? I'm, I'm, we're gonna let the the guys <laughs> that are working on the the abacus and the the, the calculators in yeah. the back. I the mean, new Z06 is sick. He's a tank. The winner. I don't know. I waited you know, so long for it to come, know, come, it come it out, and now I kind of think it's May. I don't know what happened. Bro, it's also so unpractical. I wish they would make a SRT8 Hellcat version of the Chrysler 300C. That would be sick. But they don't have that in North America. Who makes it out? Oh, man. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be good. Uh, characters? Are we gonna that would be Hachi? awesome. Yeah, they uh, used to, but not, they don't anymore. Not, wait, no, you're, come on, guys. You, man, come on. You have ruined too many finals like that. <laughs> oh, ruined? I made it amazing. It was really bad Either that or if they made a wagon. I like wagons. It was great for I want a wagon. It was great for but the only cool wagons, wagons they make <laughs> these days are all European engineered. All nah. Right. All right. Like, um... Shadow yeah, E63 AMG or the Audi wagons. Know, they have a few. I think if Vin Chang but goes into this, I'd like nah. to... Nah. <clears throat> They made a Dodge like Magnum a SRT8. Yeah, they did, but 2005 called. I'm not trying to buy an old so? ass um, ancient I mean, V8. A question. I think. I think <coughs> choice really depends on yeah, Shadow. Thank you. So he's probably making a bet based on that, right? Yeah. Uh, if Shadow goes, there just aren't that many cool <laughs> American yeah, cars right you. now, especially not four I doors. I There's know. cool two Maybe doors, but I don't know. Regardless, I think that if he picks the Vina, yeah. I don't think we see Heihachi here. They don't make Cadillac I, I, CTS I, I, wagons but, anymore. You have to get the 2015, 2016 ones. If it's the Fina, I think we get Brian. I think. It's his favorite character. And they're expensive yeah, and rare I don't and know, high mileage. Or, or but I do I love those movie. cars, though. I'm seeing uh, CTSV out. wagon, that is a Richard, nice ride. <laughs> Unfortunately, they're, they're there's still the, not the, much the that's going to beat a Hellcat. Yeah, I mean, well, nobody uh, even down, tries down to see it. fucking with Hellcats. It's interesting. Very. It, it's, it's Will you really ever good. play Tekken again? Wait, Hopefully it, not. It, if you're wondering why I don't play Tekken, Tekken it's so that people like you don't come there, around like, here. Do it. Will you do it? Will you do I'm it? really <laughs> trying my best to avoid <laughs> having fans who ask me dumb shit like that. You know what I mean? Anyway, say hi to the main man for me. Tell him I said hello. Do I need to pull up my tools? Should I fix it? It's been a while. Yeah, I've been all into the arcade stick discussion on, on, on social media lately. Yeah, there's been some interesting stuff out there lately. Very interesting. Very got, interesting. Um, new covers for your body parts on new arcade sticks. That sounds weird the way you said there's new <laughs> <laughs> there's new covers for your body parts. Excuse me? Thank you. Oh, okay, that's what you were talking yeah. about. I'm like, man, the way you worded it sounded crazy. <laughs> hmm. I was like, man, for me, they, they make my size? <laughs> Cadillac CT5 V Blackwing. Yeah, I saw that. Don't you think it's a little bit grandpa looking though? Look at this. I I watched a review on that car. It looks like a grandpa's car. I don't. I thought CTSVs looked cooler. Bet your channel points, folks. It's not gonna last long. I think it's a grandpa's car for me. I mean, if you think it's beautiful, that's fine. I'm not saying you're not a grandpa. I'm just saying it's for grandpas. Look at Brian's outfit, dude. These outfits are fucking zero out of ten. Glaciating mustache outfit. Yeah, I'd say historically, Shadow has the edge over Bin Chang. Just by a little bit. I, I think I would say more recently as well, because Bin Chang early on was beating. No him, drip. Right? right. Especially at the start of the pandemic. But then Agreed. I feel like he kind of took a break, second half of the year maybe. Either uh, that no or it was all according to plan. Yeah, waiting for this day. This? Waiting for this day. 
My no, sister no. bought a Ford Focus oh, RS. That's Where cool. Oh, he did it too early. Wow. Oh, he too was early. way too early on it. Beautiful yeah, stuff. It, it should have just done down forward one. He said the down forward one to one string. Unfortunately, he was unable to get it, but a big counter hit to start it off. Yeah, down three, start of the round. And that's the thing, too. Is she's so scary. She can just keep doing those lows to kind of harass you. And if you guess wrong, boom. Yep. It's going to be lights out. And look at that. That was counter hit. We didn't go for the wall flat. Dude, she is just There's a lot of cool cars out the there. Wall. Just not that many that I would. Right now. Oh. Gotcha. Squid Punch able to take it. Back one plus two low. Tied up on a round. You know, you really got to oh, really want it. One? It wasn't even a low. No one lands orbitals anymore, man. It's like hey, a lost hey. art form. Don't you feel that way even like as, as Leroy? I like, love orbitals. Do, but don't you feel like it's harder <laughs> to hit nowadays? It's slower now. They made it slower. Yeah. They got to speed it up again. Every, everyone in the chat just said no rip. <laughs> I know. I'm sure. <laughs> no rip. Everyone. Trust me. Even that guy. God of Rage Drive. Here we go. Gets to the launch at the wall. The follow-up. Man, that's just unfortunate, the spacing at the wall there. Another one? Oh, oh Kenny, that's gonna go Man, down. I'm really that ready for the down. next Tekken as well. Shadow has been going low I'm really so much right ready now. for that shit. I mean, it's, it's cool, Bro, you know, it drama for the but guys in the back. it's been such a long course, time. Pandemic was like a Shadow big reset. <laughs> He's here to ruin <laughs> Thank you. He's done it's time, man. He's done it before. Come He's on, Michael. Harada and Murray, let's get this show on the road, man. But then, you know, if they announce it now and it's like a year away, that would be cool. You think they're gonna have NFTs? He knew it was gonna cool. work. He knew sometimes there's those unexpected, expected moments. Like he's not gonna finish it. Holy shit, he finished it. I can't believe he did that. that why is your yeah, room green? Totally Fuck you. That's why. Get a wagon. You you right, <laughs> Thanks, Doug Thank Demuro Swee. Uh, I like I wagons. That That's what I was just saying. I that, but there aren't that many. Earlier. Smart man. Especially Orphan not American Prime. ones. Anyways, uh, and G63 is cool. And that uh, well, Audi wagon that they remember. still make is cool. But yeah, come on, man. European the, engineer. Not only that, he's a big nah. character. Sure. She gets an even more consistent wall combo. So damage wise, if she's able to get a launch or a low parry, it is a bad situation for Fakum I'm real curious about how you play this match. Yeah, Fox Porsche Fox. makes the I forget I, I what think, their think, wagon's called. Some dude bought one and sent me a match. picture. You want to get the hits and you would just want to get out. Not even in Forza. I'm, I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna mix. Let me get the damage. And fuck Mar is cheap. I think this outfit is so cheap. You can't even see. His I think it's cheap too, too man. What the points. fuck? I'm just saying. It's that like the cheapest so fucking effective. outfit. How are you supposed to see a throw or any of this shit, dude? It's just like a blob. Up, right? Yep, yep. That mix up is so dangerous. Blurry as fuck. Yeah, three mix up, forward three mix up, down forward four. It's all good. Oh, there we go. Nice. He had the air counter hit. Unfortunately, yeah. not able to capitalize. Excuse me. Had the down forward four. He does have a good lead too. That's the thing. I feel like. Oh my oh, god. That the elbow. It's something he goes to the end of the round situation. He feels like, oh my, god. they might start making a comeback. Just a random back one. Boom. That's the thing too. It's like it's obviously it's punishable. Why right? MK11 sucks? Pretty good move. You that guy that, got a shot. You're in a situation where you they might get a shot, bait, bitch. Or bait out a counter hit. That's a lot of free damage. I think that in all the matches I've watched in 2021, I think I've seen back one correctly punished maybe three times. Yeah. I, I, I will agree. I agree. Damn, someone got banned. Hey, what'd you do to get permanently banned? Uh huh. Uh, there that's an alt is. account. Like a book. Following and for five days. What do you uh, look like? Let's see it. Shadow now tying things up. As we go into a very important match here, Vin Chang making that switch. He is stuck with Falcon Run for the entire. They get banned. No oh, pass huh? doesn't like you, dude. I don't really know what you did. You seemed all right to me. Kind of dumb, but you would fit right in. So, although he does have to pick the bigot here, filter, the thing is, he gets so much reward if he's able to I didn't notice him saying anything bigot related. Are you framing him? Oh my goodness, that was so good! Yeah, nice down four, two, three. The follow up here, he gets the wall. He misses. How did it miss? Don't that ask is me. Usually one of the most consistent enders there She's so slimy, dude. Yeah, maybe Zafina is, is just like that kind of character, man. Sure she always outfit. slips okay. out of everything. Into so, something a little more comfortable. Things are looking you know really what I mean? Shadow. She a hoe. Try to catch him. Oh, look at that. Just the face. I'm just going to stand and block this. What are you going to do? Damn, oh, someone else got wow. blasted. Are you still wow, running a Hellcat? No, I never oh, yeah. bought a Hellcat. I bought a Dodge Charger Daytona. Is it kill? It killed. It killed. 
kills. Okay. Uh, okay. 5.7 leader. <laughs> need to hit a button there, but Daytona. Right, but it's years ago. Well, it's already been enough, right? five yeah. years since I bought that, that car. Crazy. All right. Two rounds to one. Bin Chang proving it's worth it so far. But that was, a, that was too close for comfort. Very scary moment. Yeah, it's a Bin cool Chang, car. I love it. I have no complaints at all. Ooh. Try to catch up with the mix. Did not go for the low. Went for the mid instead. <laughs> but that don't mean I'm not gonna trade it. It's got sixteen thousand miles on it. We're gonna go to a final round. I work from home. Work low. Yo, the wall flat. It's not gonna do a lot of damage because of that. Hell no. Hey, what are you looking at? Wanna watch the MGS2 speed run on Act now? Hey, thanks very much, Amir. And Hyzian, and thanks Diabolical Dreams, and Garadex, and Clam Hat, and Oni Ramen, Robo Fish, Alex 2D, Busta Tunes, Snake Edge, thanks. Um, no, I don't. Why would I want to watch a speedrun of the shittiest fucking Metal Gear there is? She ducked the high but had nothing! Oh my goodness, what's gonna happen? How is he gonna pull this off? Anyway, thanks. If he just lands a rage drive, he wins. I mean, these lows could add up AGDQ too, is online now, right? What so, like, Ooh, as if it didn't oh smell God. bad enough at AGDQ, now we gotta be inside their bedrooms and shit. Binjang, hold it on. No thanks. One apiece here. Stuck with Fock and Rom, as you mentioned. Shadow has opportunity to switch characters if he chooses to. I don't think he's gonna. I think he's gonna run it right back. Nah. You think so? I think he's sticking with that. You don't think so? I think I know so. Right. <laughs> I think 100%. Yeah. Thank you. Don't look at that screen. Uh, at that. thanks, F. <laughs> Dell. It's like it's already loading. <laughs> Here we go. Final game, Zafina versus Fakarov. Last one of the group stages. I mean, we've had a brilliant Fuck Mar is so, so cheap, dude. He's such a bully As character. Has the wall. Look at his boom, hey. bang, boom. Yeah, those three before counters coming into effect. Oh Look at the back end down forward forcing. Give me this perfect. Fuck Mar is whack, dude. And they're going to put him on the cover of the this next Tekken game. Mm -mm. Fuck Mar is a whack addition. A lot more loose. He is not afraid. This is what you yeah. wanted. The follow up standing three. Gets it. Boom. He's going to get the wall and the big boy combo. Hey. Oh my gosh. Jesus. Yo, you took that round. What? Let me get it back. He want to watch that before he didn't get it. Low no. good. That's unfortunate because of the wall situation there. Squid punch. He lived. He wow. That is a you big punish. That must be 15 you. frames. Yo, this pixel. Is, he spent oh, is it? Maybe oh, it's 16 gosh. frames. I don't know. Rage just spent, but nothing. Whoa. And the squid oh, closes it out That's there. minus 17? Okay, How's that launcher? Really slow? That's crazy. Oh my god. Oh, it's 15. I almost threw something. While standing <laughs> 3 is 15. Okay, cool. That's what I guess. So he's kind of like <laughs> Fangs while standing 3. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. 15 frame hop kick kind of a... And again, now Shadow while standing the range here. Using the squid punch to his advantage. And the down 3. I'd like to see Bitchen go back to the 3 plus 4. They were working for him earlier. Yeah. Wow, just finish it. Bruce died for Josie's and tits and Fuckmar. I wish they brought Bruce move. back you are instead of Fuckmar. Oh, yeah, that would have been cool. Not just that, the power of the jab is always there, too. Those things add up so quick over time. What's going to happen? About 20 seconds left. Mm, have to make thanks, Goulet. Right what? The down 4 that he doubles up Bully on. Bully point for Bin Chang now. This is huge. Bin Chang looking to make it out into the Yeah, I mean, everyone likes team. Josie's tits and all. No one's saying round, they don't. Do so. But we're just saying we like up, Bruce's tits, too. Down three this time. Chang, and we clean. don't he like fuck Mars tits. Who taught that? That's not in the combo video. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh my gosh. This is this is crucial. Yeah, Shadow needed that. He needed that kind of opportunity, but still big lead for Bin Chang. We just out of rage too. This could be huge. <laughs> I don't know about oh. me. Good break. Oh, the squid punch again. Not that means yes. You remember, that's launch punishable too. He's in as rage. well as this hello. Be crazy. He in French. High. Had nothing behind it. Shadow with rage. Oh, I can't believe he's going no. for the down floor. That's just the rage drive. Damn the spacing. Too much has back. Oh he my god. Not gonna happen. Uh, damn, that guy got Two shot. He gets shot, and bitch. Jab, all, all I saw was the question mark. Nice question mark. Three to zero out of group B here. Thanks, Brex Ten. That, you know, as a prediction that anyone in this group might have made out three zero. But Ben Chang gets it done. He legit only used three moves. Kind of Are you talking about with Fuckmar? 
Yeah, I mean, that, that character is a bully, spammy kind of character, which is cool, but not that cool. He also looks dumb and... Eh, whatever. It ain't, it ain't for me. We will be seeing him later today. Yes, sir. Man. But now we still got to figure out who gets out in second. <laughs> our, our guys are in the back there. The venue We're is sick? The yeah, it's pretty oh, neat know. considering yeah. the yeah, circumstances. We got because of this situation. Make I don't know what venue we'll this is, man. Go don't ask me. It's cool, though. I'm amazed that this is happening that's offline. Happen later today, our top four, two winners, two losers. Exactly. And that's going to be first to three the whole way through as well. So a lot more Why is Seglia making them stand? I don't know. Uh, but definitely I mean, we know our tell me. We know our winner's final match is going to be This is at Rip's winner, house. Of course we'll get oh, into the grand finals and then everyone else is going to be battling out nice. for fourth, third and second. Exactly. And you know those two have a lot of history throughout the year as well, so it's going to be really fun to see them, you know, finally get a squash it mm -hmm. offline here at the regional finals. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, it all comes down to this. Everything that they've been playing for the entire year throughout all these You think now is a good time for a break? I definitely need a snack if I'm going to make it all the way through. I'm hungry. All these weekly events really showing up not only that for the master event as well. Let's take a look at the official standings. Yeah, now's a good time. There it is. All right, it's chat room, I'm going to get up and do a stretch. They're starting top the four after the break. All right, chat room, I'm going to eat a little snack a I'm going to come back. We're in it for the long victory. haul. He's moving on to the top four, where he will be going up against I'll be back. Crush from Pool A. I won't be long. Good stuff, man. Boy, I could good feel stuff. it. So I'm hungry. <laughs> Click on this. Thank you. Thanks, Algebra number two. Give me a couple of minutes, will you? I'll be back. Be cool. And that will be our top four bracket coming up later. But man, great matches all around. You know, great stuff to all the competitors today. But Joey and Binchang, very excited to see that one happen again offline. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. What, was what that? else we got? <laughs> we got more? Oh, yes, we do. Make sure you guys follow us on all our different social accounts and, of course, our YouTube account, our Facebook accounts, and Twitter. As you can see, BNE Esports on both Twitter and YouTube. You can watch all of the action from not only this weekend, but past events. Mm -hmm. You can also see games from Dragon Ball Fighters, Soul Calibur 6, and many more. Say what? And make sure you guys follow us on Tekken for both Twitter, Twitch, and Facebook, as well for the latest updates on the game as well. All righty. So I believe we are going to take a break before we get into our top four action. Uh, it's going to be crazy, guys. Don't go anywhere. Uh, we'll be right back after this. Oh, and we do have an encore performance from the sax. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Patrick Bartley from the J Music Ensemble will be jumping up on stage and he'll be treating us to more of his wonderful tunes from the saxophone. Let's check it out. <laughs> Thank you.
Thank y'all very much. <laughs> Thank you. I know y'all gonna recognize this one from the modern hit Tekken 7. This one right here. <laughs> Thank you. This guy's good.
He's good. Standing ovation. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Damn, man. He's really good. He's not even like, you know, talent show good. Like, yeah, this this kid's really good at playing the whatever. He's legit good. Like, we're not even trying to be nice. Are you guys trying to be nice? I'm not even trying to be nice right now. Hey, man, I ain't even fucking trying to be nice. You're pretty good. Nope, none of us are. Hey, none of us in the chat room are trying to be nice. We don't do that here. Just yeah, FYI. Goddamn. You see all these people who are clapping and shit? Everyone impressed? We don't give people credit just for nothing. We hate everything around here. So, you're pretty good. Think about it, man. Everyone's hype. No one's trying to be nice to him either. That guy's good. <laughs> Thank you. Nice. Good shit. We ain't nice to no one around here. These parts? Mm, thanks, rookie on the job. You know, thanks, I've Eastside never liked Eli. You, Rick. Yeah, that was sick. Agreed. Thanks, ear user. Uh, and Ramathorn. Pure schmuck. Thanks, Mofus. <laughs> Thank you. Dr. Dark Dick. Thanks very much, Top Remain. Uh, and RLT. Thanks for the subs. I just took a break, but it's <laughs> only two you. minutes. Yeah. Excuse me. Thanks, Wavos Rancheros. <laughs> Thank you. I had, uh, earlier I ordered three chicken soft tacos. I ate two for lunch, and I had one more during the break. Two bites, and then a swig of hot sauce right from the bottle to chase it down. Wash that burger down. It was good. Got the job done. <laughs> now I'm Thank re-energized. Mm, thanks, Afabor. And thanks, Armor King TV. And Meltman. Happy New Year, bros. Yeah, it was good. Nice, quick little break. I'm ready. Top 4 is about to start, I think. Plus, I got some good movie recommendations, and I got a few video games lined up, too. I think I'm gonna try out probably... Yo! Maybe Tenchi 1 tomorrow. Time to dust off the cello brew. I've never even played it once, dude. It's just for show. I'm a poser. I try and look sophisticated for the ladies. Thanks, Gaddafi 20 z <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, we'll see. I never really played a Tanshu before. The highlight of Tekken 7. 
Thanks, Eris Bueller's day off. Appreciate you. Bueller. I've been hearing that one since I was a kid, dude. Eris Bueller. I've been hearing that one since I was a kid. That's a cool movie, though. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, uh, Desi. Thank you again. 20 seconds of silence? No. Mamma mia! Thanks, Money Myth. Mono Myth. Thanks, Mono Myth. Silent Generosity. Make a new account just to make one dono and never use it again, lol. Hey, what's up, dumb asshole? You don't need to make an account the to donate. Online you can just make up the name. Damn, look at all right the smudges now. on that. Nobody could have cleaned that thing? But the online champ of Jesus North America, Christ, somebody whatever, French kissed that shit. Grand champion. I like that. Grand hey, you guys couldn't have polished that thing off, man? Here. It's got fucking we're back, we've smooch got marks on play. it. We have our finalists who make it to this top four. And the format <laughs> is Thank a little you. different, especially yes, coming from that regular format. Mm -hmm. Especially considering now, once they get to a certain spot... I'm going to make nachos because uh, I'm sick of them through. delivering soggy-ass nachos. I'm going to make them. Hey, you guys ever made nachos inside the, the air fryer? That sounds weird. I think it's better inside the toaster or inside the oven. Because all you really need to get done is melt the cheese. That's it. All you need to do is melt the cheese. That's all I need. And then you put on the wet ingredients after. And then Junior 2-1, which I really feel like what really set Oven is top. Was Junior's first match versus his brother, and that kind of mm. offset everything for who could possibly make it to Pool B, especially nacho the cheese. Well, but what I want is I want double cheese, so I want nacho cheese and I want Mexican crown, cheese, uh, grated cheese, you know, like the three cheese blend, the, the Mexican stuff, mm -hmm. and I want sorry cream. Series. Guacamoles, uh, very probably some of salsa of some type, first match up and from the side of the bracket. anything else and you recommend? have a lot of history throughout the entire year, uh, so really Pepper good Jack. to see them, you know, squash that here. Cheddar on tortilla, I love uh, cheddar. Down to side, we of course have Joe Crush going up against Junior. These guys have been meeting online tournaments throughout the year. Maybe well. that's a good idea. Of course, you know, I'm not really even sure who Sharp has Sharp Cheddar. Hey, what are you looking at? Hello from 2025, 20, 20, smile, smile. smile. Thanks, Dr. Hulk and Spider-Man. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Fulcrum 103, huh? Thanks for the 103 month sub. But I feel like he's kind of like that Fulcrum. landmine at this point. Yes. Stay Happy New Year, man. Play and has been making a name for himself, not just like in the past two That's years crazy, only, right? but specifically 103 in the past year, months. we've seen him in a lot of top eight spots. So the fact that we do have Joe Crush being one of those sole representatives that, you know, kind of did solely online. Thanks, Win Ben Stein's money. I, mean, I remember that show. Right there, of course. Being up here with <laughs> Thanks, like Neo MG. Uh, as well as Joey Fury, Ben <laughs> G Cube. The best in the world. And thanks, and Extra Pep, Extra Cheese Pizza. Damn, exactly. I, I wish. Right now, you know, personally, no pepperonis like allowed, dude. The player in America to beat. Oh, yeah. Right. And Do you know about the island like boys? To, to put other no. names up there with them, but to me, <laughs> Thank Joey's you. been What's the consistent that? one throughout. Is that a restaurant? Uh, maybe even more than a year and a half. Even. Thanks, like, Yeet Master. Of from Joey throughout. Speaking of good ass tech, and let's check out some of the merch Tin OS so graciously gave us out there. And for you guys at home, if you would love to get some of this good ass tech and merch, 10 0.gg slash merch. Or we made it easy to do a scan Me? of the QR code on your screen, and you can get whichever one of these, whether it's good ass Tekken or cute ass Tekken. They meme? all look godlike, oh. and you can get your very own. All right, man. then. Shout outs to Tin for holding us down. QR code technology. Island boys, wow. these nuts. You could just scan it and buy one right Good now. One. Steve, I missed it. You're lying. It's right there on the screen. You know, for the long time, I didn't even know how to do it. All you gotta do is like on an iPhone at least. You just take a camera, you put it Thanks up there, boom, it pops Master up, hit the Pete. Safari button. Next thing you know, you're at the page. Next you can order. You're buying it on a page, man. Speaking of, Ben Chang, man. I wonder what character he's bringing to these finals. We've seen quite a few already. That's why I said this dude has so many different characters. That he yeah, I know the Van Buren boys. The, the Deadly Gang. I want to know what character he's looking at to fight against Joey Fury. 
of course. Before we get there, we do have to give a huge shout out to Astro, the official headset and mix app of the Tech and Online Challenge. We've been holding down for Astro for Shills well again. Now, I feel like. So a huge shout out to Astro. Cashing those Astro so checks nonstop. Joe, you were asking about the characters. The interesting thing about this matchup is I feel like when we first saw it, they were using different characters. And then mm -hmm. Ben Jake is winning. Hey, and Astro's cool. Joey started What's winning. wrong with just Astro? Back and, forth, and then Joey kind of ran away with it a little bit. And I like the way that you're talking about it because it puts it in kind of like a season perspective. Damn, you think like, Joey's you got this shit easy? These guys playing each other. I want to root like for said, Joey. Completely different oh, my characters. gosh. And wow, he's playing Lars? Lars? Damn, it's hard not to root for Lars. Look at his shirt. Damn. But Marduk is throwing a mid-sized sedan across the stage. I think I'm going to Go for yeah, Marta. Lars in the top four. Mm. Taking online down the NA finals. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, gets the tackle long distance. Right, Bin Chang does have a counter. counter. Oh my that's god. That's just a Get nickname. Oh, oh, shit. Shit. Uh oh. Wow. And Lars, he can go from wall to wall, no problem. Look at the combo uh -huh. damage here. Uh -huh. Yeah, that hurt. Oh. Oh, what? The classic Wait, Lars. Oh this, my God! Oh, wow. Kick. Wait a minute. That's ben like the only win. option you have there to get up, right? Well ben Chang has been playing today. But yes. so risky. But Joey <clears throat> Maybe you have other options. I don't full know. Take, full play today. Joey's matches were all kind of scrambly, but he mm -hmm. just stays consistent and gets the W. Uh -oh. uh, that's kind of what we're seeing right now. Wow. wow other side. Oh, oh nice. God, he still got the tail spin. Back to that they made Lars's wall carry right so crazy that with that new really double kick. That shit is crazy. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Harry, Harry, Thank he's he's dead. Hot. That is not one. Clean. Thanks, Omniscient. Thanks for the new the subscription. Piece. That's nice of you. Mm. Power, and thanks, Johnny Dinner. Around. Hope you guys are all having a nice new year so far. So far, so good over here. Checking with the down four ones, of course. We saw the counters coming out from Joy Fury and the Marta. Gets, her, gets him an instant mount stance, right? Ooh. It's so good. Yeah, it's so good. But then you got to guess correctly. Mm. Nice oh, whip boy. punish. What's that it's shit called? Arc shoulder. Blast? That Arc Blast. Like, and now you leave Marta with rage. Uh, you you got to get that. Ben Chang. The scary part of the match versus, uh, versus uh, Marta in general. Right. Gets right. down to rage. If he hits you with that raise drop, it's going to hurt. Don't even, and you better not let him combo. Combo right. and the tackle, take the guess. That's a good 70% of your bar you can get back in no time. And you know, the way Ben Chang approached the end of that round is great. He just went forward. He's like, I'm oh. going in, I'm going to poke Out the earth. Like That's the one I was talking about, the kicks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the same conversion, still gigs control. Yeah, man, he looks like he's pretty comfortable. Thank you. The low with Lars. <laughs> I love, I love how Ben Chang is switching oh, up. The good approach. punish. Nice. This is down 4 1 on the wall here. Down back 2 for the Oki. Joey was so ready for the punish there on Lightning Screw. Good throw. Two breaks, in. still good. Something that throw out and take Wow, whip like, punish. Oh, what the fuck? Four, one, big damage there. Was Not that an acceptable combo? combo? Oh, what was that? Did he mean to do that? Or was that an accident? He meant to do that? Dragging off you like a four three just for no reason. I love it. Style points? You have to jump over the low to get an attack. And look at the block with not a launcher. Yo, the defense has been one of the things that's been on display here. These guys play each other a lot. Damn, they're really scrapping at each other. All that experience coming into play. Still staggering the office. Ben Chang. Anyone's game? No way. No body two. Yo, the body slam. Okie okay, time too. High step. Oh my god, god. god. The mix ups. You cannot He thought the wall down. might have messed right up the Come normal combo. Damn, we got the president of the Joey Fury fan club over here. Like, you're afraid of Making up all these scenarios and shit for him. Damn, nice. Are you his legal counsel? Has ended two rounds successfully with his up for Yeah, sure he did. Uh, thanks, girls, Dan's game. And thanks, underscore. Do you like the Hawaiian and Korean barbecue, yes. yes. Very much. I think I would like them evenly, except Hawaiian barbecue usually isn't all you can eat. All you can eat, best you can eat. Especially if it's good quality, like those Brazilian places or a good Korean BBQ. Whoa. Thanks, thanks King Marky and Ken the Fat Man. Loki, Loki. Thanks. You guys are still dance gaming over girls? Right now, Bench, 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 Bench,
talking, Ben Chang fighting diligently up river without a paddle. <laughs> steals the round. Oh Yo, my god. Counter confirmed on this one thing is destroying Joey right now. Bro, the tide has turned once again. And it's not <laughs> yeah, even from round wow. to round. It's within the round. It's like the stock market, bro. Oh, it's just oh, up and down oh, everything. Oh, we missed the end of it though. Damn, Ben Chang is crazy right now. Yo, look, look at Ben Chang's form. You see him playing on his tippy toes right there? Yeah, that yeah, means yeah. he wants the controller level while he's playing. Ben in Chang is bringing the heat. Right I do it all the time. That's what he plays at home too. I've never seen yeah. it home, but I'm pretty Excuse sure. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm about to ask a very serious question. I'm like, how do you know this? Anyways, down four. <laughs> down back two. It's <laughs> crazy because now I'm gonna be yeah, yeah, yeah. see him online, yeah, right? Yeah. His tippy toes Thanks, like Scruff. When he's playing good, he's on his tippy toes, yep. like a ballerina, bro. All right, here we go. Gotta have the perfect level for the arcade. Wow. Yo, yo, Out the blue? Man, he's getting again. so many counter hit 1 1 ones. That's 1 1 1, right? Crouching. Or is that 2 2 2? Thank you. Is that shit good? Is two rounds straight for you could probably hit confirm it, right? And this is best of five now, like we said before. So it's first to three this time around. Try to go for the body slam, no deal. You can duck my throw, you the knee for your face. Yeah, the that fake seems off. really good. The and a wall splat? Uh, uh, it's off, minus right? 13, but you don't have to do the third hit, up. right? Oh, it's minus 14? Still, you don't have to do the third hit. Counter hit confirmed. How bad is the second hit on block? One in the second game here. Twice now he's blocked it down for no launcher yet. He's gonna get to it though. So looking for the throw, nice sidewalk. 2 1. Punish. Wall? No, no wall. Second hit's minus eight. That move is good. Thank you. It up. Oh, oh my wow. Speaking of finishing the string, I think he delayed it just a little bit so it didn't give him enough time. Ben Chang can take this match. <laughs> God damn, that it's was a, a huge mistake damn, from Ben oh, Chang. Wait, Chang, Chang. Oh, he didn't break it. Oh. <laughs> that was such a big mistake, dude. Oh, wow. This is his last chance. Oh, shit. Got Joey ducking. Wall's gonna be right here. Oh! Uh -huh. That's not me. F. That's not me. Oh, try to hit it with the steamroll. Normal. Oh, break. shit. Oh, God. Oh, the power shit. Nice man. throw break. Counter hit again, right dude. Look at how many times he's well, gotten that. We saw what that. happened last time. We saw what happened last time. Look at him. One, one launcher. He's dead here. And it's Marduk with rage mode. Jesus. Yo, oh, the nice. Oh, damn. All right, Ben Chang holds on to the game. Ben Chang. And we're tied. One apiece here. Winner's <laughs> final. <laughs> Thank you. Three. All right. Uh, thanks Santa Extra Large and Louise. Thanks for using your Twitch Prime on my stream. Here we go. Thanks Beautiful Jen and Vegas, Goober, Fondle the Nips, Brew, Hola, and Gruff, Boomba Gatunga. Thanks Alex Leva and Girls Dance Game. Thanks. I'm not inviting you to nowhere, bro. All right, we go. Beautiful. He meant nipple. I had the whip point at that time. Wall carry though. Well, too far. Mm. Kill sweep. Good oh, block. Actually blocked the low this time around. Wasn't Not able to get from it. Just Again? Just him flat on his back on the ground right there. Yeah, that's one of the things we've criticized Ben Chang up in the past, right? Like when he's switching characters, sometimes his punishment falls out because he's not sure about what to do with specific characters Ooh. in specific situations. And that's why it's really good to have a, a good pace, right? Yep. You got to be able to play slow enough to where you're going to get back these opportunities to remember everything, punish wow. properly. Speaking of everything, down four nope. what was bad on it, but then he, drew, he dropped the combo. Punish. I could have been better, be but careful. good it enough. Sticks to the low. Ben Chang. This is sight. Oh, get off of me, bro. Okay, just the one two goes for the veil to cancel goes for a low Ooh. right after it. playing a little too close to home plate eats an arc blast and the wall Damn, that ben hurt. Yo, ben Chang is playing Man, he really does make Mars look to cool the low this time. Wait a minute. Mars is supposed Joey to look Curry. whack. Hey, has it been that loud? Damn it. Why didn't you tell me it was so loud? Was it really loud before? Bro, the stagger or maybe it wasn't even that loud ridiculous, bro. No it was too loud. I'll turn it up a little. Oh, speaking of swinging big, just dash up down for It wasn't loud? It's too low now? That means it's perfect. It was fine? Shut up, bitch. It's fine now. Breaks the tackle. Now it's perfect. Yeah, man, it's just too loud. I ain't trying to yell. And I also ain't trying to hear her rip. Of course, of course, Joey now. Round four. 
Trying to gain a little bit of momentum here, trying to pull away from Pinchak a little bit. Could but be it's been going hard. Up. Oh man. Uh -huh. And as this match goes on, you can see that those I don't know if I believe in Ben Chang. He's notorious for having no clutch. Less and less effective. And that means Joey Fury uh -oh. is taking the lead in this set. Here he's back to the wall again. Yep. Right uh oh. Where is the punish? Okay, that's better than nothing. Uh, he's got no health. He's got no health. No. He had no health. He needed to make magic happen. With this ugly ass Craig Bart, I got <laughs> oh, you're right. It's best out of five. I didn't realize that. Uh oh, someone got shot. What'd you do now? Oh, the old why is your camera green? Uh huh. Well, um. No questions, please. He gave me the nod. I'm gonna agree with him. That's me. That's me. Yeah, the classic. It really is true at this point. The only reason my camera is green is so that new people can say, Hey, why is your camera green? And then we could remind them that we don't want fucking new people around here. We're full. Final Fantasy XIV. Sorry, bitch. No more fans. Beat it. That's A plus homework. You can use that for research. You can carry it into a tournament situation. And you're about to see it right here. 2-1 in the set right now. Best of five. I didn't notice. <laughs> yeah, fuck Mar again. I know, man. And he got me to root for him last game. Now I'm rooting for Joey Fuhrer. Get him, Joey. Fuck Mar is trash. There you go. Give it to him. Give it to him. He's got no clutch. It's true everything they say. Fucking Rob doesn't matter. Oh, no. oh, nice punish. No star chatting bunnies. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Hey, nice parry. Uh, thanks, Billy Hoyle, for the five gifted subs. And thanks, Jaha's 11th Xbox. <laughs> thanks. Man, I wonder how many Xboxes that guy had. I think it was double digits. 10 plus red rings. <clears throat> Xbox 360, one of the greatest consoles of all time. It's terrifying. If you're bitching right now, you're shaking. You're fucking wrong. You get a 90% lead. Oh, low parry the consistency. Joey Fury Marta gonna get the wall. No. Uh -huh. Tackle? No. Just out of range. That was crazy. Just actually going to jab early enough to stop so. the tackle animation. Yeah, push his hit. Hurt box forward enough. Just enough. Mm -hmm. Down four. Oh, I got, yeah, I got fuck Mar is really bro. boring to watch. Said, you just want to root against that character. Oh, Damn. Oh, big damage. Come on, Joey. That's a villain back. character. The back and forth. Woo. My Damn. Man lightning go off over his head. Oh, there you go. Right in the oh, ass. Beautiful. Oh, he and he knows lights. the combo. Uh, hey, all right. Don't let him tie it up, man. Send him home. One more round. Come on, chat room. Send him your whatever you got. We don't want to watch Fuck Mar again. Get Fuck Mar out of here. It's cool that this is offline. I would have been pissed if it was online. Trade. Okay, good enough. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh the whiff punish. That was really, really clutch. That was really, really clutch by Joey Fury. That whiff punish right there was juicy. Very nice. To steal the round back with just a pixel. That would have been really hard if he let him tie it up. 2-2. Two, two. Moving in to the grand final. And you already pointed Joey out. Joey Fury. That nice really work. On, man. We talked about the fact that this is the online chat. Thanks again, Billy Hoyle, for the gifted subs. Year in and year that was out. sick. Literally for the last two He's years. He's sharp. And so you know there's a lot of experience that went into getting that W. Joey Fury with the pop-off because we already understand how hard it is to control a player like Ben Chang. Uh-oh. Does like he have an injury? In He's been playing ridiculous today. He was oh, like, yeah. ouch. Yeah. Thank you. Didn't he, like, look at his hand? Uh-oh. We got an injured player here. Thanks, Hungry Peruvian. 
Homeroom living room. Notice how Steve is taking up more than 50%? That's his style. He always does that shit. Look at this. You see that? That's what he does. Habitual line stepper. Early on, and I've been a fan of Joy Fury from Jump. He's a habitual line stepper. Old, going and Steve. watching him play the best players in the world at this point, and this still being able to translate that to an online scenario where he's that was a good match. Pound, probably the best player in the NA. It's definitely an arguable thing to talk mm -hmm. about Easily. when it comes to thanks ESL League. On the other side of it, even though they didn't run into Appreciate each other it. all the time, Ben Chang has still been making that same run. Happy Big Friday. Online powerhouse. This time the character switches didn't help him out in the long run. Joy Fury sticking with the Marduk. We already know damage is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. He's gonna stay alive. Grand Finals is where he's gonna meet. That was the winner side of the bracket. Whistle got the loser side of the bracket coming up. They're already on the stage. Junior going up against Joe Crush here. Joe Crush, Crush still in. in. Right? So, so you know, the Noctis guy is out. The pools and the Who else is out? One line uh. Line. uh uh, Cuddlecore got the DQ, obviously, and then FDX is out, and that means Benching, of course, waiting in the loser final for the winner. Oh, there it is, Joe Crush and Junior. Man, two players that have definitely been stepping it up these past. So right now, I've been following Junior for so long at this point. I feel like we all have, but his opponent Joe Crush. Is there still a blank spot? No, right? And he talked about like his. I don't know. Really we'll figure it out. Who gives a fuck? You want to take out those idols? You want to play the hard match? Definitely got a chance. I don't know what happened with Cuddlecore. Someone said she got sick. Someone else made some shit up. But she wasn't there. Like Junior on the other side of the table. Been traveling since the beginning of Tekken Seven. Been on the same route. Mm, thanks, as amazing Pepto Bismol. Joey Furies, the Rick the Rulers, she the got Rick sick. Fees, yeah. You yourself, <laughs> the Anik, everybody been there the entire time so it's really good to see him up on this stage and this isn't his first time on a stage like this at <laughs> yeah. all but the thank you thanks your boy Pore. Like thanks this. for the subscription for what he's doing you know a lot of that comes from playing his brother and a lot of that mid west yeah everyone likes talent. watching so her match, play she's no matter good matter this is loser side one but i mean you know is still on winter side excuse gotta me. do what you gotta oh, do this is, oh we did go to the loser side excuse this me. is loser side all right so that means somebody is about to go home damn right junior joe crush one of these guys Gonna be done after this set. First of three games. Question is, who is Junior gonna use? Is he using Damn, there's Joe the Crush fans. All right, good shit. You room for Joe Crush? You ever watch Glenn? I, mean, no, I don't know what that is. Is that a game Speaking or a movie? Seasons, no. Might be locking on one of these DLC seasonal characters. And the thing about Joe Crush is that Joe Crush has multiple Dude, I thought you were playing Tekken. Nobody gives a fuck what you thought, Red Name. What makes you think anyone wants to hear that shit? Kick Rocks, Pendejo. Thank you. Not a lot of them are able to come. Uh, thanks, Jet Junkie. And Shangles, what up, man? I feel like Joe Thanks. Crush. Thanks, it's Global right there, Table it's Shortage. Really La Tabla. Thanks. Strong. And we got a blind I'm looking forward to this pizza oh, yeah. I'm about to pick. order These after this shit guys. ends. <laughs> I could taste it already. Thank you. Yeah, Tekken fans dance game. I know, man. It's the worst thing about even restreaming Tekken. You can't keep him out of here. To be able to deal with certain matchups, and I like the fact that he's going to the Katarina. I feel like his Katarina is really strong. We don't have a lot of Thanks, big doubled. Yeah, definitely do not have Katarina. It's on stage geese. Uh, so of course we saw Genghis Don putting in work as CEO, mm -hmm. uh, and now of course Junior all. doing decent with the Katarina as well. Round one. Damn, dude, I can't believe Geese is a tech and steel. It's been like five years. <laughs> and he got his stage, bro. And he got his stage. We need to figure. I need to figure out. Yeah, she a hoe. Everyone knows like, that. Those like giants, like what the hell? Yeah, dude. You think they're normal human size? Is that true to history? All samurais are that big. Position Stand change. No, dude. Wake ups. Chop. I wish go. they would just of the delay, make one more started. season of this game and remove the jumping for the 2D Down characters. Using that hair Give them a standard Tekken and jump. Man, and that's one, of the that would be sick. Time. one more season. They've made a lot of changes to the character. That Cut their legs off? Damn, you're getting crazy. And the fact that we see Junior as somebody who's held this character down lets you know just how strong it is. Mm. Yeah, all right, I'm down. Put him in a wheelchair. But actually, once you learn the 
gets a lot more interesting. You realize there's a lot more depth than first anticipated. Mm. Character is not interesting at all. Never has been, never will be. Wow, nice dude. Thank you. Wow. Hey, alright, but it ain't over yet. She a ho. Nope, that ain't gonna work. That was cool. Round comeback potential with Rage, with a Rage Drive especially, is super high. It's too bad, man. I just stopped smoking yesterday. <laughs> yep, Harry. Thanks, Boss Rutin and Revolution Toasted. And, uh, Dubin. Thanks. Damn, man. That parry got a lot of fans. All right. Nice parry. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks again. Look, area fans can't. <laughs> wow, that was nice, dude. The double stagger. Whoa. Uh oh. Uh oh. Damn, he's trying to keep him away for his life. Uh oh. Oh. Nice. That was sick. Hey, Joe Crush fan, you still there? He's looking pretty good. Oh, God. Fucking Steve lost his mind, too. Yeah, that's right. Just like Lucari. I'm a jazz aficionado. A connoisseur, if you will. Basado, Basado. What an interrupt. Stand up. Uh huh. Yo, my man, he said to stand, and then he hit the successful dunk pose. Huh. God. Huh. No Thanks, Madik is too itchy. Like no matter what his and orbital was, laser you know, cannon. Thanks. <laughs> the boss of South Town, bro. You thought I was dead? I stay in a mansion downtown, bro. Bro, just in case y'all don't know, my Excuse man Terry me. Bogart went to save him. And he just let go of his hand on purpose. He's like, yo, Geese, you don't He's have off to a good like, start. You think I want you to save me? Smack his hand and just let himself go. That's real hate right there. And it's petty. To put your life on the line for that, I got to respect it. I mean, it's it's really, really petty. But damn, that's evil. That's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> you think I need your help? I want to save you. Well, you know what? I don't want you to save me. No. <laughs> no. Did he say no afterwards? Tenchu is on the menu oh, tomorrow. Right. Tenchu said, part no, one. And then if like I don't like it, I'll try part two. And then back up, I got Klonoa. <laughs> Thank you. And the fourth one was Skull Monkey. Never played any of those. This stage, one of the, the last stage. <laughs> Thank Thanks, Nui. Thanks, Tor92. Double callback stage, I like to say. The pool side with two Tekken tracks. Hey, does anyone know what the winner gets of today's event? Everyone keeps telling me it's not important. It's like two Gs? How many Gs? That's some durable glass they got up here on this place. They must how, how much come? I definitely saw A gift card for 50 bucks mm -hmm. at Bed Bath & Beyond? Super reminiscent of uh, Tekken Damn. Tag 2 on top oh, yeah. of that. Good. Fighting games are really struggling during the pandemic. All right, Junior. Fight. Those big 3K. Talking about actually gets over the projectiles. Five Gs. I feel like a lot of people don't talk about that, especially two Gs. Get over those projectiles Man, on the ground. Fucking your story doesn't add up, dude. Whether it be a move, you can jump over them. It's a 3D game, you can sidestep them. You got options. Down to, ooh, nice. Steps forward a little bit to make sure. It's very nice. Completely different second game. He's getting fucked up now. Counter hit bait that time. Magic four combo for Junior. Look at him dashing in the face. So confident right now. Counter, I don't think so. But here's a counter for yourself. Count four, counter hit. Trying to get the conversion here. Walk nice. Almost messed up the combo. That was tight. That was like four side hits on the wall. Two bars. There's two bars hey. on the side of Joe Crush. And this could be it. <laughs> uh oh, Thank you. he could have done it. Look at the tiny pixel for Junior right now. Wow, he's fucking dead. He's dead. Is that enough? Yeah, right. He got no health. It scales. He's dead. Oh my God, That was rough. Plus five for the HP. Don't mind if I do. I'm gonna need all of this. I've been stuck in the house a while. Don't know if I got the life bar like I used to. 
Thanks, Loza. Thanks for the subs. You guys all done with church? Alvis? I didn't even know that. Now that you said it out loud, I don't think I did. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Tekken announcer. I didn't even know her last name. That's crazy. Happy Big Friday. I like how they put the respect on Geese's name. Geese Howard. Church is like garbage. Church is chicken? I was talking about church, you know, like with Jesus and shit. Not church is chicken. Church is chicken is garbage, dude. Go to Popeyes. Popeyes is way better. Church is sucks, dude. Church is sucks. That shit is mad wet. Like their chicken is really wet, but it's not juicy. It's like fucking the shit they injected in. You know how they inject chicken? You know about that? All the chicken you get at the grocery store has a ton of fucking liquid injected in it to make it bulbous and big. Shit's gross. They got that injected shit. Big ass bulbous. Full of juice. It's like brine, yeah. But it's not really brine. It would be brine if they were like a real kitchen. But it's like a corporation, you know? So corporate brine, dude? God knows what that's made of, man. Church's chicken brine? God, it's like, yeah, piss if you're lucky. It's not real piss. It's synthetic piss made out of soy. You know? God knows what it is. Chemical piss. Who knows what it is? Anyway, Popeyes. I'm not over here telling you Popeyes is like fucking good, but it's way better than Churches. <coughs> I think Churches and KFC are both garbage. Both Churches and KFC. No thanks. Counter I gotta be in big trouble Sam to eat that shit. <laughs> I'm in trouble. Then I'll eat it. KFC is bad now? Well, what do you mean by now? I mean, KFC was good like 25 years ago, but who dad this is? Yeah, we're talking about now, dude. Or are you from the future? What are you trying to say, man? How are you contributing to this conversation? It's bad now. <laughs> well, yeah. That's true. We are we are all currently here now. He's one of the original devs. Hey, are you a KFC dev? Shit changed like Blizzard? Damn, back in the day Blizzard was all right, but now look what it's become. I'm with you. KFC dev. Used to be about the herbs and spices. Oh, look at that damage. Jesus, the Thank damage, though. Jeez. So you're bringing it back. Oh, my God. I got to say, Katarina's rage drive is actually ridiculous. It does so much. The hang time on that elbow. <laughs> Macho man will be proud. All right. KFC is Asian? What does that even mean? Man, all the best Mexican places are owned by Koreans, and all the best Chinese places are owned by Mexicans. What's up with that? Which is real weird. At least around where I grew up. Yeah, California. Yeah, that's a California thing, I guess. And you know these Korean dudes that own these Mexican places are so fluent in Spanish? I was looking for them to do the need search for the county it's true. Fluent in Spanish, Korean dude. Hey, what's up, amigo? Fluent like me. Think about it. California Pizza Kitchen is like, uh... For me, it was always a place where, like, my family went. I never went there because I liked it. It seems like a boomer place, right? I feel like my relatives who are old like that shit. I think it's a boomer place. But good quality boomer place. As opposed to like Applebee's, which is a boomer place, but a poor quality boomer place. Yes, he did. He says, you got me to work with? I got me to work with too now. Like, CPK is it's for tourists? Maybe you're right. 
smaller yeah. stage on top Excuse of me. It's, it's just like that shitty ass PF Chang's, dude. Here we go, dragon. Have you ever been to P.F. Chang's? This is the most bullshit restaurant on fucking earth, dude. They just take Panda Express and put it on square plates and charge you like 25 bucks for it. General Tso, here you go. Square plate, amigo. The same Mexican dude made it, too. P.F. Chang's sucks, dude. And that's another place my relatives like to go for, like, before the pandemic. Oh, let's go to P.F. Chang's. Are you kidding me, dude? P.F. Chang's? That place sucks, dude. That place sucks. $25 for orange chicken on a square plate with a garnish. That place sucks. New York P.F. Chang's is good. Come on, man. How good could it be, dude? Orange chicken? How's it gonna be $25 worth? No matter how good it is, it's still fucking weak-ass orange chicken. You could get that shit next door. Three-item combo. Ten bucks, dude. Ten bucks all you can eat. Next door. Same chef. Oh, you. <laughs> hey, Possum, I chingu. Hey, thanks, Kim Huan and Corona user. Thanks, Sentish and Lozon. Is that enough? Nope. Here it comes. Oh, my God. <laughs> thanks, Magada. And thanks, Uno these Nuts. Yeah, I'm a big P.F. Chang's hater. That place sucks. I like Chinese food, but they're just, they're crazy. Their prices and the way they just put that shit on a plate and call it, like, fine dining. I don't know about that. I can't get behind that shit. Man, he is all over him. He's eating. Final round, game four. Loser semis, no me to work with. Go Crush has a full bar. And almost a two. Mamma mia. We hey, talking about chicken? Thanks, chicken Des nuts. Panda Express sucks too. Yeah, I agree, but it's that's not the point. Never said it was good. Sesame chicken greater than orange chicken. I don't really like either that much. Orange chicken's all right. Sesame's all right. I like Kung Pao. Let me get that shit hot, dude. I like Kung Pao. Or uh, sometimes some places have pepper chicken, spicy pepper chicken. I like spice. Staying alive. In the tech and online <laughs> or I like broccoli beef, dude. Broccoli beef is so good. I love broccoli beef. The way the broccoli gets so, like, tender inside that goo. How do they make the whole broccoli so completely through and through? It's like each one of the broccoli leaves on top where the hat is, is, like, completely holding all of this goo. So when you bite into it, there's like an explosion. Shit's good. I like Chinese food vegetables too, you know? The slimy, the slimy ones. Like the shit inside of an egg roll or like if you get vegetables, you know, they're like carrots and other things, but they're real soft and slimy. But that's one of the things that Joe Crush has. In general, do. broccoli is top four sauces. I love broccoli. Not the Chinese broccoli. Chinese broccoli, I'm out. American broccoli, USA. USA. I love that shit. I love it. But it gives me gas, though. So you can't be, you know, you got to be careful. I'll get gassy. 
American broccoli is so good. It retains all of the flavor. No, I don't like Benny Hanna. I hate Benny Hanna. Benny Hanna is such a fucking joke, dude. That guy. The guys that work there are always Mexican, too. I mean, which is not necessarily a problem, but it kind of defeats the whole fucking purpose, doesn't it? Who's going to be in the top three? For Joe Crush to be in here is a big deal, right? It is. It's a very big deal. Right? Game. It's huge, man. Man, Ben Chang's favorite food. Korean I mean, barbecue. think about it. I know, it right? Way to, way to rub it in, bro. <laughs> we need some. All right. I could work at fucking Benny Hanna. They don't even do cool-ass tricks. The last time I went there, the guy was like, he broke an egg. Like, whoa. Let me get back there. I'll show you how to do this shit, bitch. Fucking whatever his name is, Joaquin. Hey, what's up, Joaquin? Let's switch sides. I'll teach you how it's done. I feel you though. Maybe he can. At Benny Hanna. Nah, I don't fall for that shit, man. <clears throat> Dude, the fucked up thing is, you know, in Japan they do actually do that. Like, like you know how the whole point of Benny Hanna is the guy's supposed to be wowing a bunch of fucking boomers and shit, right? Like, look at this. I'm I could do these tricks. But in Japan, that's how they actually do it. Every day. It's not even like a gimmick. Thank you. Benny Hanna is emulating just normal shit in Japan. They all are like that. Super fucking perfect about everything. Even at McDonald's. There's like a perfectly placed... They put that shit out. They say, Gaishimas. And then they give it to you. It's perfect. Everything. It's tight. You guys really ought to get out, man. You can't just sit around and watch hentai all day, you know? You gotta visit other countries. It's not just all about, like, fucking Final Fantasy XIV, man. Damn, he switched. The Jack 7. Is that true? I thought he was a king player, man. I guess I'm thinking of the wrong guy. Joe Crush is not a king player. He's a Jack player. And I think that makes it down for two even stronger. The fact that, you know, Brian has to How much would a trip to Japan cost? Probably cheap these days. Japan is a lot less expensive than you might think. You can get a very uncomfortable and cramped and shitty hotel room for only a couple of bucks a night. And to be honest with you, even if you get a really expensive hotel room it's still gonna be cramped and shitty trust me i know i tried both kinds they're always cramped and shitty in japan so you might as well get the cheap one there's plenty of inexpensive hotels really close to the main tokyo circular thing you know okay Got an opportunity still. And you can't type shit like that in here, dude. That You'll get fucking there. lumped up. Filling up my chat room Jack. with a diary no, entry. I feel like that's just a counterplay. Joe Crush picks Jack. Anyway. No, not a capsule hotel, but dude, it's not far off. It's a small ass place. Space comes at a premium in Japan. But I do recommend you go. Very, very highly recommend you go. The first time I went to Japan, it was in 2010. And at that time, I wouldn't recommend just anyone go. Because at that time, they hadn't figured out how to speak English yet. So people were saying, oh, you're going to have to learn how to speak Japanese or whatever. But I stuck it out. And even though I've been there like six times, I never learned a word of Japanese. And it turned out that they gave up. It was an Armenian standoff. They gave up and they learned how to speak English. So now anyone could go to Japan. As long as you speak the universal language of math, which is English. Isn't it like they learned how to speak English. Even the robotic lady on the train systems will repeat the train stop in English now. She'll say like, you know, whatever, whatever, Takada no Baba. And then she'll say, the next stop is Takada no Baba. And then you'll be like, oh shit, that's my stop. Well, it makes sense. Still holy strong. We said That's actually a place, I think. I think it's really called Takadano Baba. Going to Joey Fury out there, but still playing sharp. Oh, man. The 
tippy toe. Pretty sure. I thought it was only me. <laughs> I'm bonding with you Big Bang here. Toes? I have to, bro. I'm short, man. My legs aren't that long. I gotta get the balance. I didn't even notice you're short based on this new camera. Yeah, well. <laughs> Iki Basura? Oh, it's not Iki Basura, it's Iki Bakuro. It in, bro. Okay. But that's a good one. <laughs> Alright, here we go. This is game number four or game number two, if I'm not mistaken. Mm, thanks, Halavari. And Wales, bro. Thanks, Fred from Canada. Jimmy, Emperor Jimmy. And Gigaton. Thanks, Melee Kunis. And Will, Will Dangle Tingle. And Chicken D's Nuts. Thanks. What was two throw? No break. Mm. Nice step. And look at the counter. It's coming out, man. Mr. Brian Fury. Everything I do is a counter. It's counter? I don't think so. Here's a low kick for you. Yeah, I look. My I dead pixel count, count is going up? Really? Where? <laughs> Where? I think I got one right yeah, here. Like right around here. And then I think I got one right around here somewhere. It's hard to see him. It's hard to see him in 720p. I really should upgrade so you could really see all the dead pixels. Oh, what an interrupt, bitch! Dude, he's like so crazy good right now. Bottom center of my cam? Here? Can't see it here. Yeah. I mean, but look, I really. This bitch ain't playing against Joey. He would have definitely won. I don't see it. Okay. Burns the meter. Oh, went for the this thing's oh fucking God. more than 10 years old, you know, get, get this camera. Getting a little bold with some of the decisions. Go I got it slide. in November of 2000 and... Should be it. Yeah, that's done, though. Yeah, he's done. Here we go. 10? Go on the board here, game two. Bill's got the meter. He's going to have maybe. a board by the end of this round. Maybe. Something like that. 11, maybe. Check him. Quick side step left there. Still good. Not falling for it again. Oh, counter. Huh? Okay. Oh, you. <laughs> the last hit. Wow, get out of the air. Oh, hey, thanks, Shaka Khan. That's nice of you. Thanks. Duck. Four, one plus two. Oh, oh you. Oh, my God. They're right. They haven't moved away from each other in like 10 seconds, bro. They didn't move right each other. Damn, it's going it's gonna hurt. Oh, damn. He's going all the way. Can we have your camera one day? Would you like some sausages? Kind. Uh-oh. Damn, nice. Thanks, uh, Kichua Tambo. And thanks... Uh, Tom Green. Thanks, uh, Smithsonian Museum. Thanks, guys. He's got no clutch. Come on, Joe Crush. Give it to him, man. He's got no clutch. Give it to him. There you go. Uh oh, that's bad news. Okay, here we go. Has a chance. The violin going ham right now. Life bar is close. But Joe's got the meter he needs. Activate. Does it get it? And he spent the meter. He interrupted. Hmm. This could be a problem. Oh. He oh what are you doing? What in oh, the. Big counter here. Oh my god. Rage both good. That was punishable, wasn't it? Oh. Minus Zero. at least 12. Lead for right? Man, I was scrambling at the end. But ben Jay, that it's off. minus 13 on block so that means he could have done while standing one and then uh, the whatever it's called and it's really right not easy, man. so he blew it hard he did a standing too that was a hard blow he blew it harder than that saxophone <laughs> <laughs> pasta for dinner Damn. all right Mm, thanks, Ben Deho. Enjoy your dinner. Sounds good. Uh, thanks. I'm gonna get pizza. I'm gonna get pizza with pesto drizzle on top. And two different kinds of mozzarella. I'm gonna get the, the sprinkled shredded and fresh globs. Two kinds of mozzarella. Not just one. Yeah, fresh globs. Uh, thanks, Shaitan. 
Delay cobbles are so sick. Thanks. I'm not gonna get any pepperoni. I'll get other stuff like hey, artichokes, diced Bye. tomatoes, um, and mushrooms and olives. No, I'm probably gonna get Blaze Pizza. I recently tried their large. It's hand tossed. It's pretty good. Yeah, these guys are getting crazy. That was an accidental jump, man. Joe Crush is getting fucked up now. You're rich. How big is this samurai here, bro? Nice game. Ben Chang's a beast. Moving on to the grand finals to face off against Joe GG's. Do they not? They shake hands? Man, I wouldn't. No way. Man, they shake hands, huh? Nope. Hell no. Shoulder bump? Maybe we can, like, do tippy toes. We can, like, touch tippy toes of our shoes from, like, downtown. Maybe. If that. Long range. Grand finals coming your way. It should be good. Booty bump. The thing about Ben Chang is that like we're used to seeing these crazy guys. The future of saying hello. What up, booty bump? So solid. So solid with his breath, and it really does throw people off. Yeah, that sounds pretty funny too. I guess. Until you least expect. Say hello. He knocks you down on the wall, and then he starts hitting. Elbows too close. Elbows not always. Elbows are right, I guess. Hey, you know, what up, Elbow? Really do add up and I guess. And a lot of but that's still pretty close. Like, as you mentioned, he doesn't really use the taunt. So you mm -hmm. kind of expect him not to be using it. And then all of a sudden he hits you and you're like, oh, he's got those too. I didn't expect that. Mm, uh, thanks, Trusty Panda. And CB300. Right? Byron Mains. That's a genuine typo. Someone was like, what are your thoughts on Byron? And then I ended up just talking shit about that idiot for like 30 minutes and then never letting go of that stupid mistake. Byron Mains, lol. And he never got his answer either. Man, I'm very excited to see what the next Harada Murray joint is. You know? What are these guys doing, dude? Hey, Michael Murray, what are you doing at work every day? Come on, man. Are you playing Final Fantasy XIV? What are you doing at work? He's doing something, man. You know they're doing something. And it's probably crazy. Whatever it is. It'll probably blow all our minds. Thank you. Watching JAV. But that's not, like... Maybe it's related to like maybe it's work related JAV. Even if he starts that way, Joey might start up with like bang or something. Well, with that being said, we gotta go to grand finals. Thanks, Corporal Quan. After this break, guys, you don't want to miss it. And if you don't want to miss work related from us down the line, make sure you follow B and E Esports on both Twitter and YouTube. They're doing something, man. They're probably hard at work. And Facebook. You know it's going to have slow-mo in it. There's no doubt. You know what I bet they're going to do? They're going to make slow-mo not only happen at the end of the round. They're going to make slow-mo happen like when two moves that do over fucking 30 points damage collide. They're just going to do slow-mo all day. Yeah, dude. That shit's going to be tight. No, nope, that's going to happen. Slow-mo all day. Not stop slow-mo. Watch Knives Out, bitch. <clears throat> Knives Out? I think I watched it. It was alright. I like movies like that. I was watching Pokemon, but now I am watching you all sh Hey, shut up, bitch. Oh, hey, what up, Michael Murray? Thanks, dude. Uh, anyway, listen here. It's break time, Pendejo. I think I'm gonna get up and do a quick stretch room. We're in the long end hall. Okay? So, hey, thanks, Michael Murray. That's not even the real guy. That's a faker. I'm just playing along with the script. That's a faker. Anyway, thanks. Thanks, watch you knives know, out, never bitch. Liked you, Rip. Booty bump. Hey, all right, I'm on break. Thanks very much. Uh, booty bump is a euphemism for using drugs rectally. I don't think that's true. Anyway, thanks, totes, not a junkie, and wapsama. 
I'm gonna get up and stretch. Talking to you guys makes me dumber every fucking time. You know I could have probably been some kind of scientist if it wasn't for you. But then I would have had to have had a job. Ugh. Anyway, thanks for liking my stream. I'm gonna be back in five minutes or whatever. Well, back in the second days, I thought that um, the average level of American player was not that great, but um, after the second seven, it, it's really, really com competitive even compared to other countries as well. I've been playing a lot of these like online NA tournaments and some offline NA tournaments, and what I've seen is like there's just so many high-level players now. Like I'm excited to see offline come back and see how they stack up against like Koreans, Pakistanis, Japanese, because I really do think we can beat some of them. I think we're pretty good now. The other, the other um, league leagues, they, the competition is a lot more fierce. You know, everyone's super good and they play each other a lot more often. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like Thank the you. level has come up since the pandemic. People just seem to be grinding more, playing more, with all these online competitions. These past couple years, I feel like NA has been really stepping their game up. So a lot of new coming players and a lot of overturning players and everyone is just getting better at the game. I think NA Tekken is interesting because the top players are really, really good and the overall scene is really, really weak. I used to be really hard on myself and be like, you know, you're having this like little short term success, but look at the grand scheme of like the world stage and you guys are really weak. Like I'm just getting by because people don't know knock this, this, you know. And it was kind of really negative self talk and I wasn't as much as it was good for, I think, improving, I didn't think it was good overall for like my well-being, for kind of like uplifting people around me. So uh, I try and keep it in the back of my head and just like there's a lot I can keep working on, but also kind of like appreciate how far we've come, you know, and like the steps being taken and enjoying the process more than kind of where we stack up long term. And the more I engage with that kind of positivity, the better I do. So it's kind of worth it, <laughs> I think. I think we beat everybody. Everybody. <laughs> um, we've been playing. Everyone's getting stronger here from literally the East Coast, West Coast, South and Midwest. Everyone's strong. We just need to just play them. I think we can beat anybody and everybody. Welcome back to the Tekken Online Challenge 2021 Regional Finals for North America. Rip and Tasty Steve here. We've had a great day mm. of Tekken 7 action, but it's time to get down to the Grand Finals. That is Poof, they need to get that saxophone guy back. Is where Forget all down. the interviews. Have one saxophone guy all Let's day. To the first of the potential said champions. First and foremost, all the interviews gotta go. Other than ben Chang. Oh, here come the intros. <laughs> Thank you. Get sprayed. The swaggy, swaggy winner, Jack swaggy? Really is that new? I got an urban dictionary that. Again, He's mad swaggy. <laughs> Thank you. Very, very shortly. And I want to know what character he's going to use. But Ben Chang looking really strong coming here to the Happy NA Big Final Friday. Online challenge. One of the Who am I rooting for? NA, obviously, you can see it here. Mm, I think I like probably Ben Chang, but I don't like um, Fuckmore. I don't like his Fuckmore. That shit's mad boring. And he always like leans on that character. You know? It's like you didn't really beat Ben Chang until you beat Fuck Mark. So I think I'm gonna go Joey Fury. Cause I mean, all his characters are pretty fun to watch, and he's good. Smoking hot, I might say. What about you? I'm doing great, thankfully. Happy to be alive. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Judge Ooze and Zing Dangling and Katsu, whatever and Godloader, Totes. Thanks, bros. And the back and forth between these two players has been quite the year in all honesty. This is why I love the way that this is actually falling out because there's so many different matchups that we've seen evolve over the years. <laughs> Thank you. And now it's come to a head. Thanks, Randy Animal Rice Fries. One of these two players to be your NA champ. And you know the characters we've seen on Ben Chang have been wild. We saw the Lars. All right. The Damn, it's mad the smoky in there. The Cheech and Chong. Now will we see something different from Ben Chang? Does he feel Look how smoky it is? Back to those same characters. We're about to find out, man. It's gonna be good. Well, I would love to see one more time the tale of the tape. What got us here to this uh -huh. Tekken Online Challenge NA Finals? Ben Chang and Joey Fury are your last competitors. Let's look at this bracket one last time, just so you guys can get a, a feel for what we went through. The story 
so far. Exactly. Of course, we started the day with the group stages. Who Could I have a luck buff for an interview? Yeah, sure thing. Joey Fury. I'll do my part. You do yours. Good luck. From that group into this bracket here. Joey on the winner side, of course. And then Bin Chang and Junior were the ones that came out of Group B. You see them all in the bracket here. Joey took out Bin Chang Yeah, earlier. I got Joey Fury. Fury. You know, it was Marduk the whole way through. Down and loser side of things. Joe Crush took out Junior. How many bananas? Right now. Brian Ten Fury. bananas on Joey Fury. Joe final. How many and rip bucks? What are they called again? Yeah, Boom bucks? Damn, dude. Right there, my is man, Joey Fury 6'6 six, six on Grinder just like Rip? Probably why fighting games in intellect is so high. Yeah, um, he just likes giving beats to people. He's like giving beats, <laughs> beating people up. That's what it is. I like what? what? <laughs> I said beating people he's up. Six, so nine. That's what he likes to do. <laughs> Jesus. Um, but of course, Ben Damn. Chang. Ben Chang. Chang. Side, fifth range, fifth <laughs> in the Thank you. Ranking, of course, Thanks, Fusion. Forty points to close out the season. I really do love the fact that we started huh? track. Uh, <laughs> what's happening on the the tail end huh? of the Tekken Online Challenge. Not the tail end, it was the entire season, of course. But I, of course. I love seeing... Yeah, he's got no respect for any player. We've been on the front he's end such a G, a dude. Right? Course, he's got about as much respect as he does clutch. The Astro, the official headset mm -hmm. and mix amp of the Tekken Online Challenge 2021. As we get ready to kick things off between... This Bitcoin is it. ...and Joey Fury. They are loading up right now. Here we go. It's time for the Grand Finals. Damn it. He picked Fuckmar. Ah, definitely going for um, <laughs> yeah, Joey Fury, you. that's for sure. So I feel like it's really going to be a match where you really have to stop Joey from getting his game started because Fuckamar, I feel like at this point from against Joey, he's going to find a way to stop it. Why not Brian? <laughs> Why not Brian? Even Rip is complaining. Man, when the commentators can't pretend like they like the character, that's how you know you got a problem. Why not Brian, dude? Think about it, man. The character is boring as fuck. <laughs> Thank you. No one wants to see this shit. At least you know who to root for. Nice. Catches him ducking, just raw down back to. First round of Joey here in the grand finals. First to three here. Maybe some of you guys actually like the character, but I don't know. To me, it's a bland character. And it's ugly to look at because of this outfit. Uh-uh, too far. If that was a back one, we could have saw something different. Exactly. And the perfect right now. Yo, Joey. Should have been Bruce. Cheers from Italy. Hey, Bongiorno, man. I like Italian. Big fan. I would go there if, you know. You know. But I would go there. But not enough damage. Oh my god. Oh damn, I didn't know it was gonna get hit by all that shit though. Fucking ground throw into Wake Us. Damn Joey Fury. Look at all the fingerprints on this shit, dude. Somebody put their nutsack on the front of this. And I think it was me. My bad. That was me. And the not working out so far. Did you My bad. Brian Fury. Thank you. But this is what I was talking about. It's this is this matchup becomes Congrats. significantly harder when you put in the to the fact that Joey Fury played this character at length. Mm, thanks, Ham Beastie as, and as Dirty as Dan. Boris. Like thanks, Fusion. What's with the green camera? Hey, what's up, new guy? Sorry, we're full, man. I guess somehow someone left the door open and you thought maybe we were looking for some new fans, but it's an honest mistake. Wow! Did this guy just do a straight up open face club sandwich? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, okay. Oh, down back two. Getting a little free against the wall. Joy Drew doesn't want to play. Damn, the frames. We're effing. Hey, Billy Hoyle, thanks for gifting more subs, my man. Those are not my Fs. You can't pin those on me. That's them. Uh, thanks, X Pac. Thanks, Billy Hoyle and the Twan. Thanks, Fuckmar versus Merdoink and Hambeastie. And thanks, Cross Contour. 
can get the wall of play correctly. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. 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 <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Thank you. Man, Duck's got some small feet and whopper hands and a whopper hey, head. Hey, what are you looking at? <laughs> Sorry, I left the door open when I went to get pizza. I'll shut it next time, Arnest. Hey, I could think of something else you could shut next time. Uh, anyway, thanks very much, Desi. Appreciate you very much. Uh, and thanks, Space Jam on VHS. Wow. Appreciate you. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, thanks, no flocks given. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Desi. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thanks, Desi. Oh! Wow, that was awesome. That was awesome. That slide was like hitting. That was a very nice low parry. Joey Fury. Hey, Desi, thanks for the gifted subs and the donation. Appreciate it. Nice low parry again. Joey, huh? Okay, this is the last hit. That's a Quick sidestep. We saw the jet upper last Huh? Nice the wall. I mean, what are you he doing? He missed it. it. He wanted a mock punch. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Whoa. Damn, man. He got lucky. Ben Chang missed the taunt. That would have been bad news. With the wall to his back like that? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, counter hit. This could kill. This should kill. Uh. 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 Ooh, man, that could have gone crazy at the end. That could have gone crazy, but Ben Chang put an end to that shit. Mm, thanks, Chris Notes and Lil Red. And thanks, Julius. And thanks again, Desi. Yeah, he's bringing out the clutch. It's what he's known for. Good for both of them. More space to work with. You yeah, know what's really fucked up if you think about it? Like, we're just a bunch of assholes, right? And all we're doing is making stupid jokes, right? Lol, no no clutch, Bin Chang, lol. But poor Bin Chang has to live with this fucking nickname that we just made up for no reason just to talk shit, have something to talk about during small talk. Bin Chang has to live with that shit. Because even people that like him, they root for him as no clutch having ass Bin having ass Chang. You know? Yeah, tough luck. That's what I think, too. But you know, still, that's pretty cool, though, because people love nicknames. So you know, ever since he got that nickname, he got more fans. Hey, you're that guy, right? You're that no clutch having guy. Good shit. He's good, man. He's world class. Hey, what are you looking at? That's Thanks, the whole man. point. The whole point of the no clutch joke is the stupid online commentators. <laughs> and the chat. The chat room in online tournaments. Fucking, that's the whole point of the joke. Nice block on the low. Oh, they're awake right now. Likely still in favor of Joy Fury, though. What the? World class choke artist. Whoa. Oh my god, what a jump! What a jump! <clears throat> How does this uh, grand finals work? Oh, it says right there W and L, so Ben having ass Chang has to get a reset. So Joey's in the advantage. Big time. Wow, and he is playing like it. Come on, what are these Fs? What? Boo! What are these Fs? They don't pay the electric bill? <laughs> God. <laughs> Man, talking shit is fucking tight. <laughs> Thank you. It just tastes good. Okay. Gonna 
Hey, Hanzo Gonzo, what's the problem, man? You don't pay the bills up there? Come on, man. Final round, important round. Take the lead in the set. Dude, these are some crazy <laughs> Fs, though. Thank you. They're not mine. Don't put those Fs in my ass. Hell no. Those are yours. Where's Waldo? Come on, Joey. Make the magic happen now. No, oh, wow, good block. Come on. Okay, nice hit come from oh, fuck. Oh, he missed it. Oh my god. He didn't guess it. They both have rage. Oh wow, dude, Bin Chang. I mean, did you see what this guy did? He got up and did that 14 frame. Is it 14 or 13 that mid elbow punch? Dude, he got up and did that shit on wake ups. 13. Wow. That was clutch, which is what he's known for. Ben Chang. He's world class, you know. When I met him, he was a real Korean. Now he's a formerly Korean and he lives in Seattle. But when I met him, he was a real Korean. He came here from Korea. He was authentic. Like, he didn't speak English or nothing. You know, authentic Korean. He's still authentic? All right, buddy. Come on, man. He's fluent in English. He lives in Seattle. Probably a stoner. Yeah, real authentic. But ceremonial fucking, uh, you know, traditional Korean. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure. And Joey definitely mixing up his offensive options right now. There it is. Another down back two. Ceremonial. <laughs> Hey, thanks, Tekken on the radio, and Jigsy, thanks, Stinky, and have an ass, Ben Chang, and Chris Notes, and thanks, Belly Bo. Appreciate you guys. They've all been correct for the most part, right? The downboard one call out was very jack like. This time doesn't work out, but the down back twos, bro. Jesus. Man, Ben Chang missed so many fucking taunts. Dude, I feel like at this point, the match would have been completely different if he had hit half of those. Man, he missed a lot of taunts. That's what happens when you play too many characters. That's really the lamest thing about Tekken 7. That, I mean, I don't know, some people say it's Nii's fault, but Tekken 7, people just play so many characters that it's just the tendency of mistakes happening is higher because people play too many characters. Oh, well. While he's playing Marta, mm -hmm. no matter how you slice it, you don't want that. And that position was so dangerous, right? Marta you think it's because of Nii? He did popularize it. And look, we got a First, at least. The old main here. And we're going to the arena he switched the out of game. Brian. Byron. Final game of set one. Mm -hmm. Of grand finals. Here we go. Claudio versus Marduk. Tackle denied. Still doing a really good job of breaking these tackles. One of the main defensive things you got to look out for. Speaking of, hop kick this time to clean beat it. Big damage. This game will secure a reset for Ben Chang, but he's got to get the W. Yeah, he has to win. So he put his whole life on Claudio in this ridiculous outfit. Can't believe that. Above the knee shorts, not a single button is buttoned up on his shirt. He's just going to go into the fight with no button check, huh? Oh my God, dude. This costume sucks. But he gets the first round anyway. I guess now that I've seen this one, I think uh, I like Marduk. Marduk's is better. The pimp one? 
At least he's a pimp. Claudio ain't like no pimp. Right now, just slowing it down just a little bit. Trying to get Joy Fury to swing in some of these situations. He's not taking the bait though. Man, they're running through the so fast right now. They're instant from Benjang. Keeping up the pokes. Joy Fury having a hard time getting set to try to start it off. Oh, Ooh. Kick again. Okay, Superman punch finds his mark. You're giving I got the boost up. up. Oh. Oh. Not much damage, he'll take that. Looking for the power crush, try to bait. Oh, oh. man. Joey Fury is fucking blowing it. He's blowing it. Oh my god, dude. Commentators lost their minds. Posado. There you go. But that's oh my. Are you trying to give me hot bun? Why are you dropping every fucking combo? There you go. Okay, he can bring it back. He was a good man, feel scared man. What you need though sometimes. Hey, thanks. Uh, <laughs> whatever. And Mango Bruh. And Belly Bow. And Knee. Knee. Whatever. Thanks very much. How many is it going to hit? I mean, it's what you expect from Claudia, but we haven't seen it like this in such a long time, I feel like. Well, conversion. He didn't die, did he? No. 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 He did? No rage, like when? Music, but he's got rage curse here. Oh, fake out. Thought he was going for the tag. 20 minutes ago? Of what? Yo, bitch. Two games with the Brian, one with the Claudio, and we got a reset. Ligma? Damn, man, that sucks. He was tight. When I was a kid, he was the shit, dude. Found dead in his hotel while on tour. Whoa. Right, here we go. Maybe it's, uh, Fontenelle? <laughs> Maybe he was the type. Don't do it. All right, here we go. Obviously sticking with the Claudio. This is reset. Only 65. I mean, that's not young, but that's not old. Shadow, what do you think about those hot quicks? Quick, yes, yes, thumbs up. And remember Funniest Home Videos? Okay. He's gonna walk off that shit was Good tight. Old that was like YouTube before the internet. America's funniest home videos. That shit was fucking funny, dude. It was basically people fucking up and falling over and dogs doing cute shit and stuff. But before, like, they had VHS. It was cool. A laundry list of characters that go through for Ben Chang. Bummer. Bob Saget passed away. Uh, of America's Funniest Home Videos and also Full House. I liked both those things when I was a kid. May Lord Umbasa rest his soul. That guy liked to party though, right? I'm pretty sure that guy is notorious for being a drug, habitual drug user. So that's pretty good if you consider that. Dude, we, we, we didn't even get to see that combo. And look at that Vintex of the frames. And he's got the first round. He's got the lead in the set right now. Counter F's all day. To the wall. Trooper roll. This is nuts. Okay. Uh oh. Joey Fury trying to get back started up. Joey hit a delayed Hopkins with rage and the rage drive mix and got all that damage. Still lost the round. Okay. Let's yeah, that guy was sick. Damn, a lot of people have been uh, kicking the basket lately. John Madden, too. Betty White. But most of these are pretty old people, which is cool. I mean, it's not cool, but it's not as sad to me. You know, it's always way more sad when a young person dies tragically, as opposed to when like an elderly person who lived an amazing life and is like a like a storied hero. You know, when that happens, it's almost like cool. You know, like good shit, man. Let me get one of those. Doesn't feel it like a tragic death. Ben Chang is pushing. We're seeing a tragic death right now. Joey Fury's getting fucked up. You better wake up, man. You gonna let this guy beat you with no clutch? Uh huh. Going for the Oki once again. Tackle setup? No. 
always ready for it. Just imagine if he commits to a high kick on some of these punches. Right. And we did see the switch up coming from Joey Fury. To go I mean, yeah, 65 is young, but is it, dude? I don't know. I think that you, the life expectancy for a man in the U.S. is like 70, right? And he was into coke. He kicked the cameraman. Think about it, man. 70, and he was into coke? Who isn't? What, into coke? <laughs> Me. I've never even tried it, dude. That shit... I've been around people that tried it. I remember. Yeah, I've been around people that tried it. And those same people owe me 500 bucks. <laughs> Fucking bitch. Now that I think about it. Fuck. Uh, thanks, Betty White can always get it. And Obelis. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, uh, thank thanks, you. Matt420. We're going down the roster, baby. <laughs> He's got a checklist of characters. He's gonna get a call from his mom. <laughs> ben Chang like started sweating. It's like Lars again. Ben Chang, don't forget about the Lars. You're right, mom. The Lars. Oh yeah, the one, 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 one. Ben Chang, baby, don't forget about. No, the I never Lars. tried it. It yeah, doesn't right, sound right. like my type of thing. Nah. Jesus. Does Carrie wasn't where you go. I need a nah. table for two. And, and this car. <laughs> oh, that could have been ridiculous. Yeah. Paul! That could have been <laughs> Thank you. Mm, thanks, Resign. And thanks, Ben Automatic Driving Ass Chang. And Matt420. So many characters contributing to this reset. Oh! Mm -hmm. Reset and gonna get another wall combo. Oh no. Oh god. Now Bardic got rage. If Ben Chang could tell me that he ain't gonna pick Fuckmar, then I would root for Ben Chang. But I can't stand that, like, you know, alright, push comes to shove, let me pick Fuckmar and beat this guy's ass to death easily. You know what I mean? That shit's lame. Damn! Under the high. Damn, Joey Fury is uh not looking so hot right now. Right this second. These are the small details you miss when you see online Come on. Hanzo Gonzo. Joey's looking mighty flat footed, Steve. Flat footed individual, I can tell. Hell sweet. Lots of back and forth here. No walls in the second part of the stage. Goes for the low. Two throw, no. Mm, going for the low pull. Damn! That was a reversal on a down forward one. That's a punch only reversal. That was cool. I like that. That was nice. That's a punch only reversal. What a jump. Get the full launch here. Mm, boy, he's gonna run in. Damn, big whiff. That could have been an arc blast. Maybe it was an arc blast and he didn't do it right. He got one, two, right? God, dude. Damn, that's not good. We might be going all the way. I think we're going all the way. This was a nice treat. Thank you. Uh, thanks, No Pants, for letting me know about it. I didn't even know about this. Randomly, he was like, hey, check this shit out. It's offline, even though it says online. Say, word? I didn't know about that. Let me check it out. <laughs> Thank you. Mm, thanks, it's x -Gen. And November's fire and Shinta and resign. Thanks, bros. Nope. I wouldn't be surprised at this point. I don't think he's been playing that much lately. But he still remembers Lars and Brian, Claudio. He's played those ones plenty. Mm. Dynamic entries going for the lows this time. Down four. The thing is, I think the Joey Fury's catching on is just the fact that Ben Chang really likes to retaliate with lows. And those low parries are really starting to add up. This time actually doesn't go for it, gets the punish. Ben Chang is a 
amazing and how he can just switch characters. That's not safe. Oh my god. He's just attacking until the moment he lost a turn and then lightning screwed him. Did you see that? The moment he lost his turn, he just had a lightning screw ready. I want to turn every time. Damn. The down forward. That's something he had done multiple times with multiple characters, but now finally the launch is coming out for the down forward block. Oh, oh. Ben wow. Chang. Right now, Ben Chang looks like he's taking a fat shit in that hat of Marduk's. A big one. Okay, Joey's fighting back. The final stand? Uh-oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. The final stand. And not enough cash. All right. It still wouldn't matter, but here we go. Still set point, game point for Ben Chang to take lead two to one here. Wow! And the whiff punish. No, but he reeled back in the chair. I don't think he meant to do that up forward either. He wanted orbital. That took a shitload of damage, dude. That took a shitload. Going for the mid out of dynamic. Tackle still not working. I would love to know the success rate for Joy Fury versus. Mm, it's close. It's gonna be a close one. I think he's only got hit by the rage rappers, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, Throw break. Position. Still the wall. Ooh, that's not safe. Oh my god, he's dead. Damn, dude. Now Ben Chang is one game away. Excuse me. If he can win this match, I hope that what doesn't happen. Is that exactly what's going to happen? This is crazy. Wow, I can't tell what the match I have a feeling what's gonna happen is Joey Fury's gonna win, and then Ben Chang's gonna switch to Fuck Mar, and then he's gonna win with Fuck Mar. I think that's what's gonna happen. And I hope it doesn't. Joey Fury's gonna win a game. Ben Chang's gonna be like, alright, I had enough fuck Marin around. Let me pick the real shit. And then that's how it's gonna end. Damn it. We'll see though. Still has one more game, right? So Joy Fury needs his game. If we're gonna see anything past this, Joy Fury has to win. Here we go. Punish is good. Joy whipping stars around, and now the mid mix out of that dynamic entry. Yeah. I love, I, I love how Joey is switching it up and getting more and more mental, committing to these lows, really throwing Ben Chang off the trail. Wow, dude, out of nowhere? What the fuck? Just like intercepted with the arc blast? Holy shit! Okay, he's got no health left. Uh, oh my gosh, that was gonna be crazy if it worked. It could have worked. High risk, though. That was high risk. Yeah, Ben Chang's two rounds away. Coming out of loser's bracket to win. That's hard to do, you know. Holy shit, big damage. Joey Fury's getting owned, dude. And it's not even uh, Falkmar. He's doing it with Lars, dude. Lars? Lars? You don't see that every day. Hey, nice Lars, Ben Chang. <laughs> Thank you. Dude, he's getting clobbered. Oh my god, Joey Fury is in big trouble. He's dead. He's dead. Wow. Ass beat down. They're blowing him with fucking fire extinguishers. Put him out. He doesn't respect any fucking players. He doesn't respect any players, dude. That's been no clutch having Chang right there. Don't forget it. Formerly Korean. 
Obviously, it was all data. My Damn, one love. He was taking notes. He gave us the one love to all us Ben Chan you know, fans. I've never liked you, Rip. One love. Never forget South Korea. <laughs> hey, thanks very much, uh, Agent <laughs> Chieftain, and always pickled. It's X Gen. Thanks. Good shit, Ben Chang. He's a beast. Thank you. Oh my goodness, Ben Chang. What a monster. You know. God. He's got no clutch. This guy got the reputation of having no clutch just because of online. Sure, I helped a little bit, but it was mostly because of online. Nice reputation. Thanks, avoiding the clutch and skadangle. Thanks, bros. Hey, good shit to these guys, right? Tano, Rip, Steve, Mark, man, Hanzo, Gonzo, the whole gang, dude. Think about it, man. They had to wear fucking masks all day just for us to have something to make fun of for the last five hours. Think about that. I would have been miserable. I would have been miserable. Wearing that shit all day long, talking to fucking Rip. And that's what's really gonna Jesus. do Chang, your Tekken, The saxophone the guy was amazing. Champion. Huge shout out to the With saxophone the guy. That guy yeah, is really good. I told him earlier, but we weren't even being nice. You guys know the chat room is full of shit. They hate everything. They don't like anything. And everyone agreed he was good. That was awesome. Nice job, saxophone guy. We like you, and we are not nice to anybody. Congratulations. Think about it. Thank you. Damn, man. Bin Chang's life preserver makes him look like Markman level. Right, give it up for Bin Chang. Our Woo! And of course, he also gets the good job, hat. Bin Chang. Damn, three thousand bucks! You guys told me it was gonna get a fifty dollar okay, gift so card. What? Now, Bin Chang. You guys are full of shit. I thought that was sick too. How do you feel now that you've won the tournament? Three thousand bucks? That's like half of Evo, or more than half of Evo. Can't hear anything he's saying. Thank you, everyone who participated in this tournament. And, um, every commentators and organizers, organizers as well. Yeah. All right. It's been a, obviously a very long year. Of Woo! Online, good was, shit. You, uh, Ben Chang. I mean, it's a hard time, but, you know, we can still get together in the online. And um, I appreciate that. Um, so we'll keep going, everyone. All right, guys. Keep fighting. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. We are going to set you guys free. But of course, before we do that, we're going to go do the smooth stylings of Mr. Patrick Bartley. Oh, damn, another one? Ensemble. We're going to have him on stage with another rendition of one of our famous Tekken tracks. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. He's going to, like, uh, send us home. Look at that big-ass check. Sweet. Congrats, Ben Chang. He's looking at all the fingerprints on his trophy. Man, what the fuck? They couldn't have polished this shit a little bit before I won it? Woo! Three K is pretty good, man. I was hype about a fifty dollar gift card. Three K is not bad, dude. How much did the fucking North American Regional Championship of fucking Melty Blood get? Hmm? Let me know. Uh, thanks, Eves is online. And Drunk Penguin. Oh, damn. He's good.
This is the announcement? <laughs> Someone in the other chat said this is the announcement. Damn, that's more hype than any announcement I've seen lately. This guy's good. Woo, that was some amazing freaking Tekken. Woo, come on, y'all. Woo! It's the weekend, baby. That brought me here. I want to thank you all you know so what I mean? very much for watching and for having me. I'm going to bring it up one last time for y'all. Let's go. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Cut that bitch out. Damn. Next call. Thanks, play the cello. I don't play the cello, man. I'm a poser. How many times do I gotta tell you? It works. I just have a cello. Put it in the corner. Talk about how I, you know, I used to dabble a little bit. I don't know how to play the fucking cello, man. I also have an electric keyboard. You know, like a... What do you call that? Like a, like a keyboard? Like an electric piano? I have an electric piano. But... And it's plugged into the wall. But it, the plug that it's plugged into doesn't even have electricity. It's all just the front, dude. Oh, yeah. You know, I got, like, notes up. Like I could read music, you know? Yeah, I just like to unwind sometimes, you know? Yeah, just every now and then. <laughs> you know what Thank I mean, you. dude? Shit works like a charm. Thank y'all so much. Once again. She's a pretty girl. For Fell been. for it. Suck it. To everybody here, to Band Dynamco, to all the players, all the commentators, thank you so much for making this happen. Let's bring it up one last time. Come on. Come on. He's really talented. I wonder if he does that shit for like a living. Probably, right? I, can, I can't imagine this guy not being a professional musician. He must. Saxman for season five. Hey, thank damn that would be sick. <laughs> that would be tight. New character. Uh, thanks, Saxamophone and Dragon Stop. Play the cello. Talk a strawberry. Thanks, Delta and Eves and Drunk Penguin. Standing ovation. Nice, nice job, Sax man. People want you to be a DLC character. Yeah, that was pretty cool. He's good. That guy's good. I'd way rather fucking listen to that guy all day than listen to Rip and Tasty Steve make small talk about tech and lore. Nah. Yeah, standing ovation. That guy was good. Thanks. He is sick. Does Marvel music too? Yeah. I he streams too, yeah. He's out there. I saw him on Twitter. My friend, shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. I like how he sucked that sax. <laughs> you don't suck on it, you dumbass. <laughs> you blow. Uh, thanks, sax man. <laughs> thanks. I'll give it up. Thanks, Halo. Uh, appreciate you. <laughs> I never heard anyone say that. Hey, that was pretty good. Nice finishing, uh, finishing blow. Mm, you got me. Uh, chat room, listen here. You know what time it is. This pizza ain't gonna order itself. I can't <laughs> wait. Two <laughs> kinds of mozzarella. Thank you. Uh, thanks, Steadiest Shark. Hey, that was really sick. Thanks, No Pants, for letting me know about this shit. And thanks the rest of you for joining me. Because, you know, as fun as it was, it would have been way worse without you. That's for sure. I mean, just me by myself making fun of Ben Chang and how he has no clutch. Look at him. <laughs> he won. That's so tight that he won. Hey, congrats, Ben Chang. And good job sucking on that saxophone, saxophone guy. 
And good job sucking on that keyboard, participating in the chat room. Chat room. Anyway, thanks very much for joining me and liking my stream. I'll see you guys in the sewer. Mm, tomorrow. Tenchu, part one. Unless I change my mind. Take it easy, everybody. Thanks again. See ya.